and the clock strikes zero on check-ins. Hello there, everybody. It is a pleasure to have you all here today for something a little bit more experimental. A little bit less about the glory and a little bit more about praying at the altar of Damien Keekin. We require data on the good old-fashioned uh, testing grounds here, so why not do a tournament for it, considering it is mainly focused on an element of the game that is mainly reserved for competitive. Verbalosti here being on the production and the ones and twos to bring you the tournament, but alongside me I have two people who actually can explain the bloody concept for today. Alongside me I've got both Norgoz and Freeze. How are you two doing? Great to be here, Ferb. I'm feeling pretty good. How about yourself? I'm rather excited for this, personally, Norgoz, considering we're going into a testing grounds that's fiddling a bit with the deep arcana of the game, the third hit stun rule and ganking resets. However, Freeze, if you want to give us a bit <laughs> of an overview of what the structure of today's tournament is going to be, because there is going to be a little bit of, sh uh, not shenanigans, but some wrenches thrown in the works. Yeah, yeah. First of all, hello, everybody. I think I don't need to go over the Swiss bracket. We've done that in the past mm. plenty, but the special rules today are here that we have only a handful of characters that can be selected because the testing grounds aren't featured on all on all, the whole roster. We have a few characters that they picked out and the changes only apply to them. So, and the characters that you will see today and only those because none of the others are pickable. But let's go down the list. The first is Warden, and we have Conqueror, Yormunganda, Jugoki, Hitukiri, Shinobi, Jongjun, Jonhu, Pirate, and Ocelotl. Those are all the characters you will see today. None of the others. Now, as a fun little aside, do expect inevitable delays in getting the game set up because, fortunately, we are able to actually do custom games uh, for the TG. However, it seems like there's been a little bit of a wrench thrown in, in that every character is selectable in custom games versus matchmaking, you only play the relevant characters. So, someone get your Fs out preemptively for the admins today. However, yeah. Goz, Freeze, for those of you, uh, while the brackets are being arranged, unless they're actually already up now, let me quickly peruse them. Survey says, still being made, so we've got a little bit of time. Mm. If you two would like to expl uh, give a very quick overview as to, like, what's actually being messed with and what are we looking out for today? Like, why is this tournament happening? Sure, we can do that. The main thing is how Hitstone works. If anybody of you has watched a tournament before or played at the higher levels of matchmaking and you've been ganked properly, then you know there's very little you can do just because there's a chain of attacks that keep you in a Hitstone throughout the whole thing and you just die. And mostly what's been used there, or what was what, what was used, are hit stun resets. Things like Pirate Gunshot, for example. Hmm. That will reset hit stun. But that's not the case today in those testing rounds. And that is a huge thing, because ganks are now very much limited to a specific timing in between two attacks. It's not as easy to chain everything anymore and reset and reset and reset. No, now you need to hit very specific timings of where the target cannot defend anymore. And we can go over that. Maybe it's a little complicated. I think we should first discuss hit stun. Do you want to uh, explain that in August? Uh, actually, just before cutting in here real quick, we have actual brackets here or for the Swiss. We do? It's going to be four rounds. It looks like we have ended up being a nine-team participant. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. No, it was eleven. Nice. So yeah, a few more signed up. Yeah, Goz, what are we thinking for the first game here? Unless admins intervene, who do we want to watch? Uh, let's see. Bracket update. Let's see, Greenhorns are on a buy. We've got Goblin Gang up against the. People are asking the who's on team... hot spot. Yeah. A hot spot. Hang on. Someone's saying Barrett's just... on a hot spot. You're, you're no, capping. no, just to explain, hot spot gaming used to be Barakid's like yes. main team before yeah. he joined UDA, before he like teamed up ago. with Clutch. But that was what, five years board. ago or something. But that used to be a team that was very much able to compete for the first 
place when they were showing up in top form. Mm -hmm. So that name is a little bit of a throwback. That's why everybody in chat is excited. Ah. Sadly, the team members here are, not, are none of the former ones. All right. Uh, admin, if you're listening, just a clarification. How long is each round going to be for today? Uh, I'm just going to stick a 60-minute clock just for the sake of having something there. But yeah, first round is began. We should actually find a game. Uh, let's see here. Oh, yes. Nemesis is not present today. That is a the thing. They are taking a break from this tournament, it seems. He's got Goblin Gang, Pink Underwear Revenge. What is that name? One hour, 50 minutes. Thank you. So... <laughs> Uh, that would be... I wasn't going to say them out loud. That's why That's why I kind of stopped. Mate, like, yeah, no, this, in this no. community, I have become numb to names, even though they still anger me to this day. It's like, I, I am going to run face first into those names, Goz, as a point of fucking pride. Pardon my French. There you go. Let's see. Mostly Machine, Miasma Deep Purple. Let's let's find a game that'll be relatively easy to get a... Uh, uh, to get a game in immediately. Let's go with... It's... Yeah, the last one you hover and over, you're gonna have Kino. Uh, sorry, Frozen Reapers and is that, uh, Frozen Reapers? What am I doing here? Yeah, you you have Kino in your friend list, I assume. Oh yeah, so... most likely. Uh, da -da 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 -da. what am I doing here? What is that deep fried picture? Holy shit! Uh, let me get them entered into my scoreboard program. Jolly good. All right, let's pull the game up. Uh, OBS, hello. Please, please recognize the video game. Why, why you do this? OBS, please. One moment. Apparently, it, my OBS has decided to just forget the existence of For Honor. Come on, For Honor. It's it's literally right there. Come on. While you're getting that pulled Thank up, you. we yes. can. We can jump back to the the hitstone rules and whatnot essentially in a very brief uh concise explanation for those of you who are not familiar with it the hitstone rulings are effectively uh once you get hit with a an ability or an attack or once you're in the first you hit hit second you're in second hit stun and then third you're in the or rather there's a bit there's different terminology so you get hit by the hit by three attacks you're in effectively what for some would refer to as the third hit stun rule and this for all intents and purposes referred to as the second so that's what we're testing out today, and ultimately you have damage reduction and have super armor during that, uh, or hyper armor during that uh, that that additional phase. So you want we're basically testing whether or not that can be, the timing can be more precise, shortened, and the hit stuns can be more consistent. And a lot of the abilities that are would normally reset hit stun have been removed. So yeah, exactly, like hit stun values carry over. For example, if you get hit and then you get hocked by Shigoki, for example. Um, usually that would reset, right? If you attack mm. the guy again, he would take full damage. Now, during the whole hog, it would still pin him and everything, but if you damage him then, the previous hit stun damage reduction carries over to that. So, ganking just became a lot harder just because the damage reduction will always be present now. There's no resetting it. I believe the window for second hit stun... It's a 100 millisecond window for, I think, transitioning into second hit stun. Is that what it is? I, believe it's a, I know it's a 100 millisecond window now for, for getting the final damage in for a longer gank. Hmm. Oh, for that? You As mean, no, no, no. It still carries completely over. Or maybe I'm misunderstanding you here. I, I'm trying to remember the, the how how JC went over it. There's supposed to be like a hundred millisecond window where you're when you're transitioning into like sec the the second oh. hit sun ruling where you can get the final hit in before you actually have that activated. So it's a so it, it, the intent so, was supposed to be where we have very precise timing on the games. <laughs> interesting fact here. Uh, I loaded in to actually spectate Kinu because I assumed the game was going. He's in a he's in a two v two right now, on the ring. Hmm. So we have a little bit of time, it seems, while I figure out why OBS is deciding to not capture For Honor. Why you do this. It is... Oh, oh, hello, Spaniard. How you doing? I just heard what Goz was, was saying, and my... Uh, my, my misinformation... The oh, no. Alarms were going oh, no. Off. oh, no. Oh, uh, no. No. It's all right. So basically, the, the, the way to do ganks that are full damage relies on hitting windows that are essentially after hit stun ends, ends but before yeah. you can defend properly 
So, so yeah, the so hundred yeah. milliseconds. The, yeah, Sorry, freeze and explain the best. Yeah. 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 Okay, so yeah. the hundred milliseconds. Yeah, the hundred oh. milliseconds you have there is when you can't parry, basically. Exactly, and then one sixty-six if you like want to chain into a bash. There we go. All yeah. right. I had to change around some I won't of my stuff. I will again, sorry. I know my audio is back because I'm on a bad connection. But... No problem whatsoever. You bought me some time to fix things. Okay. <laughs> I, on, you, can, you can keep it. Let me explain one more thing yes, because that is a yes. weird interaction that Go we're ahead. going to see today. Because mm. you know that when you it hit stun and then you block something, that changes the whole thing. And that's going to be the same here. And we have a couple mm -hmm. of very... I think Magi is not in that list, is he? Uh, no, he's not. But uh, should go. Okay, but should go. Is it? For example, you know how you uh, like chain hug, mm. where you keep hugging the person and the other, and the guy keeps heavy into light, and then that light is undodgeable, and then you get hugged. Now, uh, if you block that light, that confirms the hug, then the old gank still works. But if you get hit by that light, it interrupts the gank. So there's a little bit of. I don't know. It's not necessarily weirdness, but it's counterintuitive, isn't it? So, in that gank, you want to get hit, so to take advantage of those new rules. Mm. So, if anybody's doing the infinite hog gank today, we can pay attention, because the moment somebody blocks, they're fucked. But if they get hit by the confirming light, then all of a sudden, they escape the gank. Let's see if somebody can do that and applies it as it should be. All right, so we're not getting an eye yet on Kinu. Uh, let me go ahead and flip us back to the brackets because we can either chill uh, with our initial target of Reapers VW2F or do we want to try and jump to another game here? What do we think? Oh. We can play it patient for a bit or we can try and hop to someone else. Oh, let's be patient for a while. Okay. Mm. All right. Frozen Reapers WTF. Let's uh, because since we've got a moment, let's quickly look at like participants and who is here. Oh, wait, I was already doing it on that window. I'm very smart. Let's see here. Goblin Gang. That's Antonio, Immortalum, Living, and Normie. Pink underwear. Favorites, so to speak. Yes. Baby Nator, Reven Engerun, All Under Crusher, I Pop Bloons, and Sicario. Hotspot Gaming is Joanna, I Jupiter, Pink TS, and Post JS. Miasma Deep Purple. Game Curse, Mortesma, Pelegrin, and Modulus. Mostly Machine, Credly, Milk, Milk MM, Nitro Beast, and JTAX MM. The Greenhorns is actually a five man team. Nashley, Gamer Nex, XL, XXL Hunt, Codboy17, and Spadey Cat. Donut Glazes, Asthma, LOF Conk, Space Monkey, and Yatto. Frozen Reapers is Dizzy Rat, Directon, My Randoms Are Jokes, lol. The Ice King 604 and Illusions. Pretty much the truth, isn't it? Can be, yeah. <laughs> Gorth of Void, Finzen, Lonely Jinx, Aindless is set up struggles, like the picture. That is another team we can keep an eye on. Ah. I think they're going to place well. They might place top three. Hmm. So. WTF, what am I doing here? This is the Kinu team we're going to be targeting. It's Kinu, Verp, 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 Tamor, Tiamor, I don't know how to pronounce that, and Choquette. Last but not least, uh, not going to sugarcoat it, it's, it's Kazuya Mishima, Semper Paratus, Kanada, Rhythm Masters, and V-Ray. That is our lineup for hmm. today. Ray is an old name, isn't it? I believe it. I'm well, for a while. Am I confusing maybe? him? I don't know if that's the... Well, it depends on which Ray, which Ray we're talking about. One of the NA plays. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I don't know that that's him, though. Oh, okay, Yeah, so for this tournament, there is steel pricing actually there. If I, I can actually pull up the uh, Tony page, I do believe it's a decent chunk of steel. It's the normal chunk of steel, but it's still a decent chunk of steel. Uh, prize is, yeah, it's a 340k steel pot to give people actually, you know, something to fight for. But the purpose of today is to see how this kind of goes, because am I wrong here in... I've been using the same talking point consistently, but am I wrong to say, chaps, that's... This, these changes in this testing ground are aimed squarely at the heads of a more competitively organized player base. Yeah, I'd say so. Because those are the ones that actually need to change their play style. But it's not like the everybody in the player base will feel them. Hmm. Just because well, 
Oh, go ahead, Mel. Go ahead. I, I have I have a like a, a from a casual matchmaking perspective for those that are not as familiar with it, they may still feel the impact for all of those players that go into matches and just start deathballing people. They're gonna mm -hmm. they're gonna start seeing the hit stun reset and more damage or let more damp they're gonna start seeing the hit stun reset earlier. The damage reduction is gonna kick in earlier. There's gonna be less damage going out because of it. More Venge is gonna be fed of it as opposed to the damage that they would normally deal out. And I think that that's going to be seen in that. That's what you may see or may experience in a matchmaking perspective where people don't do ganking properly. Exactly. Because the, re the amount of revenge you feed is always based on the base amount of an attack. Mm -hmm. uh, the game doesn't care whether it's damage reduced, damage increased by a buff or anything. A 30 damage attack will feed 30 revenge. It doesn't matter. And with these changes, you will run a lot more into the 75% damage reduction. So you do 10 damage, no, do 8 damage, something like that. And you feed the full 30. So, yeah, you will notice. All right. Well, Freeze, uh, you're on the analyst list, but you're welcome to actually chill in the full cast if you so wish. Going to be a little more chill vibes today. Wait, well, you're going to kick me out. I mean, I can't... No, I, 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 I was gonna, no, I was going to stay here. Okay, all right, all right. We can get <laughs> into three map desk. <laughs> My brain was in ITF this, mode for a second. Yeah. Th this is this is a 1v1v1 all day. What are you talking about? We're just mm -hmm. we're just yelling into the mic and just whoever exactly. yells the loudest gets the, gets it's the a chair. Bomb That's roll. how it works. <laughs> yeah, I have this weird habit of really... I, I interrupt people a lot. It's... I've always been doing that, and I always hope people don't mind. But if somebody really minds, I am like the most annoying talking partner. <laughs> but yeah, here we are. Get away. No, guys, what's going on? We have a match on Overwatch. Remember, folks, this is the testing grounds tournament. Limited hero pools. We're gonna see what happens here in the opening split. We're gonna see a three. Whoa, no, one, we're going to see a, a big bandit back there. It's going to go over to A point. It's going to be a free cap. Or for big B rad, excuse me. He's an absolute bandit for taking this point for free. Although, how much <laughs> are they going to give up on C here? How quickly can it get back? Particularly since they're fighting against a team that should, in theory, be way stronger in the team fighting. So, but no, they did well. Mm. And now, Shigoki's here. Let's follow along with the Shugo, one of the characters noted to potentially come out of this uh, out of this TG with less wounds than others. So that could be useful. However, if most of your teammates still die, it doesn't really matter how well the patch notes treated you. Oh no. Oh, we can Speaking already see of, actually- Oh, an example there right there! See the damage reduction there and mm. the amount of revenge they have? And now they're just- <laughs> Oh, you're gonna onesie them. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> All right, I'm, I've only seen a single team fight in this tournament, but I'm already starting to see in my mind's eye visions of s stalling stonks go up. Oh mm -hmm. no! <laughs> oh, sneaky! Caster's curse. I'm He's sorry. He's stalling him right off the ledge. <laughs> that, I'm gonna shut up and have a drink of water. Uh, I actually <laughs> killed that person. I'm so sorry. Oh my goodness gracious! This is this is yep. Yeah, Char, we don't we don't we don't need a jury for this one. It was definitely verb. Yep, ver binge again. But they're gonna eat it. They're gonna come in, and we're gonna see three gamers now. Let's go. It comes the Shugo, gonna be able to assist. Excellent dodging by Derek for the time being, but Derek didn't gonna go full Renekton. Full pressure onto Kinu, but can Kinu take it? Nice dodge, all Kinu needs. And now can take this back to a 2v1, but Kinu had to make a choice there of which fight he chose to respond to. And Kinu chooses to respond to the Shugoki. Interesting that they try to bash confirm. Yeah. Bash confirm's got a lot weaker in general. Because like I explained, the uh, hit stun values carry over now, and bash is like JJ kicked that, or Jun Hu, uh, the palm strike which used to reset, no longer do. So hmm. confirming follow-ups with bashes is terrible now. In fact, it's basically dead. You just don't do it anymore. GB. Yep. That's actually a, a good point, I think. So uh, when we say when we say guard break to confirm, we I, I know I've said this time and time again, but for the sake of, of the audience here, for those of you who are not familiar with it, if you guard break for a finisher, if you time it properly, the guard goes away, the hit lands. The full intent is to make sure that the timing of the guard break is proper so they don't get damage reduction. 
Exactly. It's not. It's not with the intent of the guard brig actually landing. Oh, the guard brig often lands. Like the guard brig basically punishes parry attempts. Uh, but if the other person did not parry attempt, obviously that guard brig is not guaranteed. Like Noah was just pointed out. But you want to hit that very specific 100 ms time in there. Yeah, another note for this tournament in the rule set that's different. Uh, we do not have the traditional bands that are being uh, put up by the community right now. As you saw you know, there and heard by the spectator bug, the, uh, the Ocelotl tier 1 is Ooh. is on the table, for example. Just, mm -hmm. oh, rip. That could be a factor going into this. I was just going to mention that we do see here the, the tier 1 from Ocelot, Ocelot being utilized in... And it's been, you know, we've kind of been begging the the community to use it. There's been tournaments here and there where where it's it's been available and and to the player base, but they just uh, there's been sort of a what is it a gentleman's agreement I believe they called it yeah. that they were not going to use it, and and we've just been begging, please use it. We still need more data, more data, and we're finally seeing it uh, from uh, someone uh, such as Kino. So it's pretty cool to see. Kino's actually been rotating around this map for like the last five minutes on one HP. It's kind of interesting. Question, very ineffective. Question to the lag here. <laughs> it, was, it was clear in mid, so I guess he was like, it, it was very good, yeah, yeah. good. Good bit clear. Yeah, question to the lads here, both like as like an analytical thing and sort of instructions for myself. Where, which characters should be keeping an eye on if they start getting ganks? Because ganks are the star of this TG. Like, is there any characters we really need to keep an eye on to see if their performance changes? I mean, you I think you're on it right now. It in one, yeah. Oh, Shinobi. Yeah. I think Shinobi has been like one of the biggest culprits for ganking, especially easy ganks. Uh, and the other one, we, I don't think we have one in this game, but Pirate is the other one, I think. Pirates. Yeah, I was going to say Pirate. I think another one to keep an eye on, even though they're not really in the meta right now, is Yorm, just because there's so many changes that are happening to it. Uh, Yorm's finishers having that, uh, that reset from the displacement, I think is pretty interesting. Uh, and the fact that that's actually getting changed in, uh, with the uh, the hit stun changes, that'll be interesting to see how that plays out as well. We got a yeah. tier four. And Memes is pointing out something as well in chat right now. Uh, the back was heavy, you know, the back stones heavy from yeah. Ocelotl. It was basically not used at all already. Uh, but as yeah. a ganking tool, because it's, it was a hit stun reset, and that is no longer the case, so I'm heavily nerfed. Like, I don't think we will see it at all today. I don't think Kino has used it yet. Uh, I, mean, I, I don't doubt think so it. either. So that move's been taken out back and shot, in your opinion? Yeah. For now. I might as well not exist. It was already something that was, uh, in some, in, in some scenarios, was kind of awkward to set up for as well. So it's, uh, it's just one less thing that's got it going for it. Yeah, because it, you need like a really big setup for it. Because you need to go, you hop backwards, then forwards, and... It takes a while to land. I don't know the exact numbers here. What is it like 1600 overall? Like the whole mm. move? And then depending on distance, probably, I'm not sure. But yeah, yeah, it needs a big setup and then it just doesn't reset anymore. So yeah, it is. Ow. Yeah. Unfortunate. To the glue factory with it. Yeah. Two man down. Bean and chat. How you doing, Bean? Oh. And I have memes as well. Nice to see you. Oh, I have memes, by the way. Excellent little video you made that uh, you posted about a summary of the TG changes. I have that. Oh no, someone got ledged. Rip. One nil to what am I doing here in this little experimental tournament? But as I was saying, excellent video you did. I have memes. I actually have it pulled up in case of like, we have a big delay. We could just have a nice little video summary of some of the things that have been discovered in regards oh, to- Oh, Noah James Bond. Oh, so yeah, we got a James true. Bond. Oh no, <laughs> we got a James is. Bond. Oh, doo -doo, rip, doo -doo. Derek. You hate to see it. One nil. What am I doing? Oh, no, ba -da 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 -ba -da. All right, how long we got in the round? We still got an hour and chat. Just under an hour to go in the round. I'm sure, why the clock is not there? I really should import that over. Let me do that. Uh, clock. Where are you? Waiting. Live production. One, two. Clock should be there. Oh, I see. I yeah, see. For some reason, the, yeah. It. For some reason, the clock isn't on my in-game for some oh. bloody reason. Oh wait, because I have it bloody she, hidden. Uh, it is there. I was just an idiot. There we are. There we are. Well, it, the clock was I, there the whole time. Uh, really? Way, as YouTube long as you like. Go on. Sorry. Oh, right, sorry. Um, I was just reading chat because. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I th don't think GB ganks are affected at all because you GB when the other guy is in neutral already again. So mm. it's 
Mm -hmm. First hit's done again. So GB ganks are as they were before. Nothing changed, I think. I believe so. Yeah. I believe you're probably yeah i believe that's right as long yeah. as you're doing i mean obviously you're going to be doing a heavy finisher so or something that has a long duration so yeah that should be should be a lockstone gang should still work as well ah okay exactly yeah, yeah being is correct yeah. lockstone please, is please touch that. the nice thing about this tournament today is because of the nature of, it, of being kind of chill and more just to observe seeing what's going on while we kind of shoot shoot the breeze if you will all of these questions we can just see if they're answered throughout the game so because of the round robin format we'll be able to see a few more games as well hopefully and if we end up seeing some weird interactions we'll have them on camera mm -hmm. i think this is this is really Im important to to take note of too with with the the changes that are getting put into place so, something that looks great on paper may not look great in in like actual implementation once it gets into the game i had some concerns as to as to this because it's it's affecting a core mechanic of the game and i knew that there was going to be certain scenarios that would maybe kind of bypass this in some way you know like freeze and fiend have mentioned the you know the blockstone rules and uh the ability you know that and that kind of stuff and when you're changing hitstone rules overall it's i was kind of worried to be honest with you that there may be some situations where it may be activated too early uh or can kind of affect something in a funky way so it's good to see this in an actual tournament format so i want to give a huge shout out and thank you to everybody who's participating and everybody who's out there watching right now it is really good to get all this information one nil to what the fuck am i doing here the Frozen Reaper is going to have to make the comeback. It's best of threes as yeah, a tradition. Yeah, look what we got. Conk. Oh, my. Exactly. Oh, my. The move that is affected is the running bash on Conk. Oh, wait, are they? <laughs> wait, hang on a minute. I think I just realized. So, are... Did... They're... We're not... So, we don't do a Conquest rule set here today. No, it's not. Conquest is But I the think table. they just changed their set. I mean, why not? Yeah, why, why not? I'm uh, no, I'm just saying. Like, no, I, that, that it's cool that we're getting to see, and uh, yeah, even exactly. though they didn't have to, they're uh, they're changing their they're they're changing the setup. We just mentioned like we wanted to see a pirate, so now we're going to see a pirate, which is kind of cool. Yeah. Nice. They might be triggered from the last Tony. Ooh, that's a point. That's fair. Well, they then. may not have read the rules. Oh my. <laughs> that's true. That's I was wondering. I, I didn't know if that was the if they did it intentionally or not or whatever. But ultimately, yeah, the conquest format's not going in today because it's a limited pool of heroes. Uh, we had, what is it, 10? Yeah, Three, like Nutella said, it's it's only 10 because yeah. we're, we're strictly adhering to the TG. Well, uh, we'll have to find out if this ends up getting a restart or not. If it doesn't, so be it. But I'm going to pretend that it isn't for the sake of, well, my excitement and my sanity. Mm -hmm. But no, I think it's nice that they changed. Yeah. Oh, that is a weird start to notation, isn't it? Huh? 2C2A? Yeah. What is oh, going on here? Oh, we have to see on improvisational. Well, so that is. Where do we go? That... We're going to see. All right. Going to see. Yeah. Uh... It's always interesting to see these these differences in splits. Usually, if you see a uh, split going to A and you want to use that strategically, you'll see like a three one and have the last person go to mid. Uh, it's interesting they sent two and two, but it did work out for them because they were able to put the uh, extra person going to mid and they get still got A for free. Hmm. I'm surprised it didn't send the warden to me. Or the onesies. Who is in mid then? Mm -hmm. uh, who is in mid? Uh, that uh, they're dead. Conk. Conk, it's Conk, yeah, in mid. But, but, but killed the Zhan Hu. That's it, yeah. Uh oh. We may see the gank here. All four, all four warriors on the opposing member. Last man standing, oh no. Let's see how much revenge they can feed. Exactly. Death ball, yeah. let's go. But, but what we're gonna see a lot, uh, at least what we saw before, uh, as a lot of just fainting and pretending to confirm. Yeah, it means it. Oh, that was a lot of it. That wasn't. felt weird to watch. <laughs> that was weird. These that I'm not sure if a minion block that or if that was actually the TG effect coming into play there, but that felt weird. I see that reset there. Yeah, I just saw the flash, the uh the silver. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Yeah, let's keep an eye on Chiquette. 
I think Freeze makes a good point. You know, what this these changes could potentially implement is is a lot of different reads that we have to make, maybe more so than we have to now, but it actually gives us options to actually counter these games. Revenge, back on the table. Let's see what the pirate can get done here. Full throw, should be a Colmo punish. Yes, it is. However, the Warden wasn't able to assist because got peeled off by the Ice King. Kinu back now to assist as well. Pirate gang gonna be used one, two. That's all you need. Testing ground changes don't matter if your HP's too low. Mm. Now, for those of you who may be wondering why Warden is here, Warden didn't actually receive any, you know, pinning changes here. I believe Warden's here as a control, as they stated. They just wanted a neutral character. Yeah, Jesse said because everybody has Warden. So if you wanted to participate in the testing rounds, you have a character that you can pick. That was basically it. Okay. That feels weird to watch. Like after mm -hmm. for years yeah. seeing the gunshot confirmed, that would have been a confirmed heavy. Now it's not, bruh. But they quickly adapted. Hmm. They, did, went for they the didn't light. use the gunshot there. They just yeah. did it differently, but still fed revenge. Ah. Like it from before. Had a lot of bench there. And there is a window when you block, you can still parry a follow up. What? So if you make a good read on it, you can still kind of counter. That choke was weird, wasn't it? A little bit. Oh, oh damage play. reduction. Yeah, no, yeah, but good. The pin? Yeah. Actually working there, hitting at the correct time. No, well done. Yeah, I could have waited. Didn't maybe. use the gunshot, which obviously doesn't work anymore. Hmm. But yeah. Defenders. Nice to see some oh, adaptation. Oh, we have a bot. Oh, bot. oh dear. Yep. That was the Jormungandr, unfortunately. Hopefully they're able Bots to reconnect. Doing bot things. For more lore. Archivist era, why have you invaded our game? Exactly. <laughs> you, you, you picked up what I was looking <laughs> Come on, bot, you've got this. Anti-gate like a champion. Oh. I hoped for too much. <laughs> and that's game gonna be over quickly. Yeah, the, yeah, the score line is uh, harsh. It's very, it's very much a. a we, we've the solid line has been driven in the sand. Uh, oil has been poured onto it. The fire has been raging from the John Who's tier four, and uh, it doesn't matter though because they're about to die and be in breaking. Yeah, but Gunshot seems like a bismal, bismal there. Mm. <laughs> the gunshot. We're just ending this bang. <laughs> Nothing uh, personal, kid. Last two standing is Big B Rad and the AI. Let's see if they can get some magic working together. The bot is immediately fighting in the mid lane. Big B Rad. The bot is first on the scoreboard, by the way. Wait, what? No, <laughs> oh, he went down. Okay. Oh, he, he was like just a second ago. <laughs> Look, I, uh, yeah, they must have, yeah, the stacking must have got him some extra points. Mm. I mean, it was just clear in mid all the time. No, I mean, like, just now, the, the flip because he was on point. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, so they, instead of doing the actual the actual confirm, they waited and got pinned. There was a bad read from the Hedo, so it worked out. Hmm. What we can talk about here is, just because we have Pirate and Gunja no longer resetting, mm -hmm. the amount of revenge some of these moves feed, just because of the issues it had with Gankin in the past. So I think that's naturally the next step that Ubisoft has to take is just reduce the amount of revenge some of these moves feed. Otherwise it's ridiculous. There's no reason for the gunshot to feed this amount of revenge without having the upside he used to before. Mm. All right, so first match in the books already with a demonstration of what has been, ha what is being affected by the TG? Let us go back to the brackets, give them a good old refresh, and see how the Swiss is looking. Goblin Gang has two old pink underwear. Uh, mostly machines still fighting my asthma deep purple one nil. Donut glazes ha and setup struggles unreported. Kazuya Mushima of the Zaibatsu and uh, Hotspot Gaming still unreported. Where do we want to look? That's a very good question. The question is, the, also the question is whether or not they're still going through their matches and they just haven't reported yet. True. Or... 
or if they're just still getting into their first or they're still finishing their first because we've been through a couple of matches already so i'm under the impression that these have just not reported in yet yeah, please they should report your matches be in, in the real shop time. soon all right i'm just gonna yolo a spectate go ahead yeah mostly machine versus uh miasma deep purple uh shall i go in current position just for the just for the speed or shall we Makes go from sense. beginning all right uh if it's the second one they're probably getting ready to wrap up so we current could position. probably actually go from the beginning oh go from beginning yeah yeah let me make sure i've got the names on the right side jtax uh that is mostly machine yep they're on the right side okay it's 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 you know I wasn't entirely sure if it was on the right side or not, but now, you know, like... I had to double confirm. Every time I have to double confirm, because I, I always get I know wrong. you do. I, on, on my end, I'd already saw so I was like, okay, well, I see where it is, and I looked at the teams. Like, they have matching colors, which is... You know, it's not. It's a rare thing, but it's obviously really cool to see whenever they... Yeah. they of course, up Deep Purple makes sense. Herp Derp, my brain. Yes. Deep Purple. Let's go. Okay, we do not know the scoreline of this... Uh, actually, no, we do know the scoreline of this match. Uh, uh, it's 1-0 one one mostly. To... Yeah. Yeah, this is game two. Uh, as consensus was reached, we'll go from the beginning, so we'll have the full thing. Let's once again follow along with the pirate, as the pirate and the shinobi seem to be the two characters that have immediately caught our attention to observe. Indeed, and we have a team fight going here on C point. The in Nitro Be I oh, what? Nitro Beast? I see. They have little brackets on the side. The Nitro Beast Xbox is here. Style. Working, uh, working their magic on the John Who. The team fight's actually starting to not go their direction, though, and they're out of stamina. They cannot heal for their teammate. Let's see how the hit stun changes uh, help them with a potential gank that may be happening. Out of stamina, Shin Bob lights. Let's go. Pilgrim trying their best, but it don't really need the help there. Is the rest of the team able to clean up? Pilgrim able to survive? That's going to be Miasma Deep Purple claiming victory in the initial scrap on C. Mid only just secured Ooh. A left alone. Mm -hmm. Yes. Wait, they should have had the advantage in mid anyways. I think mm -hmm. they could have grabbed A without an issue. Oh yeah. They absolutely could have grabbed A. I probably would have off of spawn, I think probably headed towards A just to see what uh what happens. They don't have their teams, they don't want to actually push too too deep, they will get ganked. But then again, it's testing ground, so you kinda of wanna provoke that, so maybe do it anyway. Mm. Jindu gets taken out by Mortisma with an excellent whiff punish. Now Mortisma can look for assists on the other areas. Game Curse can be the one who needs it right now, but Pilgrim sees that as well. Take this into a three versus two. Minions are also going to be in the fray, so that will also add an additional element of chaos. Question is, are they going to be chaotic good or chaotic evil? I think these uh, these changes are chaotic good. For now. Who knows, there could be some horrendous thing inside that we don't realize. I know some people have already been, like, searching. The nice thing with uh, TG's going public is the amount of sheer man hours you can get to test this kind of thing. Or sometimes you'll find something buried in that's horrendous. Like, remember back in the day, the night, uh, the warden uh, one-hit kill grapple mm -hmm. that he had off, off guard break, that shenanigans? That, I'm glad that got found out before that slipped into a tournament. Oh, for sure. Rip Pirate, you'll be remembered. Game Cursed Heavy. Heavy. Sweep Heavy. <laughs> heavy de bush, de bush de heavy. Also, uh, side note here, not TG related. Interesting choice of feats by Game Cursed on the, uh, on the Hito Kiri. Oh, yeah. I would have, oh, yeah, nice. I personally expect the, uh, at least the unique tier one. Huh. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Well, with the stamina, I mean, you, there's... Yeah, I guess some players may prefer it. Maybe it's more of a comfort thing for them. Yeah. It, is uh... that the fast regen or is that the one that... That's fast regen. ...uses stamina consumption. Okay. Yeah. It's not Tyless. Yeah. Tyless is a smaller icon. I say as, as a... we can as make a, uh, an argument for the second feat. That's Righteous Deflection, yeah. right? Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't think that's a bad feat. Where, where you can is use it. it. Here we are. But uh, particularly, like, the, the top comp players are very much confident in being able to use the what is it something shroud right uh, the one where the keto like selects a mark target for death kind of style yeah mark for death yeah, yeah. Not... AOE yeah, heal. Shroud, yeah. Shroud, yeah 
because if you execute that person that was targeted with that feat, everybody oh from, no no from uh, the team gets no uh, uh, tier two. It's tainted gift. Sorry, tainted gift. It's, thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Trail, it's the tier three. You basically pop a huge heal in the middle of a team fight, I and mean, if you manage to actually use it, that is amazing. But very very rarely, very 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 very. Really, <laughs> 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 so I'm, I'm very much fine with that person picking righteous deflection because getting the the game changing mm -hmm. feel, you just see. I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I mean, I, I think I've made myself clear. Yeah. It's not well, you got to think like <laughs> it's it's definitely going to be helpful in certain like the gank scenario that you mentioned earlier with Shigoki. So. If you on on block stun, um, I, I'm getting to I'm getting to it. But on block stun, you you get get grabbed on hit. You don't. Uh, but with righteous deflection, if you go to parry an attack because you maybe you want a little bit more revenge, uh, then at that point you have 50% damage reduction for five seconds. So you still have a use for that even in the testing grounds. Actually, isn't it the other way around? Now that you mention it, because you're gonna have a lot of damage reduction in. But no, oh no, 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 you are right. Sorry, I am completely wrong because, yeah, if you parried, you were already not hit something. So, right. Are yeah. oh, you correct? Yeah. Might have actually. Hey, I, I, get, I get it every once in a while. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm redeemed from earlier. <laughs> okay, occasionally, the good point strike Might have actually gone up and bowed there a little bit. Hmm. All right. Lots of intermittent skirmishes on the map here. No one able to secure pa uh, real, f no one from mostly machine able to secure a real foothold on mid. And because of that, Miasma Deep Purple, slowly but surely, acquiring a fairly healthy lead. Well, we got Hito Ganks in play here. Ooh. So something I noticed with Pilgrim, Pilgrim has been going out of stamina a lot more than I would expect a Shinobi to be going. However, at the same time, they've been leveraging the high damage heavies from both the Zhanhu and especially the Hitokiri to re to result in some fairly nice one-two short ganks and not the extended ones that we would used to, that we'd normally see pre-testing grounds. Ooh, let's go, Cursed! Tracking heavies, two for one special. Oh, it's so clean. Wow. Probably because the animation, yes. like he was. Oh, here we go. No animation. Oh, there we go. Made the wrong oh, way. the dodge. That what is actually? Oh. I think that actually did fine. That is correct. Yeah. Nice. That is how that one looks now. I think oh. obviously the forward dodge one. I think was dodgeable there. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, because I know the, there is technically a window for most of them to still work. It's just really short. Or just get pinned into a wall. That will also make it hard to get around the gank. Unfortunate. That's a scary heater there, isn't it? Hmm. A little bit. A little bit. Nope. We did see a little bit of damage, uh, a little bit of a uh, reset to damage reduction right just before the pirate did die, though. I believe. Hmm. Yeah, I think it's almost it. unavoidable now. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah. The nice thing is we can, uh, people can always pull up clips and we can analyze if we get some spare time, you know, gather the data, we can have a look back through. And I'm also, I also personally, I'm really wanting to do the winner's interview this, uh, this tournament, because I want to ask the players their opinion. Like, coming hot off the back of the tournament, I want to hear what they think. Because, you know, we can, we've got our, like, our own viewer here, <laughs> we can yap all day, but the ones in the trenches may wow. have a different perspective to us. Hito is uh, this he okay? So game curse this Hito. I'm actually kind of interested without some of the way that they've been deciding to play there with the anti gang. You know, going for the kick, going for the uh, slightly delayed heavy, changing the targets. They did a pretty good job there. They, they did run out of stamina despite their tier one, uh, but they some pretty good reads there and ended up uh, coming out on top of it and surviving long enough to get their team to come here. They still got C. It's just getting closed out right here. Three people down on mostly machine threatening a game three in this set. Oh, and the fear itself or the heat. Oh no, it's not the funny button, it's the death button. And just dump everything. <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, this is not a feat, TG. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Dear God. Fear itself. You can call me Gaz. No need to be formal. Ah, my apologies. <laughs> but yeah, game class, 15 and three. Hmm.
And some nice fights there. Yeah. Got to be nice and quick here, actually, because we do have a third game in the wings, probably, from... Yes, we do! There we are. We're going to harbour. Alrighty, then. Is that a complete... No. The difference is... Shin Bob and JJ. Otherwise, it's and complete... Nitro's on Hito now instead of Pirate. Nice, interesting, interesting. They do still have a pirate though. They switched it to uh, Jindu. Hmm. VTG Wen, please, VTG Wen. I know, right? I was hoping that's what this one was gonna be, and it ended up being uh, the hit stuns. I mean, it's still a really great, really great, uh, really great TG to get into. So I'm hoping we get that one later on this year. I think that we will. I think we will. Oh boy, yeah. I, I need to break kayfabe for a moment. The hangry is gonna get dealt with right now. Yes. So... Do what you need. Take a break, my man. Thank you. Oh yeah. But if we're doing uh, kayfabe breaks, uh, freeze. God, how's the uh, quality on the uh, your stream been? Everything good? Perfect. That's great. Jolly good. All right. So it's gonna be me and freeze for a little while while Nor goes, uh, while God has to satiate his hunger. You know, you when you're hungry, have a sandwich. Oh, too late there. On the C cap. Too. Oh, C cap. Uh, I'm hitting the wrong buttons. Observer, please. Observer, you're drunk. Just... There we are. Defenders captured zone A. Jindu, let's follow along with the pirate. Three. Yeah. Inca, stay on the side. Pilgrim getting someone in the sickle rain. Hyper armor going to be helpful, but only so much. Not too many actual 1v-Xs here. A lot of uh, either 3 v 3 ing or 1v1s. Now we're getting an actual 1v-X here. Multiple X2, but there's revenge. I don't quite understand why they're fed revenge there. Hmm. They could have just waited a little. There we go. See? They could have done that before. <laughs> but now they got reinforcements again. Oh, okay. Spawn. We're fighting on sea. Let me post up in the usual spot. Anyone want some potatoes? Got some peaches, some tangerines. Is that a donkey on the other side, right? Can we go with the donkey? Yes. Donkey. Here's donkey. Oh, the donkey's looking wrong. Okay. Fair, fair, fair. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that was authentic. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Get back to your sandwich and put that Eldritch impression back where it came from. Oh, hang I on. I can't see. But yeah, Did. they got basically stuck there the whole time on sea. And uh, mostly machine took advantage of that. Look at the hard points. Taking both other. Other points. Probably farm in mid, are they? Oh, go back, the to, go back to Donkey. We don't care about fight. As chat requests, we go to Donkey. Donkey, <laughs> your opinion on, opinion on the TG? Mm -hmm. uh, well, you know, it uh, looks pretty good on paper, but uh, nobody's giving me apples. This is bullshit. Ah, I'm terribly sorry. We'll fix that post haste. Thank you, our, our, our fieldside reporter, Donkey. Oh, we got a full team fight here on mid. Let's keep a look on this. That was a risky hit. That was a risky attack, Crady. If you got parried, you're on your backside. Pilgrim, core. Doesn't take too much, though. Both teams playing this a lot more loosey goosey. They aren't necessarily wanting to dedicate too much time to a single opponent. They're spreading out across the fights a lot more than last the last game we saw. Who knows about the first game of the set? We didn't see that. They really need to stop using the gunshot. So many of these fights basically get interrupted because all of a sudden they realize, oh, the guy's 90% revenge, oh, I can't attack anymore. And I feel like it's been mostly the case when the pirate is involved. Particularly when they press the gunshot. But let's see how often that happens. So, if we pretended the gunshot was illegal now in ganks, what option would you recommend instead? If there is any other viable option in its stead, that is. Hmm. There. I don't know, maybe just try and confirm the... Walk the plank? Exactly. I mean, it doesn't reset the hit stun anymore either. But so far, we've only had one confirmed walk the plank. And that was from... What, what am I doing here, right? That's the... I I'm trying, the to, I'm trying to, like, listen to you while watching whatever the dickens just happened there. That was some yeah. improv... That wasn't TG affected. That was improvisational ganking. I don't know what happened there. I think the players feel the same. Mm. I don't know what's happening. Yeah, still getting a feel uh, for I it. I don't mean that in a mean way or anything. Yeah, they're getting they're used to it. Going to have to, like, figure things out as well. Yeah, like, this is... A that's why we're here. 
this is a round robin format too to, to you know if you lose once or twice you're not out of the tournament you're in for the full set of rounds you need yeah. you need to learn as we are learning this as well excellent parry by game cursed Ow. Can he? Oh, that was Sifu. nice. Sifu! Can he escape? Oh, no, he did. Oh, don't get greedy, my son. Don't get greedy. I'm becoming oh. a fan of this man. Let's Lucky go! Oh, oh, I tried the parry. <laughs> Nitro Beast putting him down. However, over the top here, we have an actual gank, and that is the priority to watch today, in my opinion. So JTAC gets revenge. 2v1. Now it's a 1z. Oh, never mind. Nitro Beast rotates over, and now it's the pirate who's in trouble. Did I say, did I say round robins of Swiss? But yeah, Swiss. Herp derp. Yeah, oh, there get out there. That's hey. the... You can blame me. I was talking about before the... Yeah, there it is. All uniques now. They changed. Yeah, that that means the uh, the pirate being piloted by Modulus has to be real careful now, Freeze. Well, Nitro's on the on oh. mostly machine. Feels Meows with Deep Purple, the game person, the one that had the uh, yeah. Modulus is the one who got targeted by that though. He had the little <laughs> ghost above his head. Oh, I see what you're saying. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. If you if you get targeted by that, you got to be real careful because if you get, like you know you can end up feeding the enemy team a substantial team heal. Yes. I like you. Scoreboard. You're good. What's going yeah. on here? It's really close. Look at the, the renown. Look at the hard points. It's as close as you can get. I heard a zip line. That was Crady going over from the middle of the map. Shimbob is here. It's going to be Shimbob Janhu. Ganks versus Jangjun Hitokiri Ganks. Ow, never mind. Goodbye, Janhu. Nice knowing you. Yeah, he would, Hito with a lot of HP. That is a absolute... Me Where is the Hito? There we are. God, I'm so rusty on the observing. Nito, Nitro with that much HP is going to be a menace in fights just by the pure nature of heavy Gobur. We mean it in a joking manner, but with the buffs that Hito has slowly received over the months, heavy Gobur is a legitimately terrifying playstyle in team fights if you've got the HP to actually fuel it. And anti ganks. We saw Gay and Cursed in the last match utilize their, you know, their hyper armor on red, basically, to, mm. you know, the quick acting hyper armor to use them in anti gank scenario. Fast switch target, go hyper armor, go burn. Indeed. J Tax gonna be in a discreet 1v1. However, over on the other side there, we got Nitro Beast in a little bit of trouble. Has the Zenbon Sakura ready to go if they need it. However, Pill Grin moves away to let Nitro <laughs> fight on their own. The oh. kick lands. Oh, I was expecting that kick to miss. The dodge seemed on correct timing, but apparently not. j Tack in a 1v2 here gets revenge just in time though. They need to kill this man, like now. They can't afford feeding revenge. I'm not killing this person. Top heavy, top heavy, top heavy. GB cancel. Last hit. That's what either person needs. Oh, lets it fly. But reinforcements got here in time. The delay. They didn't kill him in time freeze. Attackers captured zone hey, rallied though. Good stuff what? by JTAC. Why are rally. you in chat, JTAC? Get out of here. You got a game to play. Yeah. <laughs> but deep, because Miasma was like in breaking. They could have rallied had they oh, killed no. them earlier there, because most of the machine was like three of them were dead. That was, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We're getting a little bit down to the wire here. Advantage to mostly machine. They're the ones pushing Miasma Deep Purple into breaking. They're looking to lock yeah. that in before they move anywhere. They're in permanent breaking soon. Pirate, where are you going? Why are you running? Stay with your team. Oh, here we go. We gotta go to white cam. Let's actually follow along with this full team fight here. I lied, never mind, we're going to the pirate. Jindu's out of stamina, can't assist, but JTAC may not need it. If they can get the kill on Modulus, no! The gunshot bounced back and killed Modulus! Modulus killed themselves with their own feet, I think! Oh no, that was Jundu firing. Never mind, the cooldown on the tier three just popped. I thought that was a gunshot actually bouncing back from themselves. No, it was actually Jundu. Nice tier three. Good drop. And that's it. Defenders captured zone A. One or two bits of cleanup, and that's going to be a full set. The first one we've Defenders seen today. 2 1 to mostly machine.
I've become a fan of Gamecast. 100%. Yeah. Yep. Good shit. What a dub for console. Oh, our mostly machine uh, consolian team. Nice. Yeah, look at that. All four consoles. Oh, yeah. UB logo, UB logo, UB logo. Yeah. Well done. Good on you, chaps. Oh, they're an Xbox, Xbox team. Xbox team, apparently, yeah. Hmm. Well done. Console chalks one up on the board. Let's hop back to the brackets, if I can... Oh, yeah, that look. should conclude the bracket, right? We should be done. 25 minutes left. Refresh. Uh, it's just donut glazes Not setup struggles. Uh, we were able to catch the uh, two games in the set, JTAC. We saw... Uh, Temple. The Temple and then Harbor. We did. We were not able to catch the first one. Yeah, Donut Glazers set up struggles. I imagine this game actually probably hasn't been reported yet. We can try and hop in on them quickly. Like space. You have someone team. from setup struggles. You might have Finson. Yeah, let me check. Or Jinx. Uh, Those two you might have. Uh, Finson or Jinx. Let me have a look. Uh, Lonely Jinx. Oh, uh, their eye is fake, so I think the game might have just ended. Yeah, they probably just need to no. report this score then. Yeah, like if I uh, pop this back up. Lonely Jinx, Lonely Jinx. I literally just looked at them. Yeah, Lonely Jinx, the eye just left, so I think that probably just sealed the deal. All right. Up on back. Yeah, I imagine. Unless that game has literally taken so long, it's now going into the third game. I mean, there is 25 m minutes in the round still, but, so it's not unfeasible that that could have happened. Like, I'm not going to rule that out. But we yeah, I think this uh, this set has gone into uh, second hit stun rule. <laughs> <laughs> go, get back what to is it then? Time which... reduction we're looking at. We're doing a reset. We're going into game. Potentially, yeah. Uh, Potentially. Gl yeah, let me actually, let me load up the, the bases on this, uh, so to speak, just in case. 1-0 uh, Donut Glazers. That's all the information we have to work with here. And yeah, the target will be Lonely Jinx. Oh, wait, we have an eye on Lonely Jinx. Nogos was joking, but he's at, I think we're going to a game three. This has to be game three. Yeah, I refuse oh, this map, though. I refuse. <laughs> uh, we play Sankbridge. Cry about it. <laughs> this has to be a game three. This is a, absolutely a game three map. Going to Sankbridge yeah. on a te team fight TG. Yo. How is this not an emote on Twitch already, by the way? Oh, Sankbridge, cry Coach, about it. You're Toe slacking. Dancing. Somebody you should, are slacking. I, you know what? Yeah, yeah. Well, somebody, yeah. It's gonna happen. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, Tylenol. There, there have been. There are some jolly fun names. Let's put it that way in the tournament today. Trying to find out more. My net is stuck. Oh yeah, we also have another thing working against us. Unfortunately, the internet gods have decided to curse our admin for today, uh, Spaniard. So he is literally working off of a mobile hotspot that is at the whim of the weather <laughs> and he's in england england yeah <laughs> so, so f in the chat for the admins it's now a lawless world Attackers captured zone all right let's zoom on down here who do we follow Defenders along with let's, we get into the team a. fight let's see we got warden we got a pirate on deck let's go actually let's go shin bob let's follow on with conk uh, with uh, lof conk here we are Gets the dodge initially, trying to help where they can. A warden's an okay base for the team fight, but the Janhus are going to be, and the Shugokis especially, are going to be big concerns. The first Shugoki's going to go down, killed off by Aimless with the help of the rest of the team. Gorthar dealing out lots of chip damage and actual outright hits too with the Shugoki. However, it looks like everything's kind of split up a little bit here. Oh. Ooh, good GB. A fake confirmed there. Oh, wait, you got run. Oh, man, yeah, there we go. There we are. Okay, that pro that makes sense. Get away. Aimless. Gonna be able to assist, pick up the kill. 
mid controlled. Finn's installing on the enemy's home point. Actually took it as well. Uh, is there anyone else behind him? Oh, Yato's actually still behind. Oh, Yato's dead. Now we're back here. Wee. Oh, well this is basically what he wanted. You're taking him out of the the game basically like this. Has to run all the way back, heal up, and then he runs back. It's almost like had he killed him, would have been back to the fight soon. Hmm. Yeah, they didn't want to go for the drop attack for that reason, I imagine, right? Yeah, it was a good choice from them. Hmm. Sank Bridge, a map where it is team fighting the whole time. An excellent place to actually test out this TG. Lonely Jinx will follow on with on the Warden, see if they end up getting ganked here. Asthma, however, to a quarter HP already, having to back into the minion lane for his cover, but realizing it's the enemy minion lane, that's actually going to be cover for the enemy against him. Gets chased down by Gorthar. Gorthar's having absolutely none of it. And gets taken out with a little bit of a one-two hit. But Endless also coming back in. Gorthar just letting it rip, waiting for the guard break confirmed. So far, keeping it simple is keeping it successful. Ooh. Early GP, unfortunate. Sorry, fellas, my uh, mute button's been broken for the last, like, few minutes. Ah. It is what it is. But yeah, you're right, then. I was just a little bit late GB there. But yeah, at least they're trying to confirm with GBs instead of lighting mm -hmm. or bashing. So, yeah. GB is the yeah, way to go now. Yeah, yeah. GB. GB, GG. <laughs> That's going to be the new meme. I'm calling it right now. GBGG. Yes. Trying to We're start a new trend. My... Let's see if it's successful yes. or not. Indeed, indeed. Gothar is, is like, is like uh, just jumping in here like, this is my line. There are many <laughs> like it, but this one is mine. Come on, I'll take all of y'all together. Let's go. Three people in his face does not give a shit. Oh, apparently Asma doesn't either, girls. Got a little. Oh, I was gonna say he's got quite a bit of venge. Nobody else there to feed, but uh, gives himself an opening and gets killed. Unfortunate. You know, I will say one thing. We have seen quite a few wardens. Oh, there's a reset again. Yeah, and I think that messed up his party timing there. Hmm. Yeah. Now, one thing I will say is we've seen quite a few wardens, but we have not seen a warden skin yet. I'm very sad that we have not seen an unsung knight skin yet today. Well, I mean, there's a good bit of steel on the line today. That if whoever wins, could you take that steel and actually get some drip? Good point. Good point. Yeah. So those of you that are running warden, if you win, I fully expect you to get the unsung knight hero skin. Yes. It's uh, I don't want to have. I don't want to have this go under the uh, radar. Finsen just killed Aimless. That's his own teammate. Rude. How dare you? Ooh. Cruelty. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, that Lonely Jinx continues the trend of setup struggles killing each other because he just sprint heavy Finson to death and Yato got the credit. That was a smart target swap there for her, but when uh, Jinx got the GB on the John who was swapping targets to the JJ, unsure what they were going to do in terms of like heal, so that was a really smart idea. Hmm. We can try and pay attention to is the huge range that Warden has. In mm. these team fights with the charge mm -hmm. bash, basically just I don't know. Oh, interesting pick on the tier one. You love to see that. Come at me is a really interesting renowned starter, uh, a renowned boost. If you use it strategically, you do take more damage whenever you do uh, do pop it, but you can get a humongous boost in in renown gain if you are using it to get kills. Oh, I just heard like eight parries there. That's what happens if you're in the middle of the minion lane where that happens. We have a warden. <laughs> Let's flip back over to Lonely Jinx, see if that charge yeah. mass comes into effect. Want to get back to come at me real quick. Yep. Uh, usually you want to use it on a character where you who you want to enable to get feats early and quickly, right? Mm -hmm. Or your whole team basically wants to. But which one are we going for on warden here? Do we want morale boost? Or what do we want? Oh, uh, very good question. I mean, you've got Inspire for the second one, so that's going to help with team fights. Uh, that you know what that uh, so the tier one helps you get quickly to the tier two. Tier three is kind of hit or miss because they're running uh, was uh, whatever that bomb is. Uh, Mo I can't remember the name. Of it, but then you got the morale booster, which is Pugno Mortis. See, I was going to say Mugno. I was like, that's not it. Uh, <laughs> I know it ain't that. Um, but yeah, that tier four is going to be really good for 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 the team as well. 
dead. Shout out to Yedo while we were talking about all that, just dash canceling for his life, securing a couple of kills. And I think Yedo actually might have even been able to get out there alive yet. Yeah. Oh no, Yedo, I think, actually ended up did dying, but Vincent is also going to get away. Good Wanna job, the Pirate. The Gorthar, watch that gate, mate. Watch those That's wrist it. rockets. Ah, nice knowing you. Yeah, I mean, when Shigoki's low, I mean, that's kind of what you want to do is you use your dodge bash, get set up on the... Oh, they're not going for it. That yeah, probably Space Monkey cancelled twice. He seemed a bit hesitant. Yeah, I think people are still trying to figure out what it is in terms of, like, what fits on the, the hit stun rules hmm. and what doesn't. Even though, like, we, we kind of have the idea that oh. Gortha or, or Shigoki is going to get dropped, the Space Monkey is no longer in space. They have been grounded. Um. Okay, that was uh, a weird bash. No! Oh, oh, Asma! HD. Oh, two. No. That's two for oh, one yeah. special. Two, two yeah. for one special, baby. All day, every day. Let's oh, go. Oh, wow. That was cruel. <laughs> oh, I just wanted to talk about it, boys. this bash confirmed there, but the <laughs> I immediately hit him. <laughs> <laughs> So it's all good, all good. The universe balances itself oh, out, right? I, I swear, I was, I was biting my tongue. I'm like, we're really close to the spikes. I foresee <laughs> something, but I don't want to jinx it. You get that sense on this map, Nagals. If you've been commentating mm. for long enough, like, don't say anything. Don't bloody jinx it. We might get it on camera. <laughs> and you got it this time. <gasps> oh, that's kinda... from neutral. That huh? was wild. Again? Huh? I don't understand. What... What? That was not a gank. Let's point it out right away. <laughs> yes, that was, was not, not a gank. A gank. No, I mean technically you could argue that it was because it was not a gank. It was not not a gank because you know if Stop. they were to confirm I'm it the this other thread. way. Stop. I also had two hawks with a friend nearby. That's all I'm giving you. <laughs> Onesies with friends. The sequel to Wordle. <laughs> Lof Conk gonna have to get away there. Aim oh, aimless. Just keeping the opposing Shugo out while the team cleans up the rest of the map. This is going to be setup struggles, most likely taking the dub unless there is the mother of all sprinkles put on this comeback donut. I think they're getting glazed. Uh, what? What? <laughs> what? Tier three has it. Is he gonna spam it? No. Ah. Oh. Okay. Ah, oh, they're um, gonna take it though. Shigoki tier three for can, Shigoki tier three. Can I get a rain check on the past 30 seconds? <laughs> what? Fair trade. Up. Up. Legacy pass. Yes. Also, go for how so. dare you. Is that what that is? I think that's what that is. Yeah, yeah that was. It's that. at the end of the it's not it's it's at the end of the match. It doesn't it's Yeah, it doesn't really actually effective. it doesn't matter. I think yeah, there is the actual the uh, there is the rule of like if it's at the end of the match, admin discretion. Yeah. All right. I don't. I don't think Spaniard's gonna bother with that too much today because on account of rain. Yeah, I. I actually think that Spaniard <laughs> is legitimately having to invoke like the uh, some sort of eldritch being to be able to use the internet. That is. That is going to be a whole thing. However, we Look. are done with the first round. We Took are. Well, it did. It. Did. I mean, it's. It's good though. Lots of good data happened in just the first round. I know some people were probably wondering. How much data were we going to get? How much it was actually going to affect the game? And and in the very first round, we saw several games where we immediately can see in the very first game, as a matter of fact, we saw that happen. Uh, Shigoki and Jean Hu, I think, were the setup, and the second bash uh, reset the hit stun and uh, completely botched that gank. Really interesting to see. Gentlemen, what do we think about this setup struggles? No, WTF. I want Goblin Gang. No, Goblin yeah. Gang. Okay, Goblin Gang. First it's one. time. It's time for the gang. The, the go goblin gang. The goblins will be fighting the Mishima Zaibatsu. I I've recently started playing Tekken, so I actually Tekken. get the Kazuya oh, reference. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> nice. It, it's, it does look like a great game uh, yeah, for the FGC, for sure. It really, really does. Uh, I've seen a Nobi. few heroes. Like... We got Nobi in the goblin gang. All right. All Ooh. right. We can hover on the yeah. eye here. Wait for Are you actually playing one of the Mishima family? Uh, no, no, I'm not playing a Mishra. My current character is Leroy Smith, uh, with a little bit of Shaheen, but mainly Leroy. Okay. I just, I just know the memes now because I've been in the community for a little bit. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I play Dan. Ah. Uh, hang on a minute. That's, that's a Street Fighter character. <laughs> How dare you? 
I can't put that past you, can I? Like, oh, okay, <laughs> Dad's like, because yeah, there are characters just called Brian, Paul, Lee, like, uh, like all that's yep. like one name. So it's like, oh, Dan. Okay, hang on a minute. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, you jester. Well, fun fact about that, I guess, while we're waiting on this to get started, uh, Dan from Street Fighter is actually, uh, in most of the Street Fighters, he's actually the weakest character in the game. Either lowest damage or lowest health pool or both. Is he uh, so like, like a knight in Tekken? Huh? Is he like a knight in Tekken? Mm, I'm not familiar enough with a Tekken to... Oh, to... you... Okay. Yeah, like, it was sort of it was sort of for there. memes essentially. Yeah, it was it was there for to for is a is sort of a meme. Yeah, but it's been there as far back as I think was when he was first implemented. I think third strike. I I'm trying was I'm trying to go strike? deep into my I didn't play that. I'm trying to remember a Maximilian dude video at this point. Uh, yeah, I think it was like third <laughs> strike or something. Shout out to the dude. My joke completely fair. I I'm so, I it, yeah. I'm sorry, Freeze. You'll need to explain. It went over our heads. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. I'll, I'll make it again in like an hour or so. <laughs> Let's see if it lands then. Mm. All right. Okay, spectate. Oh, yeah, let me grab a drink. I'll be back. Yeah. In... yeah, you you you. We'll do shifting breaks. Now it's Freeze's turn. That was gonna be me right. and Goz for a bit. All right. That sounds good to me, Verb. Yeah, you know, allow you to get some food. You kind of need energy, especially considering Pacific time. You got up decently early for us. Yeah, I did. I, 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 I mean, considering my sleep schedule, I'm like, I got, usually on tournament days, I get maybe three hours of sleep. I got four today, so uh, Oh, small luxurious. Victories. Yeah, I know. Uh, the day before, I got three hours of sleep. So, oh. <laughs> you know, it's, you know, it is what it is, though. You know, we that that's kind of why I was, I, I was a little... Little, not necessarily hangry, but I mean, I was I was not a hundred percent earlier today, so I'm I'm okay now. I'm decent. Uh, we and we appreciate you being here, nonetheless. No, I appreciate you being here, Verb. I am very very grateful because if it weren't for you being here, we wouldn't have production at the quality as we as we do, and I wouldn't have had the chance to take a break. Hmm. Yeah, like a, a rotating desk is always good. Like I've they've been like you've been, I imagine, part of tournaments where it's just a two man desk the whole time. You can't get a break. Mm -hmm. It's ugh, the worst. Pretty much. I mean, it's not, it's, 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 as long as we get, you get a break at some point in time in which, you know, we've kind of started, like, you kind of made, actually made the initiative on that. So, like, all right, we're going to start doing this break at whatever time during the tournament, caster's break, and it works out for your voice and, and for mm. uh, your mind and whatnot, which is good. And, of course, uh, not to mention that you have the talents that you do. I uh, mentioned earlier, like your produ the production that you bring and all that good Aww. stuff. But the talent that you bring here is awesome. I always love to ha have you on the desk. Oh, you make me blush. I'm just telling the truth, man. Tell me, where's the eye? It's Come definitely on. not with me. That's for sure. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> Unless though, it's a four man team. There's no sub. So yeah, Normie is one of the people there. And so is Antonio, so is Immortal, so is Living. Here we are. So yeah, we should have a game hopefully up soon. So we're just going to be vibing for a little bit. Clock has started. Damn. Man, you're gassing me up right now. Oh. Just love everywhere. Someone cleaned up. Love everywhere. That's why this community is brilliant. Such good. Such good. Gauzy is on the game of juice. I mean, I'm drinking some orange juice right now, so I'm on some juice. Definitely juice, less gamer. Like if he was, uh, if he was chugging juice. Red Bulls, then that would be gamer juice. I had some Zoa earlier. <laughs> um, that's what I. That's the. Ah. That's the only energy drink that I endorse. Not sponsored or anything. Like it's got no sugar and stuff, so it's like that's a big thing for me. I don't like sugar. No love, only hate. Thank you, Nutella, for bringing us back into it, balance. No, no, with no, the no. Force. Here's. It's it's it's. They hate to love us. Ah. That's what it is. Well, you hang hate on a minute. to love it. Hang on a minute. Objection, Your Honor. If no love, <laughs> only hate, explain Kichu. Explain your adorable cat. Right oh. now. Oh. No one can oh. beat cat. Kichu is part of the Ferrara community, damn it. Normie, hurry up. We're getting into philosophical anyway. topics. You know it's that, that's when it's bad. <laughs> Let well, as in. a reminder to everybody, uh, there is a, this is this tournament is not just for bragging rights. There is steel on the line, and we have a pool of about 340k that's going to be split up against the first three teams. 
And additionally, this is for data, invaluable data for ourselves, the community, and the dev team. So again, a thank you to everybody for being here, not just watching, but also participating. And Verbalocity has it up here. What are the three that we have here for the split on this deal? Uh, out of the 340 total, third place is a 40k split, so 10k each per player. Second place is 100k, so 25k per player. And first place is 200,000 steel, so 50k per player. That is Ooh. the split. That's enough for at least... Uh, so for the first and second teams, you can easily get the Unsung Knight hero skin right there just for just for getting it so there you go yeah all of you wardens that don't have it i expect to see you with it afterwards yeah. although i will say like actually like a like stepping back from the hype for a second a lot of us like old heads are like get the skin get the skin because it's the original like night from the first you know that e3 that we watched you know with jason vanderberg yes. walking on stage like we have an emotional yes. attachment to that but the new breed it's been eight years but like they may not actually have that attachment. I feel like this is a great time What's... to bring up Nutella's heartfelt question, says Tyler Not. What question? No love, only hate. Is that the heartfelt question? Is that is that the question? <laughs> yeah, I think we that... answered that already. <laughs> I don't... Explain Kichu. Oh, nunchucks when? Ooh. Yes. Nun... Yes, please. Nunchucks. Nunchuck Absolutely. hero would be sick. <laughs> oh, words are being put in Nutella's mouth, apparently. Of course, it's from it's from Tylenol. How how did we expect anything anything less than? We have a before Nutella goes and shoots Tylenol. We have a game. <laughs> it's about well, it'll probably reset hit stun. You know. <laughs> always on the always on the thematics. Always on point with the I'm thematics. I'm just, I'm just here to bullshit, Burb. That's, that's, yeah. that's, I have one job, and it's to, it's to throw everybody off. Speaking of throwing people off, we have a new game to start off with that we're going to throw at you right now. And we've got, uh, Gobla Gang versus Kazuya Mishima. Compositions are looking good. We do have, I was about to say Peacekeeper, but no, it's the Shinobi. That, ever since they introduced that cosmetic a while back of that hood, that has messed with me. I always assume on first glance that that's a Peacekeeper, but no, it's a Shinobi. And I find that one to kick me in the face. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's... <laughs> uh, uh, Burb, I wasn't, ex I, w I didn't see that one coming at all. Yeah, it's a Shinobi, they're stealthy. But Antonio! Speak! Oh, here we go. Kanada. On the opposite Shinobi, the Undodgeable will be tracked heavily, but Antonio has to veer away onto V-Ray. That Ocelot. Ocelot, had, like you know, you mentioned earlier, Norgoz, is having some troubles in TG in theory. Oh, Antonio having none, however, using the Superior Guard on Dodge to get around that. We'll talk about that Ocelot problem in a moment. Zoom, and here, here comes the game. See? Here we go. Oh, they could have landed. Oh, they did. They See, the funny thing though. is on Jean Hu because you cut heavy lock. So what you need to do on. Or what you need. I, I don't even know what the interaction here is because before, you need to land the finisher heavy on Jean Hu for the heavy hit stun to confirm. Mm -hmm. And. I think that one still works. I think that one is actually unaffected. Because hmm. uh... Jean Hu is the, the one hero where you can dodge the. Uh, the chain, like the un uh, the unblockable. Ah, okay. So we'll see. Well, isn't isn't the timing of that where you know you're still trying to catch them in the pin, so to speak, coming off of the the hug? Though, isn't that kind of? I don't know. Maybe I I don't. Maybe I'm thinking wrong. To be honest, I'm not sure whether you can land an attack on the wake up, a blockable attack. So I'm not sure. We'll see. I hope they test it, or maybe they're trying it out now. Mm. Be right. There what is. is that hug? It tracked it right at the Good end tracking. of the dodge. Let's go. Mortal because going Living up. is yep. happy being able to play. His, oh, one of his favorite characters there again. Oh, the the gentleman's agreement is out the window again. You love to see the tier one from Ocelot, the unique tier one. We all love to see it because why? Because reasons. And however, we don't love to hear it because spectator bug. 
Yes. Pain and suffering. Oh, there's the reset. It doesn't yeah. matter. I'm so uh, looks like a mortal and tried to dodge backwards and got caught and killed. Little bit of a, a Oliver analysis of a game, prepare for shenanigans, but I'm getting a feeling the characters that have like essentially alpha damage, high first damage hits, might be a solution through the, uh, or at least a new way to uh, go around a post TG world because Kito Kiri, mm. oh. at least Tito Kiri, charged heavy, seems to be doing rather oh. well. What is that tracking? This is really interesting, bro. I was going to point out that Zoom has their tier three already, and it's really interesting that they pop their tier two, really good timing on the tier two, and being able to get that super armor, they can sh shut down one of the gamers in that team fight, and they did that twice. They got a hug off of it, and the teammate couldn't do anything. Love to see it. Good decisions. Zoom gets... They're stalling for the life now. Uh, damn it, Windows, I appreciate you trying to uh, help with my vision, but do not put the piss filter on during the stream. Ooh. Thank you. Oh, Ooh, yeah. Zoom coming out on top here. Almost tier four. Going to have it in just a few moments here. Really, really solid get play here from Zoom. Yeah, living is Wait, wait, which one? Who's Zoom? Which one's Zoom? That's living. Apparently. Living. Okay, there we go. That explains a lot. That, that explains a lot. <laughs> Please I didn't know that attack. was his new name. Please no. drop attack. Ah, oh, coward. Understandable. It's Overwatch, but coward. Oh, Normie not going back to heal yet. Said I've still got something to add. Ow. <laughs> nice knowing you. It's a death, apparently, unfortunately, but... <clears throat> D-Ray's not going to get... Oh, no, he does have a teammate there, but it's going to get Venge, and he's going to die. Not getting out. Antonio gets a full combo punish, and <laughs> just... <laughs> Living's like an attack dog oh, right now. Up. Wow. I'm surprised that scooped him up. That's... I thought I would just, like, he'd bounce off, but no. He scooped him yeah, up there from the floor. Yeah, the wake up. Caught him on the wake up. It's wild. That is the first time I've legitimately seen someone get scooped in, like, the FGC, like, vernacular, but in For Honor. Off the ground, like that? Wow. I hope somebody slashed markers that I want to see. I want to see that in post. What in the world is happening? Oh, he's trying to get away because it's really close to breaking. Oh, yeah. That's uh, quick. Oh, he gets the hug anyway. Living took like, lessons from Marco anyway. Yolo, apparently. Full hug banditry. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, shot no, him in the <laughs> He shot him in the back. Tier, four, tier two to tier four. Yeah. Wait. It's juggy. Tier four. Uh huh. Juggy, juggy, juggy. They're going to get that uh, point. Let's see. Uh, it's Ocelot Isn't should be coming any? off in a moment. Yeah. Three. B-Ray. Oh, they got a teammate there. B-Ray spawned and immediately died. And now it's going to be Hanada versus the entirety of the enemy team. Oh, no. Rolled in place. He's going to try to get away as quick as he can. But gets Venge. Could do something here. Could actually. He's got a ledge, but there's the entirety of the enemy team there. Nice knowing you. 1-0 to the gang of goblins. menacing stare yes so how um from what we were able to see from the relatively quick round one any examples of the tg uh it, tg changes coming into effect in the flow of the game there or was that a fairly stat like uh, a game that was not affected by it in your opinions i don't know living just spread the love with all the hugs too much so yeah, many hugs definitely did there were a couple there were no there were a couple times where that did affect there were there were at least two or three ganks that I remember, but I could not place exactly like when they took place. I think that both involved uh, Shinobi and uh, Shigoki, and I think yeah. one was maybe Shinobi Jean Who. Shinobi was involved in both. Yeah, Shinobi's a big one. I mean, Shinobi's that. that I mean, it, this this TG is definitely going to be affecting Shinobi. Probably, I don't know if I would say the most, but I would say you know definitely really high impact to that particular character because right now it has such a strong. Hit stun, that's pretty much the go-to for gank setups. It, they can set up ganks with pretty much every hero in the game. And in a lot of cases, you know, you can even get like a triple heavy off of uh, heroes that reset to neutral that only have a two-hit combo. They reset to neutral as part of the gank to get the third heavy out of it. It's kind of it's kind of wild. Yeah, because it was the ranged heavy that did mm. the resetting. Mm -hmm. So the whole setup might be weirder than we think. Mm. 
investigation will be required like and i imagine yes. once yes. this tg actually drops <coughs> excuse me properly That'll be when really pe people start diving in. No, that was not an electric wind god fist, Noel. If that was the, if people started doing actual electrics in For Honor, that is when we need to panic. But looks like we don't have an eye yet. So of course, as soon as I click away to uh, show something, that that's going to happen. But we can go look at the uh, the actual testing grounds to see what moves specifically were affected for each character. And yeah, as you were saying, Goz, Shinobi got affected has the most amount of moves, I think, out of the entire list. Yeah, Yorm has one, Yorm. two, three, four, five, six. One, two, Very three, close. four, five, six, seven yeah. moves. I think those two are the two that has the, the, the longest list of changes. That's why I mentioned that while Yorm is not in the meta, their kit is drastically being changed and adjusted as part of this TG. Like the heavy finishers, uh, the... Um, it's gonna... is a big change because that is something that I, again, it's not meta, but there is a 100 to 0 gank that was pre and post nerf of, what is it, Storm Rush that was adjusted on Orochi, where mm. basically you can do 100 to 0 gank if you land a bash for Yorm and setting up for the Orochi. It's 100 to 0 gank. There's literally nothing that those players can do. But now with the hit stun being, not being able to be reset from that finisher on Yorm, that gank should not work anymore. Should See, be the keyword. Look at that. Should. So what? Living stopped with giving out love. He's shown the cold shoulder now. Oh, no hugs. No hugs. I'm sad. And I, I take back what I said earlier. No, that is Ray. That's Ray. <laughs> I, now that I've had my food, that's Ray. Yeah. Hmm. I'm mad. That's I don't Ray. see no wild berry crunch characters today. Yeah, I don't think. Um, We'll be seeing any wild berry crunch characters. Is that uh, is that a reference to Bean's horrible fashion, or is that a reference to someone else? The berry crunch characters. Mm, isn't I mean, isn't that like Havoc's go-to right now? Oh, oh wait, does Havoc rock like the deliberately like polka dot bad fashion? No, I mean we're. Attackers captured. Are we talking about different things now? We're we talking about the like the wild berries, the new uh, rep eighty material. Oh, I did forgot that was the name. I just called that hot pink. I thought uh, I was completely lost to be yeah, honest. Yeah, I was lost <laughs> on that too. I forgot its name was Wild Berry. Like, no, 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 no. It is not. Look, I don't care what they put it as. It's called Mangenta. Thank you. Okay, thank you. I, no. I refuse to recall it anything else. I don't have any characters at Rep 80, so I don't know the name of the cosmetics. Note to self, and I need to grind my cosmetics names, my commentary knowledge. <laughs> Ugh. Oh man, I tell you this, Kanata sit there and did the uh, uh, max delayed lights on the pin, had long enough time for their, for a minion to come in and try and help. Not really sure if it helped or hurt. They oh. got Venge, but they're not going to be able to get, go very far with it. And there we see their hit stun got reset. Well, yeah, they should have. It was a hit stun yeah, reset because they, they just bashed out, out of the hit. Out. I got so confused. Yeah, yeah. that John Hu light there did, I don't know, like three damage or something. Mm. <laughs> but wasn't, uh, not John Hu, JJ. Wait. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, but I guess it was enough. But yeah, this was yeah, I mean, very much. Oh, oh, Lord, that's enough too. That one's an HD. Mm. Antonio having none of it. <laughs> <laughs> Actually fighting? Cringe. How dare you? Get me out of here, says Antonio. And now we're back Excellent to the Excellent stamina management from the pirate, by the way. Ooh. And. And Antonio, amazing because he gets the tier one pop off of the uh, bounty hunter off of the kill, so he gets to stamp right back, even though he was out of it when he did the the, the dash heavy. Oh, what? oh, oh, is that okay? I'll, I'll is shut up. I was about to say, oh, yeah. why is no, he not pressing heavy? Speak. That goes back too, I guess. He did, He's uh, trying to get the XE. Yeah. Ah, okay. XE fishing. So yeah, sometimes you can optimize those off the ground hits for an XE. Nice bash. Yep. Just the uh, the tier three just has infinite range. I'm sorry. Are they are they giving a little something something to V Ray here? I feel like there's something going on here behind the scenes. Hmm. <laughs> are you suggesting that our players <laughs> are being bribed? <laughs> no, I'm I'm <laughs> suggesting that there might be a little bit of team hacking going on there. Oh, I see. Normie. Beware. Drop attack is not really something to worry about. Most of Kazuya Mishima are dead. 
appropriate considering. Oh wait, no, that's a hatching instrument. Never mind. My lord. Although actually, I say that. Look up there, V-Ray. If V-Ray kills a mortalum, he could go for a drop. But I think the rest of them saw that. Normie and Antonio fight for who goes up the ladder. Meanwhile, Living finishes off Canada on his own. And now we're having a fight under the blue dome here. It seems. We do, and now, well, they're still ganking someone down there. Normie and and, and Living are. But I was thinking that I was gonna see we were gonna see Normie come up and pop their tier one, given there were more players up there. But the looks like rhythm yeah. pop rotated in there. They did lose. They did lose C, but that's only I think it's only delaying the inevitable. At this oh, the oh, fire! Oh, no. getting fire hecked. That well, what we saw actually, was a bash confirm again and led into like. No. Freeze is trying to explain something. Sorry. Sorry, Chris. <laughs> Please continue. <laughs> uh, oh, no, I made was... the point. Ah, fair. So, speaking of fire, I think that that's something that's going to be interesting. So, an example of how, like, hit stuns are changing and whatnot. Is the hit stun going to be adjusted for the fire? Hmm. Interesting question, because from what they talked about on stream, they're having to go through each individual character, like, moves and change the flags and whatnot on them. That's why it apparently took so long. Are they going to ch change environmental, like, flags for that? Mm -hmm. That's, a, that's still, a very good point. There's still a clip of Old Shinobi uh, where the, like, Old Shinobi comes in on High Fort in the middle against the Warlord, and they're using, you know, Old Shinobi with they had the range attack, and basically 100 to 0 is the Warlord. And, to, and there's nothing the Warlord can do because they get bounced off of the fire into another, uh, another ranged attack, and it was just ridiculous. Yeah, I think the fire is a reset, isn't it? I believe so... it hits you. I mean, you get, you get, you get the. I, I think you effectively get the second hit stun rule during, during like, as, during the bounce or whatever, during whatever window it is. But shortly after, yeah, it's 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 back to normal. Something for I'm a honestly, video sure. question mark, Mister Freeze? Yeah, we should, we should test that. Hmm. At that point, isn't that your clip? <gasps> Ghost. I wasn't gonna call, I wasn't gonna say <laughs> that, but you know, yes, it's 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 like I was trying to be like modest that it's uh ah. I guess modest isn't actually the appropriate word here. I wasn't trying to I wasn't trying to you know plug or anything, but yeah, it's modest. <laughs> yeah, you can find it. It's I am the warlord that was being discussed. I was very very angry at you because you'll be able to tell. <laughs> hmm. All right, Antonio, got to be a little bit aware. Got to be a little bit aware of what's going on there. Last man standing, V-Ray, do what you can. You have a mission to disable your notification. I'm aware, thank you. Ugh, God, you do love people like that. One moment, folks. Mm. But yeah, that will be 2-0 to the Goblin Gang. I'm pretty sure there's also an account that's not going to exist in a while. Indeed. Probably not. So... Out of that game, we did see a couple interactions. I did see one with Normie uh, having a damage reduction off of a shin kick. Now that we're like two rounds in, what are you guys thinking about at least initially here with the TG? Do you guys think it's very, uh, there's actually going to be a lot of meat to this? Or do you think it's not really affected the flow of the game? I think it's affected it quite a, quite a bit already. Mm -hmm. We've seen a lot I of... Agree ganks not happening or the players being scared to do the ones they practiced in the past mm. i think this it's not really a transition just yet but we're in a phase where they're still trying to figure things out i mean it's what thursday saturday today so i don't know how much they practiced how much they tested so i think they're using this a tournament as a test just like we do yeah but we've seen some of the effects already quite significantly i believe it may sl i think it's going to slow down in, in scenarios where you're you're just 2v1 i think that that's going to slow down the the gank setups and whatnot it's going to allow for more stalls just by default because you're not going to be able to just spam buttons not necessarily spam buttons but i mean you're not going to be able to like you know just keep pushing the ganks indefinitely you're going to eventually give the players revenge if you keep doing that because you're not getting getting the you're not going to be getting that damage that you normally would have prior to these changes. So I think we're absolutely seeing. I 100 agree with Freeze. It's having a drastic impact. Now the question is is whether or not there's any other things that need to be tweaked or adjusted 
And so far, I don't think that I have personally seen anything that it's like game breaking. You know, we compare and when I say game breaking, like comparing that to the, the dodge changes that took place where guard goes away and whatnot with that one until you go went to full population. We didn't see the effects of that where your best option in an anti gank may have been to dodge and you just get hit stunned to death because your best option is to dodge and gamers are tagging you while that's happening. And then, then you're kind of, you have no recourse for, for that type of uh, death ball, if you will, or gank or whatever it may be, happen to be in that scenario. I'm not seeing anything like that with this. Uh, as of yet, it seems like this is something that, that fits pretty well. And I don't, I mean, if they put it in today, I don't think, you know, but like Free said, you know, we're, we still want to see what this is and, and get more testing in with it, I think, before anything's like finalized or whatnot. So this is a good start. You know, we'll see what happens throughout the week. Yeah. What game like should we look at next? Before. What are we thinking? Oh. Sorry to hop in real quick, but what are we thinking for the next gang? <laughs> Goblin Gang and Mostly Machine are both done. Hotspot, Donut, Glazers, um, Miasma, Deep Purple, Pink Underwear, and Sub Struggle, WTF. I think the Purple Pink. Purple, uh, Purple Pink. Ooh, I like it. Purple Pink. All right, continue. I just wanted to get a game going. What did I s Oh, yeah. You uh, to say. What we pointed out before is like a revenge gain on some moves need to be adjusted. Mm hmm. But, yeah, I think you were specifically mentioned like uh, like the pirate gun. You were talking uh, yeah. about it a while, we were, like right after we mentioned the pirate gunshot and whatnot. And I think you're 100% exactly. right that you'll they'll definitely need to make adjustments on like some of the pinning moves that like Shinobi's pin. Exactly. Uh, the, the same thing the with uh, I think Glad's and then uh, pirates uh, gunshots and whatnot. So there's definitely going to be those that they'll have to make adjustments on. Yeah, the moves that got basically uh, I don't know bandage nerfed. Mm -hmm. Like a band-aid fix by increasing the revenge feeding of, of a specific move. Those just, first of all, need to be reverted and then reassessed. Maybe even lowered further. We'll see. But yeah, that's a, that's a work in progress, but also yeah. needs to be seen in-game. How much does it affect it or all of a sudden do new 100 to 0 loops pop up with it? So yeah, we'll see. Yeah, it's a huge it, it, you're right with that what that questions that that raises it's a huge amount of variance on all of those things and every time there's there's these big undertakings of of changes we can all we always see something that uh the that we don't nor, that we don't see on paper until it actually gets into the game all right we don't know the score line for this game specifically unless they chose to start on overwatch people are asleep Noldless mm. first, and Baby Nate is still sleeping. <laughs> oh! I thought you were being better for actually asleep at the wheel. Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh dear, that's not going to be good. Let's come back here and see how that affects the team fight. Sicario on the Ocelot. Let's follow along with them for the time being. Not able to stop the dash cancels of the Janhu. Now only gets the guard break in. Baby Nate finally arrives. Looks like no ca big casualty sustained yet. Casualties, no, but big team fight here on C. Everybody's here. It is a battle royale. It's, it's almost like a Royal Rumble that's going on here. The first to draw blood is going to be Sicario, and they're also immediately going to get dropped by Game Curse. Game Curse being a sort of a bit of a fan favorite among the casters here right now. Speaking of fan Jeez. favorite, he's in a 1v2, 1v3 scenario. Just needs to get a little bit of venge, but instead, they're not going to gank him, not going to feed the venge, and he's going to get dropped. They're going to get dropped. It's gone. It's over with. Okay. F for them in the chat. C A oh. taken by Pink Underwear Defenders Revenge. Miasma Deep Purple have control of mid, but Orlando and Sicario looking to make quick work of that. So I think Miasma Deep Purple are going to wait and mm. regroup, hopefully. Let's remind everybody why Miasma had mid for so long. Because somebody was asleep. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like, no, we're, not gonna, we're not gonna name names. Generated by one guy just being like 10 seconds late. Yeah, like, this isn't a tournament. This isn't Into the Fray. This isn't Dual Frenzy. This isn't Dom Series. But, like, come on! Yeah. At least be present. <laughs> Good reads from Mortimer. Ow. It's not gonna matter, though. They're putting themselves into a situation where Pirate is now available and they have now 
died and they have now lost their eyes. They're going to come back and they're just going to be like walking around looking for, uh, you know, listening to the sounds of, of their other teammates dying. Like Orlando Crusher has now gotten dropped. Game Curse is going to drop though too. I'm I'm just cursing everybody. I don't I don't know. I'm going back to, to eating, I guess. Yes. Eld Eldritch curses fall from thine mouth. How dare you? Another I mean, team we do see. I was just, just going to briefly mention, we do see a, 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 a very large point lead with uh, for the Pink Underwear gang. Oh, yes, that is a fair point. They are starting to not blow ahead, but they're starting to build that lead with a second effective team wipe on the map. Looking for a third here, if they can begin it by killing off yeah. Pilgrim, which they do. Gain Cursed and Mortezma against Baby Nator and Sicario in the mid lane. Excellent Shifu stance by Game Curse, however, gets parried and is going to eat a full charge heavy from Baby Nator. Did a minion block him there? Maybe. I was warned this. I see now where their teammate went to. Looked like they were trying to go up to. Look at Modulus was trying to get up to A point, but Sicario and Orlando stopped them. They didn't. Oh no. They did not Honey, get, get to where they there. were going. Shinobi, yeah. get out of there. You don't, you don't want to be in there, my friend. Even with the third hit stun changes reducing damage, you're still going to get blitzed in that scenario with a back up against the wall. And now mm. we're getting into a little bit of an unfortunate place, which I call a Noah's Ark, where team just kind of starts going in two by two, hurrah, hurrah. They need to regroup yep. as a full force. Uh, they do. They've got nowhere to heal. Uh, Miyazo Deep Purple is in a scenario where they can't heal anything. You know, they need to see about getting some mid and getting uh, one of these side points. Looks like they're going to be pushing towards C. Uh, yes, two on one scenario forming at C point. Babinator knows that that's what's going on. Uh, they do have righteous deflection, so if they get some parries, they can get some extra damage reduction as long as with well the boom done. right there. We're seeing the hit stun reset. Revenge is here, and now we're off to the races, Ferb. Modolus low on HP because of the gunshot bounce courtesy of I pop balloons, but I pop balloons agreeing to I popping shit the enemy. Yeah, words hard. The English language in my brain, apparently. <laughs> I pop balloons, gonna actually keep it a lot simpler than I did, and get key eyed by Pilgrim. Uh, Smoke bomb. Oh, but gets interrupted instead. Not. Ah, uh, I think is that what just off on the coordination there? Yeah. Like there, was no, there, there was no damage. Walk the plank, but mm -hmm. Lone's just GB'd instead. They could have killed him a little bit quicker, but that is just... That happens. That happens. It's fine. But yeah, oh. what we keep oh. seeing here for Pirate, hmm? they are... Conf they're basically... Oh, if oh. I understand it right... Fire. Not, fire. Fire. <laughs> they got what bounced they're twice. Is they're resetting hit stun on purpose to <laughs> confirm <laughs> Walk the Plank. I'm so sorry, Freeze. That's actually a legitimately good bit of knowledge and analysis, funny. but just with funny fire stuns going on in the background. <laughs> I know, I sort of force everything in there. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> oh, there he is again. You, you gotta fire! Love, you gotta love the, the dichotomy between... Oh, sorry, the disparate tone Wait, between what's it? going on on screen and what's going on in the ears. Get out of there, Orlando, Tier please! Two? No? Okay. Ah, I, uh, I think that they were waiting to pop their tier two as soon as Vinge got, got, got away, but they had an out, so they took it. Yeah, Pilgrim's gonna get rotated on 3v1. Pirate doesn't matter though if they can kill you on the one. Oh, he comes the Ocelot. Sprinting heavy. But don't... Speaking of Pirate, it's not gonna matter if they get bid. Yeah. Yeah, that mid doesn't matter. Not at this point, unfortunately. Corner, there's no fire in this corner. Oh my god! Oh no, I'm sorry. I I thought that the I saw the plunge happen. Yeah. Mm. And I and immediately they're in an execution. I was like, wait, wait a minute. Yeah. Oh no, different, there different player. As well. Stealth different patch. player. I'd have been like, that would have been epic if they had actually would have been possible. <laughs> Imagine They're if like, they yeah, actually did that. Like, being able to execute off a drop attack? Bruh. That would be, that would be very interesting. That. Actually, a good good change. Yeah. I'd be down for that. That would have been very cool. Oh yeah, we implement, so uh, we have uh, decided to adjust hit stun rules in order to compensate. We have added executions on drop attacks. I could see some shenanigans happening as a result of that. Like, entire Hito Kiri playstyles being based on hitting people with the tier 2 and then just waiting to get a confirmed drop off a guard break to help your team. Just bomb healing. Become the, uh, become the Griffin tier 4. Alright, do we have a confirmation on the stat line for that game? Because that was a game we kind of came in blind on. Uh, mostly machine have finished off the greenhorns. Half, Nothing Half yet. thank you. 
Yeah. Are we just have hotspot gaming against donut glazers now? Yeah, we don't have. Oh, a what's that? We don't have oh, yeah, confirmation don't on this yet. Might have been a one or one. Yeah. Yeah. I've got uh, an eye on Mortezma because Mortezma is my target going into this. Yeah, because Mortezma is on uh, my asthma. So if we see an eye pop up, we'll know. So we got a little bit of time. My TND would fit right in with their fashion. Ah, lobster. Do you have a? Uh, do you? Are you talking about the the purple or the pink? I imagine the purple. Going by the timestamp. Uh, oh, bracket link. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, the bot is apparently on holiday right now. So uh, let me get you a bra like a fresh bracket link. Da -da 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 uh, sorry about lateness. Bot is kind of dead. There you go. There's the bot link. Oh, there is the bracket link. Unfortunately, uh, I guess, uh, you know, bots just have to have their own day off and... Apparently. We, uh, yeah, it's just the way it, it's just the way it goes. We can't, uh, you know, we have to, to give them their, their day off or... I, will, I was about to make a joke about do bots have rights, but then that's how I die in the, uh, in the, in the uprising. I have to be, exactly. I have to say thank you I, to my Alexa. I, I thought about it and I was like, yeah, yeah, I also, I too want to live in the, uh, post-apocalyptic world. Where all art is AI, and oh, God. the bots will inspect you. I'm, you know, honestly, like not to delve too deep into that, but you know, we've seen like like the whole Twitter Twitter X get all these responses that are all like basically the same or slightly slight variations. Those are clearly like bots and whatnot. And I started mm. thinking to myself, you know, before too long, we're gonna see that AI get translated into that. All social media, probably even Twitch and YouTube chats and everything, are gonna start seeing more and more and more accounts randomly pop up that have that kind of thing happen where AI is just in there interacting and it's just fake and whatnot. It's already a problem in various uh, various places. I think it's just only going to get worse. Something, something cat in bio. Mm. Oh, God. <laughs> I wasn't even... Uh, that... Yeah, yeah. I, I meant more as like an interactive like kind of thing. Not... But, I but went for yes, the blatant because yes. that's the one my like I see my messages get hammered with. As soon as yep. any tweet of mine gets a mild bit of interaction, it's just the weird, funny like spam bots come in. I I could rant yep. about that all day, and we mm. might have to if we don't get an eye soon. Come on, play teams. Give me an eye, or give us an eye, or give us a score report. Give us something. We need one of the two, please. Refresh the link. Nope, still nothing. And we don't have an eye either. Should we consider hopping to another game, or are we going to chill here for the full set? You reckon? Should we be patient, or should we switch? Do we even have the option? I mean, is the uh, the the should we? I think we should check the eyeball to see if there's an eyeball first, and then yeah, Space Monkey and LOF. I'm not sure. If I might have people. Uh, still no eye on here. Let me see if I've got anyone from those teams. Uh. I say that I literally just checked Hotspot Donut and I immediately forget who's on their team. I have excellent memory. Space Let's see. Let me Monkey, see Post, if I can pull up I my Jupiter, LOF. Brackets. Brackets. All right, so, and yeah. Uh, oh, I have, I have an eye on Space one. Monkey and it's fake. Oh, I'm annoyed. No. I lit hang on, ah. let me refresh. It's got a fake eye on Space Monkey. Okay, so whatever they're doing, that's not something we can watch right now. They're uh, scrimming. Oh, they're scrimming. I'm joking. You need to have patience. They're <laughs> scrimming. Please don't. You're gonna get. You're gonna give me a heart attack. Please. <laughs> like I already the had call a heart back. I, I, <laughs> old call Lord. back to Light Boogie's tournament where he's he spectate the scrim. He's like, wait, what? This is a scrim. What do you mean? It's a Oh, I hope both both teams. I, this is this this sucks. Both teams suck. I hope they both lose. If you've ever <laughs> wanted, one I'd see. if you've ever wanted oh. to see what it looks like for admins behind the scenes, go back and find the old light boogie tournaments because he admined and produced and commentated them at the same yep. time. The absolute madman. And on that day, you got to see what we sometimes <laughs> get the pleasure of hearing <laughs> behind closed doors, which is just. <laughs> Oh boy! <laughs> just, just blatant, just, just, just Rage. genuine frustration, and like it was hilarious because Light Boogie is one of the most genuinely nice people that you'll ever encounter, and to 
to it was just hilarious because he just let it all hang out like screw it everybody sucks this is stupid like i mean that's not what he was saying but that that was the gin that was the uh that was the, the, gist. the premise is like yeah that was the gist of that was the feeling yeah that was the emotion at that point all right and i felt it uh, it, was, was it was visceral though. it was hilarious all right we have a game we have I, I, either game two or game three in the set. We don't know for sure because they haven't reported. Yeah. Please actually update live for the sake of the admins. That is a yeah. pimped out warden over there. The, the Green Knight Warden. I Ooh. love it. That's yeah, really I kinda, cool. Yeah, I kind of like that too. Yeah, actually. Oh, the... wait a minute. Wait, is that Reptile? <laughs> is, is that, that Reptile Rep Warden? Is that Rep... Is it? Is it? Is it? Does is reptile, that reptile Warden? Handle? Maybe? I was just about to comment on the sword, actually, like matching. Yeah, it's like it's actually kind of drippy. I like I like the setup that my asthma deep purple is consistently rocking. It's dog in the in the chat. Oh, is I want to I want to hear his commentary on it. Oh no! All right, here we go. We've got us a game. This is game three. Thank you. Oh, right, dog. I want to hear your commentary on the green green. Arms have copper trim, Does zero out of ten. Together? Oh, hang on a minute, we gotta we gotta we gotta give Doug an appropriate view. Uh Doug. Is this <laughs> copper? Eh, it's like bronzy copper. I think it works. It's yeah. good fashion. We have a yeah. gank though. What's going on over here? Pirate Hido versus Pirate Shin Shinbomb. Team fight for A. C's already been captured by the pink underwear revenge gang. Right now they need to get I mean they're just a one team fight away from getting A as well. But Venge is getting fed by Baby Nader. Mm. That's the Pilgrim. Do it. I like the peel there actually from Baby. Pop could have been kicked down the pit from that shallow angle if not for Baby interrupting. That was a nice heads up play. Pop. I couldn't stop the exit there. Yeah, good kill. Yeah, by I Pop. think they made the. They had to make. They stopped themselves. Made the conscious decision not to because they would have been in a. Uh, they may have been in a worse scenario if they'd have done that. And that's At a team wipe, played. by the way. Ooh, yep. you're wow, right. Starting off strong. Good little first engage by the pink underwear revenge gang. I'm just putting gang in there because you. That's actually a really good little extra bit. So just saying yeah. pink underwear revenge, I could just go. I don't know, I guess, pink underwear revenge exclamation mark, technically. But that doesn't quite work. Uh, I was gonna, I was gonna like just throw random other like, uh, you know, um, things at the wall. Yeah, they like colon, semicolon, <laughs> HTTPS, punctuation. That's a punctuation. I had to think for a moment. Yeah. For the refined folk in the crowd, shout out to the Interrobang, the underrated English grammar. Or punctuation. Big damage right here. Big punish there from the revenge. You're getting thrown on the ground. Pilgrim's still in it though. Oh, nice. They'd have realized they might have been able to add a light. Probably wouldn't have been enough to kill, but. 3v2 now. Make that 2v, uh, 2v1. Never mind. Is what the other pirate runs away. Oh. Careful. Sicario and Orlando need to watch models flailing armor. They gotta play it safe instead. They can get the kill, and the score line is starting to run away a little bit. Their hard points are maybe 200 difference, but the with the soft points, it's definitely moving very quickly. Mid gives you a lot, and they've got both A and C, and A and C were also being stat, were being boosted there for a moment. How is this one-to-one? -one? That's what the admin said, uh, Mona Lisa. Apparently this is the third game in the set, not the second. Anything else that is purely Ooh. speculation. Ooh! Nice heavy. decision. Yeah. What happened there? The teammate didn't catch on, feel for him in time. But yeah, becoming more and more a fan of Game Coast. I just saw two drop attacks in the background like it was nothing. Like Orlando killed Pilgrim, but uh, Model has killed Orlando while Sicario was actually in the 1v1 against Mortezma. If Sicario can delay here, along with Baby, it can give the team enough time to, re uh, to regroup themselves and secure the rest of the map. Let's actually cut for a sec. 
Uh, Pops in a 1v1, but we're more concentrating on uh, actual ganks in this particular show today. So let's have a look at the gank here on Modelless. It's like he was trying to confirm with a light, but Modelless was not happening. He just got away. Oh, there's the reset. Uh, that would have killed without for the uh, testing grounds. Baby? Where are you going, baby? It's just... I don't know what's baby? the thought process here. Just decided to have a vacation. Oh, maybe just wants to buy more time. Didn't realize that the shinobi was coming along till it was too late. This is a stalling uh, effort now, effectively. Oh, oh my lord! Oh, there it is! The TG change! The reduced damage on the shinobi follow-up light meant the revenge came through. They oh. have buys more time. Potentially could have came out on top of that, potentially, but uh, that still was enough to stall almost long enough for their teammates to get here. They did lose A here, but this is, uh, they decided, oh, we're already here, we'll go for it, who cares? Hmm. Stop the point gen of the enemy team. Pilligren, low HP, gotta be a bit aware, smoke bomb goes down. There it is. The trick Ooh. shot in chain, good pirate stuff. They're utilizing the unique selling point of the pirate, that is gun in chain. And now John, who's gonna drop? That's gonna be two kills for I pop balloons. Not only do they pop balloons, but they also pop modeless. And that is gonna be three kills for the pirate. They're gonna get their tier four. I'm trying to figure out if it's modeless, modelless, or modelless, like the drink. Answers on a postcard, please. Unless oh, maybe it's sure. modelless. Maybe it's like, you know, um... M-O-D-E-L-E-S-S-S. -S -S. Model. Model. Yeah, I think, mo I think it might be modelless. Mo modelless as in like, you know, model as in like they want models, but they can't get models. It's kind of like a play on Elden Ring, you know, uh, no healers. I don't know, just... Maybe, I don't know. Well, uh, they, made, this is yeah, why made, they should have easy it. names. Give us made easier them, names no. and we wouldn't mess them up. Baby Nader trying to go for the heavies. Not able to get it. Watch that revenge game. Oh, goes down nonetheless. <gasps> Miscommunication. Malfunction at the junction. Ah. Uh, oh. oh, unfortunate. Still in dodge recovery. Just barely. But yeah, I think, I no, I think the name thing, I think that's a skill issue. Yeah, um, unfortunate. Ooh. Thought we'd see a bench hit. No, that's it. That's it, right there, yeah. I'll take a Modelo, it's five o'clock somewhere. Pharaoh's hey. out here to drink. Hey man, don't don't tempt me. I got beer today, okay? I, I have it. It's available, all right? Oh, yeah, it same. is an option. <laughs> you both of you just gonna stop drinking. <laughs> I've got freeze, freeze, I got some Francis Cotter. I got one for you too. I just got you some know? local one. There you go. I got that and I uh, got some per Peroni. That's an Italian one. Let me actually put one in the in the fridge. Hang on. Excellent. My man. <laughs> so by round by round four, <laughs> by round four, this is gonna get real exciting. <laughs> <laughs> Unsung night. I, look, I I I know that I I know that we, I keep talking about this, but like I, we come back to the title screen, and I just I I really like the hero skin. I it's genuinely just a do. good skin. It just actually really it's is. cold really enough is. in my hallway. I can drink it right away. Hmm. We'll be like this till the game is restarted. Ah, okay, it's a me issue. In right. that case, let me very quickly fix that since I have the opportunity. Let me plop it. Thank you, thank you for, <laughs> thank you for the heads up. Jesus, There we go. Does he make them or throw them? <laughs> Call back to his last message. Oh, hang on. What exactly is a baby? Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> that Tylenol. Oh, we shouldn't encourage him. Really shouldn't. What the, who let this man's in here? Who you know what? It, we need we need to get we need to go ahead and get the uh, get get uh, the sub status for the channel. That way, that when when Tylenol does this, I can tell him to bribe us with subs. <laughs> oh, that's Lagavulin. Oh, oh okay. is I pop balloons Lagavulin? Okay, good to know. Oh, good to know. All right, let me put on the whack on the old uh, backup music while the game is rebooting. Should be here soonish. Why so many people change their names every 30 days like a prepaid phone? Right? I've been moaning about that for years. And yet they still do it. It never ends. You know, I've been, I know I've said this before and I've talked about it, but I think that it, it, that it would be very beneficial to have a sort of a competitive uh, 
I don't know, um, arc. Kind of like an, what's, I don't know what the term, oh god, what's the terminology I'm looking for? So, an arc, somebody who, who archives things for, an archivist. Uh, yeah, an ar I guess, yes, an archivist. I guess that's the term I'm looking for. Yeah, so an, you know, an archivist for, like, the comp scene. Okay, so this person has this different names. This is the tournaments that they won. This a, is the like name. This is the team. A lore keeper. It would be, it's it's a lot of work, but if you just start from, like, this tournament on or something, and I think that, one, that's either falls on the individual players themselves and or, two, somebody outside that to start doing that uh, for the community. And I'm going to be honest with you, I've, consider, I've seriously considered it myself several different times, but I don't know if I would be able to keep up with all that information. I, I, I like, have the idea, like, how I want to do things, and then I end up, like, overly... Uh, breaking things down into sections and it just would be maybe yeah. overcomplicated. But somebody else getting better... its own Liquipedia essentially would be interesting because mm. a lot of the lore of the game right now is just, it's it's word of mouth. There's a few mm -hmm, clips mm -hmm. here and there that people preserve, but it's like a lot of the lore is word of mouth. It would be nice to have that kind of uh, Liquipedia heads up. Now, this is the final game of or the final set of this uh, <laughs> bit of the Swiss. Do we go in from current or do we go beginning, chaps? Uh, this is the the one of the this last is hot spot donuts. Round? It's one nil to donut glazers. Last we know. Let's do most recent this time. Okay. Let's just yeah, see how far along they are. Because this is probably close to the end of this particular game, and if it's a if it if hot spike wins this one, then oh yeah, they are up it's rather close though. The, the hard yeah, the, points. The hard are points. Even. Yeah. Ooh, but kill wise they are not. And renowned a hot spot is up by a drastic renowned lead. We've got tier four coming off on their, I think that's their JJ, and very close on the behind them is the. Uh, oh, sorry, it's a pirate, and then it's uh, the Shugoki is close to their tier four as well. Up, reset, damage reduction. I believe that would have killed. Good parry. And there's the tier four, just like that. Space Monkey now has their tier four. Their tier three is gone. Asma has no stamina in this team fight. So does the whoever were there was in the background. <laughs> Yeah, hang on a minute. Let me try to get you a better view here, Ch uh, Chief. Lots here of are. things happen. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go throw up now. I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> Most <laughs> observer is drunk. I've been drinking apparently. <laughs> hey. I keyed. I keyed. All right. So we got the tier. Oh yeah. There we go. What? No. 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 Not. Not yet. Not yet. Uh, who is it? Post Moderna is not. Post Moderna is barely at tier three. Or, like is about to get to tier three. Yeah, they got the uh, mid lane, which allowed their team to get out of breaking, which is really good timing. They def they desperately needed it, but now they have nowhere to heal. Mm. A little bit of a yeah. tricky situation. Gank is happening mm -hmm. over he needs here. Needs to do something. Just just needs farming down jump. there, is doing nothing. Yeah, needs to jump quickly. To I think off. at this point. Yeah, they're going up to a point. Uh, oh, no! actually, maybe. No, Two they're still running there. around. Did you see what they're, they're like? Well, they it. are in now yeah. breaking, and they're still... Yeah, they absolutely should have went and jumped. Uh, they absolutely Ooh. deserved the... Uh... Am well, I being proven wrong? Him diddling around there actually allowed him to get the... I wonder. <laughs> they still could have come off a spawn by this point, I think, and, and got them if they'd have, killed, if they'd have jumped hammered. early. He just eat a hammer to the face. Yeah, got hammered by uh, the Yorm. And they, now they, I was gonna say somebody's pro, somebody's around looking for a side point, but it's a little late for that. I think they Almost. can't hold off four people. Pink shirt man has the pink shirt, but it's gonna be staying oh. right here in a moment. Damn! Ooh, I'm nice surprised touch. that actually worked. Hmm. Me too. I don't think that uh, I don't think it was confirmed. That's what I think. I think he just got I the I was not paying attention there. You meant the knockdown from the jewels, right? Yeah, yeah. So much happened yeah. going on. Yeah, I think you're right. I think I don't think that they actually got confirmed. I think it was just. Uh, I think the Shigoki reared back and stopped. It was a chaotic entry to the match, but I'm glad we did uh, took the recommendation from Freeze because yeah, now we are at the end of this round. Yeah, that yeah, is... this will be a the tire. They they just reset hit stun. They're going for the uh, the reset. Yeah, the I need one to check one. who won that. I'm not sure if I got the names the right round. Uh, I Jupiter Pink T S. Uh, yeah, that will be Donut Glazes. That that's a two zero. Yeah, that's two zero. So we're going to the next round. Wait, what? I had the teams the wrong way around. That was my bad. That's 2 0. Was, did you? Oh, did you? Yeah, Space Monkey uh, Space Monkey is oh, on Donut okay. Glazers. You're that was right. how I checked. My bad. You're yeah, right. We, we you are, were right. Let me update the thing, reset the clock. We're going to round three in the round robin. Oh, Swiss. I keep calling it round robin. Round three. <laughs> if it's in the six pack. Wow. <laughs> 
Gazi is an do alcoholic. We have something. Wow. Confirmed, sure. Uh, oh, bracket link as the chat wants. Here is your link, good folk. Verb is drinking. <laughs> yeah, it's a party. Oh no, it's my observation is drunk. I have water. Do we watch first game? Uh, mo mostly machine WTF. Yeah. Sounds like a good shout. Okay, mostly no. machine has been doing rather well, aren't they? Like two zero as well. Oh yeah, I, we we can check the overall um, at the moment here. Uh, I mean, I can I can actually check myself. I don't really need... Yeah, look. Table is yeah. Goblin gang and WTF are and mostly machine are all flawless. Yeah. All right. So number yeah. two against number three right now. Hmm. All right. Let's see then. Oh, Donut Glazer's hot spot was two one. They just didn't bloody show it. Oh. Hmm. All right. While we're waiting for this round to get set up, I have memes. Uh, made this it? video, and I actually kind of want to uh, show this real quick, as it is actually a informative video as to like what happens. However, I need to make sure I uh, have the audio get captured. One moment, browser audio. Uh, no, don't capture Feast of the Other World. Uh, I found that the audio capture has been kind of weird. They added the third option, I think. So now you have to pick. It works, it works. Yeah, yeah, well, at least works. on my end. It's yeah, music. It's, it's coming through too. It's got music. Like, shout out to I Have Memes for this video. It's actually a lovely little one that gives a <laughs> quick little demonstration as to what's going on. I like the notification there. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm not playing. What the hell? Yeah. I like the music. Yeah. Very much enjoy. Good. Yeah, this kind of quick fire, easy to consume content is super nice. Like you, uh, you specialize freeze yeah. in like the actual detailed longer stuff, but let's be honest, TikTok does not oh, like that, that stuff. What's that plugin? Ah, the ultra slow mo. What's it called? Ah. Huh? Did plugin. you see all the? It went super slow. Yeah. Super slow. Yeah, that's a plugin that causes these um, wobbly. The smearing effects. effects. All around the smearing, yeah. So yeah, pilot. Oh, I'm like in, 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 in. Oh? plugging for what? Editing oh, it was software. in Vegas. Yeah, in Vegas. I think it's oh, okay. in, it works in After Effects oh, too. Oh, it's isn't it like you talk about the blur, the Gaussian blur or something no, like that. No, no, or, no, no, or... no. When he goes for the ultra slow mo. Like yeah, this is the big one here. Like sh Shin Bob in this testing ground, the damage it nukes stuff. Like look Ooh. at that six damage. Handing your exactly. badges at a stricter timing. Yeah, so here we go. So yeah, well, I think we saw this once during the... Uh, I don't remember who it was, but I think we did see that once, the other alternate variation where it does work. Yeah, hmm. that's what we pointed out before. If you land your bashes there... See, you saw Scorpion's uh, guard come up. Yeah. And if you hit within 166 MS there, he cannot dodge yet. And he's in neutral, so no damage reduction. So that's exactly how you do it but very much stricter timings there. So exactly what Neem's pointed out is completely correct there. That's kind of what I was trying, I think kind of what I was trying to get at earlier with JC saying that the point of this is that, you know, you can still do some of these, some of these crazy ganks as long as you have the very, very precise timing on it. And that's partly what this uh, PG is meant to do is make it so that it's rewarding the high skill gameplay of like the, having, having your timing be perfect. See. And that's exactly what I pointed out before. You need to hit the yeah. finisher heavy, since it's a UB and heavy hit stun, and then time the hug once again within the timing of the 166, and that's how you gank that. Hmm. Yeah, Ocelot... Ooh, I'm surprised that one works. Yeah, oh, Ocelot, nice. Ocelot Bash kind of works. However, it's the stance got... Like, Hunter's stance got murdered, like you guys were talking about. Right there. Building pinning from... Yeah, the hit from Hunter's stance got murdered. Yeah, notice how there they is, keep yeah. using new beast there. Because hmm. yep. if you use non-block uh, blockable attacks, those would be easily blockable. But you need to parry there, and for parries you have a 100 ms window. Still very strict, but yeah, they correct what they're doing there. They're showcasing it very nicely. Nice, nine damage right heavy on a Jangjun. Yeah, but there you saw how the. Um, Damage reduction carried over during the hog. Exactly like this. Yeah, like this. 
seven damage. It's a butter swipe, like, bruh. Yeah, shout out to Scorpion and Rippy. <laughs> Let me out! <laughs> Oh god, so shout out to Scorpion and Ruby for helping, but especially shout out to I Have Memes for the excellent video. I wanted that to get shown at least once on the stream because it encapsulates the TG very nicely. It, it's it's yeah. a jolly good time. Good video. Good vid. Alright. Yeah. I particularly like it because they showcased it in actual matches. Hmm. Uh, it looks like, you know, when I show it, it's just, oh, look, it's st staged. This is how it perfectly mm -hmm. works. But they showcase actually how it works in game with like extra factors around hitting teammates and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Mm. All right, let Good me video. find Kinu. Amazing. That's going to be my target. I've lost Kinu, chaps. Better find him. Find a Wait, Kinu. aren't they? No, they're PC. Uh, okay. Kinu.mi and uh, JTAX are my captain targets here. Yeah, but Spaniard, the, the follow-up after the in-chain Bash from Ocelotl. They were using the, the finisher bash them, which I don't think was used before. But yeah, maybe it's just a variation that yeah, no was affected more, and the other one is still used properly. Yeah, good call on the, the video there, actually, Spaniard, because yeah, we still don't have an eye. Mm -hmm. Good For... call. So, do we want to? Do we want to take like a? A five? Like, yeah, like a quick break. Actually, yeah, I, yeah, I don't we, know could, if we could take a break. You two can go. do you want do you wanna do you wanna shoot the breeze or do you wanna actually break it? Either way, I'm probably gonna go to the toilet. Alright. I haven't go paid ahead, since then. Tuesday. Oh. Oh my. That uh you should probably fix that. That's not good, Chief. So yeah, we're taking a break. A minute or two. Uh let me do that in chat. That's good. Small two min break for casters. Yep, sounds good. Well, wait for the eye. Be right back, folks. Minute or two.
welcome back everyone we have an eye we took a small break for the commentary uh, team but we are back in i i have memes just uh, hopped in the chat just in time we showed your video on stream memes the the one you made about the Wait. tg excellent love to see it thank you very much for that you did well bravo yeah it's a great little yep. explainer oh that is one <clears throat> it doesn't look as dark in the game Kino's edgy. Oh yeah, that like the the um, Vanta Black Ocelotl. All right, we have we have Hito. I'm noticing a uh, increase, a rise in Hito Kiri the longer this uh, tournament's gone on so far, lads. That has been a trend I've noticed. Yeah, but not just for this Tony in general. Hito has general. seen a, a rise in in general. And you sit here. Yep. Yeah, she's. She's definitely being seen more as, you know, better at like team fighting and, and ganks, anti ganks. They're, I mean, her feats aren't the greatest feats uh, in terms of like actual like what they bring to the team fight, but uh, she's got she's got a very very powerful base kit, and they're definitely being utilized more. Want to watch mid now? What a yep. change! Yeah, let's go. Yeah. Let's see what's going on. Check the one on one. Kinu versus Kino. We got a pirate versus the ocelot. Not going for the gunshot here. Ow. Ow. Pirate in the mix up. Kino now low on stamina. Gonna have to back off a little bit. Jin. Is, oh yeah, Jindu. Jindu. They're, they're now taking advantage of their pirate, their stamina being low, and but it's okay. It doesn't matter. They're gonna dodge again and get punished for it. But are they gonna get C? Uh, clean white oh no, dude. Pretty's still there. Team wipe. Ooh, That's a nice. That was, was parable yep. though, wasn't it? Or was it timed correctly within the 100 MS I window that I was pointing out? I think it was timed. Hmm. Yeah. yeah good stuff. Because the, the, the bash looked like it came in a little bit later, so I think that they. I think it was a. Uh, I think it was okay because the. Uh, Ubi. Side note, by the way, completely unrelated. Oh, yeah. uh, just like a spectator thing. I like the fact that for the spectator on testing grounds, it watermarks the bottom right with a testing grounds modifier. That makes yeah. it handy to actually uh, sort the footage afterwards. What was that verb, verb, verb? I'm sorry. I saw that drop attack. You know mm. the rule. Don't drop attack on Overwatch unless you can guarantee it. And even then, half the time, it doesn't work. Yeah. Like you, you bounce on a pebble. And mm. then that's it. Especially from that spot over there. You gotta respect uh, the attempt. I don't know the yeah the Hito's ability, the discipline to not get baited into the Ubi, the mass, the numerous Ubis that were thrown at them while they were out of stamina. Ooh, takes a lot of nerve to keep yourself calm in that situation. That's a kill. Let's go. Yes, it is. Perfect utilization of the stamina. Yep. Because I was afraid he'd not be able to throw that last heavy there. But no. All planned. Attackers capture. versus Shang and what nice a parry. parry! Good stuff, Credly. Not stepping off either. Holding on to C, getting no, oh, not gonna get it. Just in time, getting interrupted. But they're full on binge though, so they can't get touched but by one person at a time. Uh, side note here, real quick. Question from the chat uh, from Ten Mags. Any YouTube content creators anyone recommends to get back into For Honor? Haven't played since Year Three, Season One. Solid soul, probably. <laughs> I mean, wow. Yeah. Okay. Unironically, oh, for a second, uh, the easy, no, the no easy answer is you throwing shade at that man. Uh, the easy answer oh, yeah. is you, Freeze. However, Freeze, look yeah. for look for someone on YouTube who just makes fun content to watch that you vibe with. Like, there's a lot. Yeah. I personally would recommend a Havoc, but there's like a bajillion mm -hmm. one, like Raven Knight instead of Reaper King, like I called him on the bloody, uh, on the reveal stream. Oh God, I'm so embarrassed by that. But yeah, like uh, Re uh, Raven Knights, or just find someone on YouTube that you enjoy and go from there. If you want educational stuff, Freeze is right here, but just yep. find who you enjoy, 10 Max. That's legitimately the best answer I can give. I think uh, one that does both is, is a pretty good fit. I think Marco Yolo comes Marco, to mind. Marco, yes. yes. Good shout. But yeah, Marco's there's... the perfect blend there. Educational and fun. He really is. And yeah. some and he's good too. Oh my, the timing on Bro. that. That was awesome. Nitro is surviving out in these streets. Pops the revenge preemptively to save his bacon. Oh no, why are you throwing? In a 2v1. Oh, maybe if they'd have thrown him on the Shinobi. Hmm. 
If they like swap yeah. lock ons, maybe. But the thing is, they, these guys know that if your teammate gets caught in a guard break during the revenge, you, 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 you peel. bash. Yeah. You bash. That, that, that's what you do. That was very much expected from the Shinobi there. So he could have, I don't know, anticipated, I guess. Double up, parry oh. by Verp, Verp, Verp. Good usage of stamina by Hidokiri. Again, from earlier, same thing. Oh, yeah, holy sh... Got bumped. The Hido got bumped, but doesn't matter. Amazing use of stamina here by Hidokiri. Making really good reads on when to throw. Oh, we have a lurking in the wings, Ocelot. Uses the tier one in time, Damn. gets back, interrupts the Xe. Let's go, Goz. This is a, a, a remake of the opening matchup between these two, and Kino's gonna fall this time. Good, you know, Ooh. it did interrupt the Xe, but paid for it. Gonna have to flee. That's gonna mean Jundu drops. Fortunately, the backup from Verp, Verp, Verp. Verp has been in the right place at the right time consistently throughout the match, right? Uh, in this particular match. I think that's. I think that was two players, two or three that got dropped there on the uh, Prime of Fake A. Ah. Yeah. And a solid but not game changing use of the Ocelot tier one there. Mm hmm. Covering C, generating a few points, healing a little bit. Wait, look at the scoreboard. Nitro Beast not having a great time on the scoreboard or in game. Gets dropped once again. Does not even have the tier two online. Neither does JTAX either. Oh, but the gun uh -oh. a surprise. Ends up scoring on the Kinu. Oh. JTAX has nothing left in the tank. They're going to bleed out. They're just going to go for broke. Yeah, Jundu's gunpowder surprise screwed over uh, Kinu just in time. Jaquette does not have gunpowder online, but they may not even need it considering how quickly this game is going. WTF am I doing here? Are pushing for game one in no short order. Jindu was one HP in a dream. Now zero. Everybody is going to get the reset, respawn, and come back. However, the question is where do they want to go? What do they want to do? JTAC is going for C right now. Nitro B is going to go over there, try and gank with them. They got to make something happen quickly, though. But realistically, like, I, A is open and B should, or B could be cleared out here to get them out of breaking. But they're going to get rotated on. This is going to be a 3v2 scenario right now, though. Four, I'm sorry, 4v3. Oh, my. Everyone's piloting here, guys. A tier four deployed, though, by Tema. That's going to be a problem. Ooh. Kinu gets the grab. GG. Uses the increased damage to absolutely smite them from the lands. Jindu going to dodge for their life. You're done. Good night. Oh, the Jindu makes the bad makes a bad read there on the dodge. It gets caught by the the, the ocelot. Almost caught him Tiandi for some reason. Dodge is about the same. Not quite, but got caught. Top heavy wow. scoreline, unfortunately, for mostly machine. Nitro just couldn't get off the blocks, and neither could JTAC. Uh, WTF, am I doing here? We're consistently shutting them down. Almost a second 007. Yep. I was going to comment on that and say mm -hmm. that uh, they died just like the character that they are right now with Don't the. Don't you uh, uh, uh. Game did not like the reference. Apparently, uh, you're, only allowed, six. you're only allowed one double, uh, double O something reference, and then it'll just have a tantrum. All right, let's get it back up and running for game two. In the meantime, we could talk about who you want as a new James Bond. For England! <laughs> Idris Elba, easy. I yeah, Idris. No, they just do they, it already. Didn't they show uh, a list of six or something that were, that they were talking to? I... Wasn't it Taylor something, Taylor Johnson something? I I will say that the like the James Bond movie studio will keep that stuff tight to their chest. So any lists that come out will purely be speculation from the public. No, no, yeah, no, there's... no. I thought they oh. were talking about it this week, like were they? official talks. Oh, I well, there was so. a there was a news article claiming that somebody was supposed to be the new one, but I don't. Oh, know. I, I, I didn't. Taylor I didn't read Johnson, it. And I didn't think it was true. Was I done? stand corrected. Thank you, Mona. I'll look it up. Quick, no goals. To the gossip sheets. What? What? Huh? Yes. No, <laughs> yes. To the gossip sheets. Let's go to the I Twitter think it's a good choice. The Aaron Taylor Jones is a good choice. That's the right age. I like Johnson, the man. James Bond. All right. Game clients back up. Hey, fresh restart uh, means we avoid the uh, signature bug. 
And we'll get back in for the next game. JTAC will be the target. Oh. Oh. Okay, I guess it wouldn't be... I mean, I guess I can kind of see it. Like, the, all of, a lot of the pictures of this, of, of, of Aaron Johnson, is when he's got, like, really long and curly hair. And yeah. it's more difficult to see James Bond because James Bond is kind of like a, a basic bowl cut kind of, you yeah, know, really situation. Slick. So, yeah. yeah, yeah. I, but yeah, but the, I'm totally the with you there. with yeah. uh, Idris Elba, but they need to move quickly because if they wait another five years, the man. <laughs> the man what? Is too old, then, I think. Yeah, you cut off at the very end of the sentence. It was really I don't dramatic. care. Yeah. I don't care how old the man is. All right, you know, you got you, you got people like Morgan Freeman, who's like 152 years old. He's still <laughs> doing it. He's still out there. Mm. You know, he doesn't look it at all. Uh, who, w William Shatner. I wouldn't. I wouldn't he suggest just him for 007, But like William, William Shatner's Shatner 93. 93. Yeah, he's 93. He does not look. He looks like 57. Well, really? Yeah. Yeah. The man's 93 already. See. Fucking hell. <laughs> Crazy, right? I thought he was like mid 70s or something. Exactly. He's, he looks so much younger than he is. It's wild. Speaking of, the, speaking of younger things, this matchup is very, very young right now. Round three, mostly machine versus WTF. Wait, don't we have one up by right now? This is our uh, second yeah. game. Well, yeah, yeah, this is second game. Mm -hmm. uh, WTF won uh, that game. Uh, are they on the correct side? No, they aren't. Of course they aren't. There we are. Yeah, Choquette, right. Tremor, Ver Verp, and Kinu. Yeah, that is correct. They're in the blue. All right. Uh, All right. Let's go back we to got C. A... Right. Also a lot of mirror there. Yeah. Yep, it was. Now we got a JJ mirror, too, in the middle of the team fight. Shinobi on Kido and Pirate on Shigoki. Lots of Watch disparate. the spam. Oh! One down. That's it. Oh, yeah. Just still the got the bash spam. Stamina. Oh, what, 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 what? Good, Good read. One HP to dream. Not going to be able to get the Vinci though. Maybe not. No, no. Very close. Very close to taking out one or two. But they sort of had to dealt with the third. Jaquette was still there. Full map clear. Effectively an ace. And... And an A cap verb. Kinu ran up to A point as soon as they had the opening and opportunity. Uh, they must have won. I believe they must have took the one v one there in mid. That was yeah. the Ocelot mirror as Freeze pointed out. Yeah. And they have had him going into mid consistently on the splits here. They did the same thing in the last match as well. Ah. Yeah, a good play in there from Chuket, like staying back, not engaging, letting the enemy team clear because that was was no reason to engage one v three. And now they're minions are pushing already, so yeah, well done. That was unfortunate Ooh, gaming there from the, uh, from Chiquette, actually. From, they did not have stamina heavy, and it just unfortunately whiffed the JJ, uh, externally. That was, uh, that was, that was sad to see. I'm gonna flip on, oh, we have a, oh, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute, that's a, that's a bot. We have a fluffy two. Oh, that is the bot, we're fluffy respectating two. the bot, got it. Sorry, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm still at 50% here. Oh, good. You got three hours of sleep. The fact that you're even up right now is a small blessing. Uh, nope, I'm not sure... the, nope, darker joke. What do you think? Just moving on. Ah, got that. Uh, I'm not sure if there'll be a, a disconnect. I'm waiting to see if an admin pipes in. I can't I mean, try really and Oh, yeah, I mean, reconnect. technically, it's... Technically, go on. I mean, I don't... I mean, it's very rare that people actually try. <laughs> of course, uh, Bivacio comes into the chat. Average tuba DC. Oh, is there a history here with tuba? Apparently, there is a prior, uh, some prior disconnect knowledge going on. We'll keep it. We'll keep it as is for the time being, and let the admins do their thing. But, but, but. Spec bot. Oh, we'll absolutely spec bot. Sometimes the bot comes out with miracle plays. Like legitimately, sometimes they will come out with miracle plays. Verb is on point up until that last. But that though, isn't it? Sometimes. <laughs> I don't need to justify myself. He was available. Could shut this whole thing down. Did not. Unfortunate gaming. Got a 
be aware, JTAX will end up dropping off screen. This is not exactly the cleanest of ganks. Oh, hang on a minute. We might have a good bit of footage here. Nitro Beast. And immediately the Shugoki peels away. That was actually probably oh. for the best. Yeah, we got multiple that 1v1s. Infinite. Yeah, they got it. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Nope, nope. They got They got it. back, by the way. Hey, it is fluffy. That's the three button. Uh, three button. Yeah. Oh, you're spectating with controller, aren't you? No, I'm using keyboard. I press three. Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah, what's the bot currently doing? Bot is clearing oh, mid. You turn, you turn the buttons off, right? You turn the UI off. Yes, I, I am the He's only person... the H button that he always tells us to do. Yeah, I am the only person that's got that community <laughs> that actually enforces, like, pressing H. Like, dick on, please. Press H. Oh, that was nice. Oh, that was sick. Not confirmed, but I, I would have expected the, the Goki Heavy there too, not the Sickle Ring. Are they using the double hit to confirm heavy? Yeah. That's cool. Mm. Oh, Kinu, what's going on here? The bot's dead again, unfortunate. I, I'm trying to balance, like, the <laughs> meme of specking the bot with actually getting good footage, because that's kind of the point of this tournament. <laughs> but I like my memes. Ooh, nice. Oh, let's go. Kino. Nice. Stamina usage, except you just got to be careful, wary of the JJ, because it does brain stam. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. What's it called? Hunter stance or something, yeah. right? Yeah, the hunter stance. There it is. Bloodlust 2.0, except like 1.5 slash 1.7, maybe. Blo the bot it's managed available. to knock a player like out of stamina prone. You what? In this yeah, century? Just eats everything yet. Yeah. Oh. Bench, Gugoki, that's actually kind of a terrifying prospect in a team fight. As long as Verp, Verp, Verp can hold the fort a little bit and allow Chaket to go nuts. Oh, never mind. Doesn't get much because they all dodge the Shugo, so instead Verp's going to have to do it. Tier 4 they chose here. Interesting Tier 4 decision. The going with the Nail Bomb. Nail Bomb is very powerful, but can be iframed. What else do they have here? Do they have something that's... Oh, they have a Hito, don't they? Yeah. Uh, let me pull a thing. Oh, Nitro's dead. But yeah, Nitro's been normally playing the Hito Kiri. <laughs> Fluffy. Uh oh. Oh, yeah. Bot uh... res, baby. Let's go. You love to see it. What? Dodge rolling out of the mix up. This bot is cracked right now. Eating every unblock. Oh, oh, in the, oh, in the oh you can see it. Bots always <laughs> back dodge. And you have oh, some bot. moves. Oh, always wow. trap the back dodge. Like, walk the flank in this case. But yeah. This. This bot has well, amazing well. feats, by the way. That tier three is the greatest tier three feat in the game. <laughs> yeah. Oh my lord, it's so good. It's so amazing. It's so incredible. Oh, it's I love Puffin's JJ. Day. <laughs> it's who's JJ? I mean, Raid Boss JJ. Oh, Raid yeah. Boss JJ. I remember that. That's a callback. Yeah. That's like if people don't remember. There used to be a book that just showcased way more HP than you actually had, and it was like. 10 bars of HP or something. It was when so you had cool. all those feats. It was just re it looked really intimidating. Yeah. Despite the it, it HP was really... not actually being what it showed. I mm. so, yeah. I like that actually. I thought yeah. it was really fun. I thought it was uh it was uh, kind of funny, kind of interesting. Like you said it added pressure from just from just being there and existing. I think if we added that back in it uh, it may you know it, it would be maybe Ouch. you know meme or fun or something. Let's see. Oh dear. God, the hitbox. Verb survives using a snail bomb. Both of the enemy ate it. No restart needed, apparently. The bot <laughs> substitution, keeping the objectives wow. controlled. You saw earlier while that fight happening between C and B, Fluffy ran up to A, the bot ran to A, then it's clearing mid. Well, it cleared the wrong end of mid. And now Box the bot crack. in comes. Let's go. Here right, come comes the finger the There we go. What's <laughs> 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 the third attack? Bog <laughs> Oh, whiff, whiff. Unfortunate. Got, oh. no, no. Oh. Third time's a charm. Oh. Fourth time's no! a charm. Damage reduced. He, it's TG. <laughs> it that doesn't work. <laughs> he does. He's going for it. Let's go, Chiquette, Credly. The role of Marco Yolo will now be played <laughs> by Chiquette. <laughs> 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 that fine. Wow. Get the final hit and emotes over the corpse. This bot is amazing. I bot love this come bot. Last. Let's see. I want to see. No! <laughs> by the last kill. By Get the last kill. On.
Yeah. Oh just man. Just by stealing that kill. <laughs> the skin of the team, right there. <laughs> Fluffy two is my new favorite player. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. <sighs> wow. This is gonna be this is a hilarious. fun tournament. Uh, but yeah, we did actually see a prime example there of the TG that um, the hug Bikinu hit on the wrong timing. He hit before they got dropped to the ground and out of the animation. So it ends up getting it ends up getting damage through, which gave Hendley another round of revenge. It's ah, another got, one. Got to adapt to it. Good footage. All right, let's have a look at the brackets. We have the Green Horns two owed by Kazuya Mishima, Hotspot and Miasma. But it's a Hotspot game. I don't trust the stats going to get updated in time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Who are we thinking about? Are we going Goblin Donut or are we going to try and get someone else? Let's get someone else, because next round we're going to have Goblin Gang against... What the fuck am I doing here? One of the two, yeah. What about... Have we seen setup struggles at all once. today? We saw them once. Okay. Let's uh, go for them again, why games, not? then, yeah? Or no, we've not seen the Green Horns yet. That's what it was. We haven't seen the Green they're, Horns? Yeah, we have already done. Like oh, they, oh okay. I just refreshed and the setup got 2-0'd two, two by Pink Underwear. All right, well, you know what we need is we need just need Hotspot Gaming and Miasma Purple to go 0-2, and, and then we'll have a... You know, mostly matching, except that last game, we'll just have to strike that one from the record books. Uh, you know, have the whole round be just 0-2. It'll be great. All right, let's uh, have a little bit of a gamble. Post uh, JS and... A guess, a guess. It'll be a guess. We don't, we don't gamble here. Ah, my apologies. Against TOS. Tesma, we have an eye. Uh, current position or beginning? I, I mean, I think that they're probably getting close to, to the end of this one, but I kind of, I, I'm leaning towards beginning. What about beginning and distant? All right. I like the yawn drip with the curved forward horns. I don't actually see that too often these days. Now that I've said that, if we were to go into current position and they happen to be done, we can go into the next one right away, but. I think either is a winner. Quick, somebody flip a coin. I don't have my dice rolling, but... Uh, you know, for the purposes of just having something to watch, we'll do beginning. Even if it is behind, mm. we'll do that. Yep. Stop being mod everywhere. Yeah, Kintama just is mod everywhere on the For Honor directory. That's just Kintama's thing. He collects mod badges. Yeah, there's a fake <laughs> off God Gaming prone, yeah. Oh, hey, prone. Maybe, maybe they just didn't know. To be fair, Sherry. was playing. I'd not allow an, a single other game to be spectated. Yeah, if auto hey, returns, hey, hey, no. bro. No, no, no. This map is raining. I say both teams are banned. This is bullshit. <laughs> My encoder. Yeah. My encoder. I've been advocating for a, for a rule where we set the weather on each specific map. I thought that, that was a rule for that. I, I thought that was a rule I'm, for that. No, there isn't. I'm 100. I, I'm unironically 100. percent Not joking. I, I fully believe we. Sh it, it should be uh, a, a standard comp thing where, because of the way the engine works with uh, specifically rain, snow, environmentals like that, more so rain than anything else. Hmm. Yeah, not just, no rain, uh, just sun. Also, on some maps, uh, the dawn setting on a point harbor, the sun like shines through that one hole on the side through that one. Oh. It's so blinding. Okay. I it's, I, that's one of the weather settings I actually say, nope, not allowed. But as you pointed out, because of performance issues, rain should never be allowed. Strategically yeah. nerfing PC FPS. Yes, it's a it's a strategic map choice, BVC. Hey, Cobra. Mm. Nice to see you. Well, Tesman, not happy to see Pink Shirt Man. Look at him up. pointing. Where you pointing at? <laughs> Look at this dude. <laughs> this one. This one, this one right here, Dodges. officer, he oh. killed me. <laughs> this one right here, officer. This guy. This guy. This guy. <laughs> this guy. Hey, yeah, like... he does that strategically so that when they come back as a ghost, they know who to haunt. Ah, <laughs> right. It's, it's, it's communication. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. That was oh, a guard bench. break for a guard break. Oh, no. Wow. That interaction looked really interesting. Mm. He fell down data. super fast. 
Yeah, let's actually put an emphasis on the Yorm here, because you did mention, well, one, we have Goz here, who's a Yorm aficionado, but two, Yorm is, like, high on the list of uh, amount of things that were changed in TG. Yeah, so many of his moves were actually affected. Yeah, yeah it's... It's his kit Dude. itself, you know, like that right there normally would reset hit stun. It's not going to reset hit stun in this particular TG. And right there, immediately as we're talking, it happens. There was also a little bit of damage reduction off of that. Ah. It looked like, no, you still get the damage, but it is damage reduced. So, yeah, yeah there was no blocking carrying that. Mm, I, oh, boy. Uh, no, oh, no, no, what you got to backstep that one. Was it just one. too slow? Maybe. I think it was too early. Oh, no. I, 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 actually, I don't know the timing on it, but they, I think they did it too early because Get it cracked the, the uh, Let's go! instead. Yeah, that's because of a reset. But... Ah, down you go. Back to Yorm. Let's see what Pilgrim's doing. Let's, keep, let's do a little bit of a focus on the Yorm and Gunther for this game, in my opinion. Yeah, good call. Gets caught by Jupiter. Gets put in the rings of Saturn. This is not good. Watch your arms. Nice usage of the hyper armor there by Pilgrim externally. Back roll. Ow. Jesus Christ. The tracking can't get away. Now they're going to run up the A point where Joanna's here. Pirate match. Mirror. Just needs to wait. And. Oh. I don't use the gunshot, my man. A woman. I don't know. Don't. Careful. Careful. Person. Person. <laughs> Medels. you got to be careful. Oh. The target switch screwed them. So the question is whether or not they target swapped themselves or if it was because the other person was off screen, off frame. Hmm. I do believe there is actually a Matesma up there. And press the right button. There we are. But Tesmo in a 1v2. Back up is on the way. <laughs> he was having a lot of pillars go that for her. Because that pillar is usually not working the way you want it to. Oh, oh, mm. oh, oh, oh. No. <laughs> Sickle rains landing roll. Hello. Sickle reciprocation. That's death. Ow. Nice. nice. Take it to oh. pillar. Oh, oh, nice! Made the reset. So it's the interesting reset happened, because with the double lights, he can reset them back to neutral, which makes the guard break not bounce. Yeah. Uh, which might come as a surprise for many players because they're, they're thinking, oh, it's done. If anybody GBs me here, they're just going to bounce off. But with the immediate reset from the double light, they're actually being susceptible to the guard break. That's interesting. I think that's a mm. see implemented in future ganks. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I think it's very interesting. Yorm could have gotten killed there, I think. I mean, they did, but they were trying to roll away from the mix-up on the JJ, and I, ultimately, I believe they would have got caught. You can't really get that, get away from JJ like that. Ooh, that was an old-school gang right there. Pin him in the corner. Yeah, light off. JJ can't touch it. Doesn't need to. Mm -hmm. Has tier three, has tier four now. Yorm only has tier two. Can heal himself and get a little bit of shield, but... Oh, that would have been a good. That would have been good. Oh, hello. Oh, throw, we'll throw, 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 throw. Let's Yo! go. Let's go. Yours forward throw is deceptively long range. Oh, a little bit of stam here. Oh, unfortunately. Oh, and that's just, that's right. The smoke bomb doesn't. Okay. I was thinking, for some reason, I was thinking it had PI pro. Oh, oh, oh throw. Yeah, like yes, hammer smoke. slam, baby. Yeah. Get that shield. Don't mind if I do. The schmicks. Throw with the heavy. Throw with the heavy for neutral. Heavy for neutral. Come on, baby. Use your hyper armor, damn it. You were so doing it earlier. Just keep zoning. <laughs> just keep Zone zoning for neutral. Is the MM, MM Yorm. MM Yorm. Let's go. Yeah, I mean, it worked. It worked. It worked. They may, maybe they were making the read that they were gonna, the Shinobi was going to keep dodging, and they were correct. Seeing a rep 71 still feels weird to me. The fact that they moved up to mm -hmm. rep 80. I, I'm happy that they did, but it's still, I'm still oh, getting whiff. used to it. It whiffs, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm hmm. That whiff. They were in motion. Game curse needs help. And he's gonna get it. Oh, the nice. oh, that lands. Oh, nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Good discipline there, waiting to see what happened. Throw wall splat. Yup. Discipline on the stand. Love to see it. Bash. Just the bash. Interesting. I thought for sure he'd go for the dodge heavy. 
We're it like... unlocks its zones. Amazing. Just like I, I'm, I'm, I like the short. Wait, wait. Yes. Nice. Oh, it could. Wait a minute. Ooh. That worked. Oh, what? Look at that. Look at that. that work. No damage. Huge amounts of revenge. Yeah. That's. That's the thing now. <laughs> Kowalski analysis. Wow. What just happened? Wow. I'm surprised to knock him down even. Oh, yeah, that's know. that's that's what I was so surprised. I was surprised that, that even actually did did work with the damage. Uh, definitely noticeable. Like, Tier four right here could be interesting. I mean, they still have, uh, it's a little late, but hmm. okay. try and shut down the gank. Team fight, you got it. He's got hard to kill. Ah, that's gonna death. Yep, yep. Being cursed, going yeah, after Joanna. Ah, oh, nice that one, yeah. So yeah, uh, Gauze, after you've had a nice little string of seeing uh, the Jormungandr in play, opinions so far? Well, again, you know, I, I always I always give this disclosure that uh, Jorm is not meta currently in the on live. I don't foresee these things necessarily changing any of that. I do believe that uh, Yorm is one of those heroes that has such a very specific kit and how the hit interactions and, and resets and whatnot works. It, I, 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 I just, I feel like they may have to actually make some, maybe some more adjustments with them after the TG, to be honest with you. Yeah. I think he has a lot of tools. I don't think he's oh, yeah. left behind in any regard, like, you know, all the night characters. But no, yeah. I'm with you there. Oh, um, key either. Yeah, tier I... four. I still. He's got this tier four, and he's you no. Know, oh, he's not. He's just hanging on to it for the next game. Like right here, that they they have them in breaking. They have the mid lane game curses over there, holding on to it. Three people are critical. Like right now, I don't know what you're waiting for, Yorm. Right here, you're too late. You could have used Did it a moment ago. It yep. does land though. I thought for sure they got. It. They were gonna roll away from that. They did not get away though. I definitely would have used that either when they were outnumbered before in mid or right then during the team fight before it got to the point to where the teammate died. That's it. Attackers win. That is at, mm, we don't know the exact score, but we'll keep it simple for now. It is one nil to Miasma Deep Purple. Freeze, how do you feel about the idea of buffing Lawbringer as Sweaty Kintama? Yeah, he can get a roll catch. I'm fine with that. Mm. What do you if, want my you know, honest opinion about the complaints about Lobby? Go on. Go for it. I think anybody who who thought that Lobbering would come out stronger with three work is like a massive retard. Honestly. It's that's insane thinking the guy it's, would be strong. What everybody me. is very much I don't know how do I say this? I think it's a very valid complaint. That is not a lot of fun to play. Everybody can complain Lawbringer is no longer fun. That's mm. completely fine. But thinking he'd be stronger after the rework is just a massive cope. Oh, it's 1-1 one, one, apparently. I was coping. We're going to Beachhead. I, wish I think that... Go on. Sorry. Okay, uh, I would... the... someone in chat said, I wish my Pookie Bear Rippy was in the tournament, but I'll settle for his commentary. Is Rippy doing commentary somewhere? What? Hang on. Where? Scope and where? Is Rippy's doing commentary? So, yeah. so come, while we're getting, we're okay. waiting on that. So on the, on the LB, I think a good roll catch would be taking his, uh, God, what is his impale? Make that, you know, do that from neutral. I don't know how, uh, what input you'd use for it, but, you, you know, I mean, increase the tracking on their forward heavy, movement. Right? That's not taken, is it? Well, no, he doesn't, have a no. really, like, uh, strict input because of his... Really short forward dodge recovery. I mean, it's not warden, mm -hmm. but it's still short. Yeah. But you know, knights are left behind, aren't they? Knights are left behind. Have you not seen? That's why I'm, I made that joke like three times already because Solid Soul made a video. I have like, not seen that. Basically, just grabbing all the idiots and telling them how the knights are left behind. Ah. Like, oh. I, will so the the I will need to educate myself on the law. I will need to educate myself. What's the what's the rotation here? Clearly, a and C. Warden's been shit all this time. Moderna, be careful. Oh wait, that's the wrong button. Pilgrim, watch Same the drop. Oh, let's go, Moderna! Kills Big Shot Man. 
Pilgrim in the middle of all of it, really low on HP. Are they going to get an opportunity to gank anything here? Joanna just going around and doing pirate things and eventually dropping Pilgrim. They're going to trade one for one here. Game Curse going to be able to add a little damage. Oh, nope, not adding damage. Going to hope for the pin. Not going to work out. Yeah, probably unsure how he confirmed it, but yeah, I like mm -hmm. what done that. That was a gank, and that is death. Now they're gonna, they got C-Point. Game Curse is going to be able to go up and heal. Oh, they're not going to be able to go out and heal. Pink Shirt Man is coming off here at the mid lane. He's got a great peel off of Modelus here. Modelus Maidenless. Maybe not after this game. Mm -hmm. I think that they, uh, they're they going to get... Never mind. <laughs> oh, hang on. Here's a free out for you, Norgoz. We just got raided by Mr. Sheep. Hello, Mr. Yeah. Sheep. How are you doing? So, Norgoz... Yeah, uh, Thank for, you for the raid. For the people who come in, what's going on here, Norgoz? This is the Testing Grounds Tournament, folks. Thank you for joining us. Thank you to Mr. Sheep for uh, the raid. We've got us a 1v1, or a 1 to 1 best of 3 situation here. Hotspot Gaming versus Miasma Deep Purple. And this is a very close match so far. Lots of team fights going on here. But the Testing Grounds, if you may not be familiar with it, is based on the Hitstone rule changes. And we've seen a lot of things today. So definitely bring in your feedback, bring in your thoughts on those changes if you're familiar with them because we've seen a lot of that today. Lots of really good data. So definitely watch back the VOD if you didn't see it live. Yeah, this is essentially a giant experimental pot of a change that was directed primarily at the higher end community. Let's run a giant tournament of competitive players to see what it feels like to watch and we'll get their opinions on what it was like to play in. What? I'm surprised this hit. I thought he was outside the circle, but I don't, no. I'm, hmm. I'm confused what happened there. Mysterious ki dead happened. zone? Question mark? I, I mean, maybe, maybe Pirate was doing a backstep light. Looked almost like it was an unlock. Hmm. Nice backflip. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Downy Hunter proc. But there's no tag there. Pink shirt man in a 1v2 situation. Again, uh, so they can get the initial, the initial heavy. But the follow-up is going to be difficult to get. They're going to drop out. You know, he's going to go heal. Pink Shirt Man in a 1v1. JJ Mirror right now. Game Curse makes the right read for the for the GB. Gets a teammate, though. And right here, we may see... You can escape, my man. You can escape. He can run. get out. Oh, no. no. Decided not to escape. Ego challenge, I think, Freeze. I think that was an ego challenge. I didn't think he wanted to run. Our man, Game Curse, knows what's going on. He's running. Maybe into his death here, but we'll see. <laughs> Buff his team at the bare minimum. I have to go, but we'll have to go back and look at that light. Uh, Spaniards just may have been uh, bounced off the wall. Ooh, that's a fair point. All right, yeah, he decided. Game Curse nope, is not, not going to make the same mistake, yeah. Oh, yeah, he's playing with Kiai, so on banners. Oh, yes, Sheep, that's a fair point. Everyone reading from Sheep's stream. First of all, hi, nice to see you. Second of all, yeah, the rules for this tournament are slightly different. Uh, because you can only legally play 10 characters, all the ones from the TG here, we can't necessarily do, like, conquest rules, feat bans. So everything's on the table for this tournament. The only purpose of today is we have some steel provided by Ubisoft in the, the tournament to give an incentive to play, but this is purely to see how the TG feels to play at a competitive setting and to gather data and footage on it. So this is a lot more lower stakes, lower key. People are cracking open bevies. It's a good time. So yeah, there are like Ocelot tier one, Juggernaut, Shooting Stars, all of that's there. I don't think we had Shooting Stars. Oh, hang on. Is, should, oh, Shooting Stars is still banned for this? I is think it, it is. Banya, please confirm. Hmm. I'll have to go look, but yeah, I think that's one of those things that definitely needs to go into the, uh, the, uh, the feet. TG, whenever that happens. Please, dear God, have it happen soon. Come on, Gatecurse, let's see what we can get done here in the middle of the enemies. You're a Jangjun, the perfect Shooting character Shooting Star is banned. Ah, it's banned, thank you. Uh, listing is, this is because it is bugged. Oh, right. Good to know. Thank you, thank you for reading the rulebook for me. I, Jupiter, yes. looking to read the rule book of winning. Gotta get that done. Oh no, the Jormungandr pastes him! <laughs> Pilgrim once again! Mr. Sheep making references. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Yeah. <laughs> I understood that reference. We're all in this tournament. It's basically <laughs> to gather footage. We know who to ban afterwards. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. These people that are ganking will not be able to do the event mode ever. 
So yeah, that's see, obviously we even why we're doing this entire tournament. Spam after the winning. Yeah, it was crazy. <laughs> like that bot can't, can't do, that's can't play ever again. This. Yeah, if you ever DC and that bot Fluffy Two replaces you, you automatically lose the tournament. You know, I don't make the rules. I just that's just what's gonna happen. Oh, Joanna's about to get jo ganked here. Yep. Takes the bait on the unblockable. Big damage coming out here. I was going to say they did a good job of not G being, uh, what is it, the second or third time there, because that would have put them out of stamina. They were getting really close to it. I think they did two GBs and they didn't do the third. Finally taking Pilgrim out of the, out of the, speaking of stamina usage, good read confirm. there. Nope, no confirm. No, because they're out of stam. You know, he's still out of stam there. Still for all random attack. <laughs> what? True. You can still, but... yeah, technically throw a heavy. That's true, that's true. Make a read. Yeah. Well, Tesma, but no, it's fair. Secure. I'm not doing anything. It's, it's completely fine. <laughs> I was just joking. Post. He's gonna get it. No, Joanna stepped away for too long. Out of all the people to not be able to pick up sarcasm from, Freeze is not the one I didn't think I would pick up sarcasm from. You see, I never do this. The, you see, here's the funny thing: <laughs> a combination of a German accent and the tism makes it real hard for me to pick up sarcasm oh. from you sometimes. It's like I need actually a slash s to help me out here, IRL. Second Have only. You commented, uh, done commentary with a finish. Oh, I, I haven't done commentary with a Finnish person, but I have played D and D, and they're worse. That's fair. The Finnish yeah. accent is a lot worse to pick up sarcasm. Especially since like 80% of what they're saying is sarcasm. Mm. <laughs> so, something something trolls in the forest. Oh. I think they were trying to change targets and external the JJ, but they didn't get the target swap to happen because they guarded on the right instead of the top. Or maybe they flickered their guard there, but they were obviously trying to uh, block the JJ and they got the wrong side. The feats are definitely in the loo, uh, in the way of Miyazma D purple and so are the points. I mean, this is definitely, I mean, this isn't completely shut out yet, but they can, uh, Hotspot Gaming cannot afford to lose any more team fights. They have to be on top of this. They need to get their, their tier fours right now, and they need to make something happen with it. Don't even try and go for the gun. Players are adapting. The longer this Swiss bracket goes on, the gun is being used less from the pirate people relying on light attack setups, block stun setups, or even just a uh, guard breaking into walk the flank entirely. I think they had a slight opening where tier one may have helped make a difference. Let's see. Pilgrim. Well, Pilgrim still has their tier three, so it might not have actually got him killed. But at this point, all feats should be on the table. Yeah. Like, there's only a Don't few hold back for anything. Feats. This is the time to use it. This this is the time that you've been saving them to use it. What was the delightful term that got used early on? Save them for next game. <laughs> yep, save, save them for the next game. Don't do That's that. what happens, you know. Uh, you know, as the wise Mr. Kyle said, is uh, whenever you save your feats at the end of the game, like you, the next game starts, you automatically have those feats unlocked. That's just how that works. That's just Mafia. Pink, more. Tier four. Yama is going to be a problem. Mm hmm. Oh. Too early, sadly. Pink is desperately, he, they are holding on for as Ooh. far as they can. Get it, get away. Oh, you can't there it is. Oh. There. That is. Nope. Nope. A confident idea. Unfortunately, that was a shinobi. Good luck running away from a shinobi. Um, oh, that was damage? Was that damage reduced? That was damage reduced. A little bit. Looked like it. Bruh. Oh, let's hop over to the uh, said Yorman Gun to see if he gets damage reduced again. He's got Twilight of the Gods on deck, if you want to go for that. May not be needed. Definitely not. Oh, no, that was a dodge forward heavy. Disregard. I think <laughs> was fine. Go through the metal roller decks. Yep. Oh, uh, that for dodge forward heavy didn't even connect. Yes. Did it so, not? No, I don't think it. Are you I sure? Think it we can go look at the replay later. I, I, yeah, I, I'd be interested. Pretty sure it connected. And that is going to be 2-1. One, one after the gunpowder surprise. Yes. Yeah. I thought that one whiffed, yeah. Somebody Someone get us it. a clip. Someone get us a clip. We need to figure this out. Spaniard also thinks he missed. Which is the most damage reduction <laughs> you can get. So we're all true. correct. 
I love this. I love Spaniard. I love I love middle of the road Spaniard. I like that. Bails everyone out. I like it. <laughs> oh. Bailing everyone out. Indeed. Hey. Hey. No? Okay. I'll go back to the drawing board. You should, you should watch. Why is watch in quotation marks? Hang on. Is something going on with Greenhorns? Quote unquote. Oh, round They're three's over. Done. Oh, yeah. Round three's over. New round. Round four round. time. Speaking of rounds. All right. So uh, I'm going to go get my next round. Let's go. Final bevy. Oh, we're going to have Goblin Gang against. What? The, yeah. WTF? What the fuck am I doing here? Yes. WTF? We need to watch that one. It's that. basically our finals. All right, let's get it loaded in the barrel. Go grab your drinks. <laughs> Damn you, Spaniard. Devs have added 100%. No, no, no. So during the testing grounds, we have noticed that uh, we're going to add uh, secondary hit stun, uh, whatnot. And uh, in order to compensate, we have added 100% damage reduction on whiff attacks. <laughs> Technically true. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, he, except for Medjai, he when he damages people just from swinging in their direction. <laughs> Technically oh. true. Tell you what, if this if this goes quickly enough, uh, uh, gamer and XL Nash, we will watch Greenhorns. But oh yeah, what's that pig? I'll oh, put it back up. Hang on. Uh, I was looking at uh, in game. Yeah. It it is a deep fried Clutchmeister that's gone through like several layers of image processing did it or at least one or two layers not too many but the, that is that is a deep fried there is no definition there it is pretty hang on, can i zoom in it would actually work for me here no it's not it's gonna auto size how dare you 23 layers of compression right if you don't watch us first it'll be too late oh wait us are you greenhorns xl nash Oh, hang on a minute. Freeze, we have we have some uh, we have uh, the greenhorns asking to be spectated. I th I believe. Yes, but I do not want to miss the finals. We have the two strongest teams. Yeah, that, that, that's, that's nothing fair. after the the Swiss bracket, right? Uh, let's yeah. This is the final round. Uh, yeah, right, then, it, yeah, this then is correct. I will not yield. Okay, uh, I'm sorry. The analyst desk has given the override here, XL. This, yeah, Goblin Gang and WTF are going to be fighting for the first place position. So that is going to be the one we will be watching. Alright. We apologize, my player is trolling. <laughs> uh, quick in... Uh, oh? Right Hello? Uh, sorry to in interject. No problem. Quick update. Well, there is a... After this, there is a tiebreak round. Oh? between the two teams or the, the number of teams that are in tied in second days oh, okay. and then we do have grand finals oh so, we do technically there is stuff after this but nevertheless yeah. sorry greenhorns we're still watching this one oh um, now the admins put the overall and there's now i can do there that's yeah. admin privilege so free free tip for anybody who wants to be tar partake in a tournament if you want your if you like in a serious note if you want to get yourself seen ask early ask well i was gonna say ask often but don't 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 harass us but just be like ask very very early to let us know hey can you get us in there because the early rounds we have more of an opportunity uh after like these late rounds we don't yeah have to exactly. we gotta yeah. watch yeah we, we don't want to miss the it, it's like if we you're watching the, uh, a uh, like, like watching march madness or something and you're like oh well you know what uh the, the two finalists are here for the end of march madness we're gonna go and watch a vod from the first round that's what we're going to do. That's basically the same kind of situation. However, if we do end up continuing past this point, there's a chance to spectate. We will do it. If it's a quick match, we can definitely go watch Greenhorns. That yeah. too. That too. Yeah. So, yeah, definitely. Yeah. So, yeah, I do, I'm just playing and saying, like, we can't promise, but it's, it's it, it may be on the table for sure. Okay. We... Right. I'm going to develop the VC because we'll, we'll have this, um, what's it? What, what the fuck am I doing here? There's Goblin Gang. Uh, well, I could probably tell you which map they've picked. Oh, uh, I know I haven't inside been information. Doing that I've been... Yeah, because you've been one-manning this and they you've had picked. internet problems. Yeah, okay, well... Um, uh, all right, looking at the match chat, uh, they have... The map they've picked is a... Uh, 
a screenshot of uh, of Eratros. So I don't. <laughs> <laughs> that's not a map. They haven't picked their map yet. Uh, that's not a map. No, no, that's just some random nonsense. Um, yeah, well. Okay, we're still waiting. Yeah, it seems. Um, All right. You'd... Yeah, we got a little bit of time to chill. It seems until everything they might, gets up running. They might, they might uh, just do their maps in in um, match chat. To be fair, so <laughs> that is, yeah, that yeah. is true. They're technically meant to do it in there, but they can sometimes do it. Yeah, ideally, they do it in the in the battle fever. You know how it is. It's, if you're in a lobby, you might as well mm. just do the chat. So Although you cannot post, probably. you cannot post privately in front of chat. So I mean. No, you can't. You can't. <laughs> God damn it, Vivesia. Why have you put that in my in my brain now? <clears throat> How dare you? What gives you the right? He's the he's not the pride of Italy. He's the embarrassment of Italy. <laughs> oh, wow. We've been gloves well, off the stream. I, I'm, I'm drinking the pride of dude. Italy. It's called Peroni. Ah. The dude, uh, yeah, like, Aerotross has literally, like, come out as, as using s scripts now. So, you know. Oh, he's scripting. Really. Oh yeah, yeah. He's 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 like he's he's too mad about, about losing all the time. So now he started to to script. So, oh joy. Yeah. Is this is this true? Uh. Oh joy. It is true. It is true. That, yeah. That's yeah. annoying. So um, uh, fuck him. Who's fuck him uh... sideways with a rusty hammer? <laughs> wow, that's very. Uh, that, I'm, I'm, not, that, like, I'm not very patient at the moment. I've had uh, a, I've had a successful uh, week. That is understandable. Yeah. Understandable. Yeah. Understandable. So. Yeah. So who's the one in Bean's video who was playing Aramusha? Who's that? Is that it? Is that them? Oh, um, oh no, they were the BOC. That's, that's BOC. BOC. Aaron. Yeah, that's um. Uh, what's his face? He's he's he used to lag switch and now he's uh, scripting as well. But hopefully he'll be banned again soon. He's been banned nope, like they... six times. Oh no no, they were doing both in the Bean video. Yeah yeah, he used to. He's now he's now scripting as well as lag switching instead of just lag switching. Oh joy. So. Yeah. <laughs> POC Aratros Morales. <laughs> Wait, is that it? <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's correct. No, no, it's it's, it's Ever Mortra Ever Morales, I think is his name, or some some something like that. But Katama is uh, there with the Burns. You know, it's on point. The his Burns are on point. Um, I'm sure they'll get banned eventually, but yeah, I. I Definitely, I'm. I've not got enough patience with, with today to be on stream talking. Nah, it people. is. It is all right. You need a vet point somewhere. How, <laughs> are you hit in any direction, really? Yeah, yeah. Are you okay though? At bare minimum. Like, oh, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. It's everybody else who's, who's going to be worried. Oh know? no! <laughs> <laughs> Do not get in the way of this man. All right, we we have a little bit of time until an eye appears. I'm looking at Normie. We don't have anything. So if you want to turn this into like group therapy venting, uh, want to give us a small taste of what you've had to deal with in the back, if you can. No, no. I think I think I'll just go and get some food, some food whilst we're Okay, waiting. that's um, fair. Um, that, ooh, yeah, that's... just just yes. It looks like from the. Um... Standing, I think What's we'll like? end up with a. Uh, I was meant to, with 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 regard to the tournament for the for the tiebreaker round. I think there'll end up being three teams in it because okay. there are not quite enough. Oh, um, I think it'll be three teams in it. Yeah, um, because of the number of teams we have in the bracket to start off with. Uh -huh. So. Then we will have a tie break, which will probably it'll be two games long. Presume, well, if it's three or four, it's going to be two games long. And then the winners of that tie break will go up to face against the the undefeated team from this from this bracket. Um, and unlike the last one we did, which caused some confusion, which had a um, like a best of five with one map in hand, we are doing a, like a bracket reset type thing. So it'll be two best of three. Well, it'll be one best of three grand final, and if the the team that comes up from the tiebreaker wins wins, then they they have a win again to get to like. So the full shebang. Okay. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. I mean, considering that it's only um, we've only had like four matches so far, four rounds so far, it's it's fine. Oh yeah, no, no one's scripting the tournament. Like, uh, by the way, uh, these. These known scripters, whilst they don't get banned from the game very quickly, uh, they are they banned from tournaments. Like you know, if I Shot see on one sight. of them entering the tournament, yeah, 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 they they they, they get they get the gap. 
you know. Metaphorically speaking. <laughs> they get I the go gap. Belt. <laughs> Everyone's gagged. Little Spaniard pulls up with the gap. Wow. <laughs> yeah, you just, you, yeah. as soon as they uh, pop I'm up, you normally, the also, I normally wait. Yeah, also, I normally wait until just before check-in, so the whole team, if the, if you join with a scripter, the, you will get kicked out and you won't be able to join it again. Ah. Like, you know, just, just don't do that. Oh, wait, mm. we have an eye. So, yeah. You're free from your therapy sessions, man. Hey. We have an eye. <laughs> <laughs> Go yeah, eat the part, calories. The final of the Swiss Thank you. Bye. Bye. Everyone needs food. Yeah. Can we watch the Lemon Kino onesie? In the beginning, yeah. All right. Oh, are you are you, are you making? Are you know it's gonna oh, be. I'm calling it. You're yeah, calling yeah, it. Calling. All right. Okay. Mm. Gotta switch them around to the mm -hmm. right sides. Kinu, and just to change it up. Hmm? No, I'm gonna say we're probably going to see Antonio instead. Go mid. Oh. Just just to contradict freeze. Really? Um, yes. One with the big hitboxes you send mid. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. That's exactly what you do here. Yeah, because you want to psych the opponent out to let them know, like to make them think that you don't know when you really know. Okay, this is the this is how Overwatch should be played. This particular map, Dusk or whatever this is. Yeah, this one. This is this yeah, is the it. night one, yeah. This one. Immortal's going mid. All right, Freeze okay. wins. Freeze wins. GG. GG. Every time, every time he wins, Shinobi is nerfed. <laughs> oh, I wish. <laughs> His comment section you, would love you that. Are shit? Basically, me always. <laughs> oh. Is that what you're getting at? <laughs> oh! No idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Mortal, very good reads there on the light parry. He's on the back foot now, though. Lots of dodges. Oh, he makes the read on Kino, making the read that he was going to dodge. So the guard break bounces. Mortal, one H, not one HP, but one mistake and a dream. Dodging for neutral, light parry's good. Kino takes that 1v1. He's gonna get A for free and go to help at C point. Looks like C is a 3v1 not right now good, for yeah. Goblin Game. Yeah, not that's good. not happening. A for free is the, uh, what is it, the, con the point of... Uh, contention. Not contention. There's a word. I'll come up with it. I'll there. figure it out. Yeah. Crack with the sword. I'm pointing out that onesie was rather quick and the team fight was even quicker. Considering how sometimes like sea fights take what seven minutes? Yeah. They Literally seven minutes. Immediately, yeah. Consolation prize. Pons, there you go. There we go. Both C words. Tremor. Get one to call in Tremor from Mortal Kombat. Ooh. Getting chipped down bit by bit from the one two of Antonio and Living, aka Zoom. Is that Tuba, by the way? Tuba Drama? Oh, it might be. Uh, confirmation for the chat, but yeah, that might be Tuba. Oh. Someone just went flying. Oh! Ooh, nice. GB. Build that. Oh, it is? All right. Devil Tuba. Don't want to get brassed out. Gets headbutted. Oh, <laughs> death by uh -huh. headbutt. Nice knowing you. The hug. I the like it, but I like I, it. it. Okay, so I might be I might be wild here, but uh, did the Hito not do the heavy and then faint the heavy and then GB? Because I'm pretty sure I, the hyper armor got hit, they traded, and they got the GB through the uh, I did not the shot heavy. I can't tell. I'm trying to figure that out, but I, I think that's what happened. Answer on a postcard or clip, please, will be the answer for that one, I think, because I did not spy that. Oh, oh very here nice. comes the mortal going for a ride. Oh, oh but he's back though. He's back up again. Yeah, let's see. One. Let's go. Will he use it properly or just respawn and heal here? I think it's going to be the bottom option. Probably just healing. Ah. Right. Wait a little bit. Sorry about everybody was accounted for. Went ahead and healed up. Three on two mid lane. Hito Kiri is off screen, very low HP. Down. Gets dropped. Antonio's about to get out. Oh, living spiel. Amazing. I let an Anton escape. Kinu manages to get up the ladder, though. Might be able to help out with the fight up here. Immortals fighting against Verp, Verp, Verp. Up. Great reads by Mortal. 
that open space. It's calling for a body to get thrown off it. Kino earlier took it to Immortalum. Immortalum now looking to take it to Kino. 3v2. Oh, oh the tier 3 is not good. Does not go through the top of the stairs. Even if they just stayed there, it might still would have whipped. It's unfortunate. I'm noticing a couple times in this match that people are just letting the Shugoki hug victim just go for the ground and they don't try and hit the new window. They're just letting them sit. Mm -hmm. What are you going to do here? Yeah, Morgan? you basically want yep, to put out. them in hit stun again. You don't want to hit them out of it. Resetting ah. from being hit in the midair. Okay. All right, so the Verp Verp and, and Tuba know that he's standing right there. And yeah, Immortal will immediately respawn and go for it. May have caught them slightly off guard with the timing of it. And apparently it'll There's be enough to secure one. Could be a second here, Goz. We'll have to see. There's Now he's got a rotation here. Immortal did drop there. Got killed by Verp Verp. Ooh. 2v1. Wait, 2v1 I'm now. I'm living down. Kino, oh, I was a, no, they did not want to do that because they heavy the, the reset. Did not want to add the damage. Now, what are we gonna see here? They've got half a bar of revenge right now, getting them norm, getting Normie a little bit lower here. Yeah, they can't really touch him, can they? Yeah, yeah. No, not taking the heavy. But look that at the points. Might have killed, look what's but... on the on the rest of the map. Oh, robbery! Almost they got CO. There oh it is, God. heavy. Lucky out of stam heavy. Gets the shame. No one should ever get hit by an out-of-stam heavy. Point generation there. Possible. It's good. This is, a frick, this is good by good, yeah. WTF. Good play. Can you look at mid real quick? Oh, look at mid. Sorry. All living clearing. Okay, fair, fair, fair. Yeah. All right. Either way, that forced them to go have to focus on C point. So they're still at a deficit here on C. They have one gamer that's living on with health. Antonio's Lemon low. Portal has got to get out of here. Getting oh, chased, chased by Kino. Kino's getting chased. Normie sees it though. Normie jump. might be able to help. Nope. Nope. He's I not think, jumping. Was he sleeping? Was he? I'm <laughs> thinking he was trying to jump, but uh, I don't know. I guess uh, something yeah, like ledges, never know. ledges occasionally do sometimes just eat the input. I've experienced yeah. that personally. Like it, it, don't, it doesn't hit in time. It's like the ledges of old For Honor were instantaneous. You could be able to drop these days. Like it's been for years mm -hmm. at this point, but that can sometimes happen. Yeah, the old inputs just, were based, but it was just variations between the one you had to jump jump first, the other one you'd have to, or, or you'd have to heavy on others. Uh, now it's supposed to be more closely uniform, but there's still, you need to angle your camera like downward on a lot of these where you actually, so it'll actually eat it properly and jump. We got team fights on both ends. Let's keep an eye on this one. Never mind, he just ran away. So let's go to mid where uh, the tuba is not having a fun time on the Hido Kiri. 1v2. But the, the rotation is called for, leaving this to a 1v1. They're confident they can get the job done, and they their assumption was correct. Gonna get the reset. Living has the tier four. Not gonna need it though. Normie gonna get the heal out. He's gonna and, and Living's in a really good spot right now. He's about full on health. He can go rejoin the team fight if he needs to. Uh, now they've got one coming off spawn and Chiquette hanging point, and Immortal can go rotate wherever he needs to go. Yeah, I think they didn't see Tremor, Tuba Tremor down there, so he was hesitant. Oh. Spreading the love again. The Church of Marco Yolo apparently has disciples in the competitive community. Hugs for everyone. Oh, for, let's see what they're doing. They're Nothing. all accounted for. I think Living's going to be peeling. The other one's going to be running away. There you go. Normie again popping a buff for, for Living. That's what's so good about uh, JJ's Tier 1 and Tier 3. You can just pop it and run away and you've already helped with the two fight or 1v1 it's super super good oh by the sound of that it looks like we Some have buddies. yep someone in the ghost world yep that'll be immortal lots of little 1v1s i've noticed immediately having to try and keep all of them in frame not too many actual gags go whoa what was mid lane <laughs> electrocution noises. i was gonna say mid lane <laughs> oh that's just unfortunate ah breaking and immediately out he still has the tier four running, by the way. He does. And that's yep. It. And he and knocks again. him down again, and here we go. <laughs> Good timing. Not a third time, though. Gonna uh, get parry window. Didn't Normie whiff there. Maybe. Tier four by Antonio. Tier three is available. It's online. Don't even need it. Now he's got a free target. 
you know, does not have the tier four, it's gone. Tier two is online. Yeah, the jug is popped. That oh, was oh my God, the bow is living. That was bullying. What is it? That's the third bow he whiffs this much. Twice because the enemy dodged, once because it hit and the stairs. Off the revive, revive is good. Revive is good. It's good. Yes, yeah, so he did wall bounce. Yeah. I wasn't sure. They're still in this. Unironically, they are still in this. Yeah. WTF, Two not out. take. They oh, they're going to get an A point, maybe. Oh. They don't I get did. the rotation. Burp calling for it. They got it. Triple cap right now from WTF. This is major. This is big. I'm thinking that they're going to lose mid lane here shortly, though. Antonio's no, down there won't. by getting stopped by Trimmer. Yeah. Exactly. Jakek going to go back and heal. Immortal and doesn't, is, is going to come over to A point. Going to get oh, Burp. Wow. Oh, that's going to be one out for sure. That's going to be an execution as well. Kino could not get... Oh, that Kino was a get really nice plunge. What? That's not TG. That's just weird. They're down a gamer, and they going for plunge attacks. Bruh. Push and see. <laughs> Kintama could already hear the angry German noises. Oh, Hello. <laughs> 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 yeah, Living's not having a great time. Living's oh, not man. having a good time. Up. Yeah, uh, Kino went for the finisher. Heavy there. You can see the fire start up from the finisher unblockable. But yeah, that plunge attack was. It could have, like, turned it all around, but no, no luck there from Kino. Yeah, I don't know if there were. I didn't. I don't think there was a GB. I don't think there was any setup for it, so. I wasn't sure we... Oh. Huh? What? Defenders Lemon just jumped out oh, right after. Oh! That ah. was the game waiting for him to revive? Maybe? I got confused. Kind of like the tier 4, um, kind of like the tier 4 revive ability the where the game yeah. ends after you revive it. I think that's what happened. I've never seen that interaction before, but that seems like what it was waiting on. Mm. One nil to the Goblin Gang. Uh, we're nerfing um, hit stuns, but we are buffing uh, the tier one from Ocelot. That way you can really BM your opponents by just sitting there and waiting Apparently. indefinitely to respawn. <laughs> yeah. And they're just going to sit there and rage and quit Hold the tournament. Hold the tournament hostage until the admin <laughs> comes in to intercede. I'll get a second. Right now. I'm going to have a quick swig of water as well. Automatic. You know, yeah, that 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 would that's that's an automatic disqualification going forward. But we're gonna let it slide this time. We're I mean, we're kidding, obviously. But <laughs> <laughs> if that's actually an interaction, that would be funny. If that could, you could actually hold up hold up a game. I mean, it would suck if, if I were on the enemy team. I'd be pissed. But uh, it's funny to watch. Buff ghost? No. Please no. That's how you go from angry German noises to angry gamer noises. Yeah. This has been a fun tournament, like, a little, little funsy, experimental one just to see what happens. We've already had some enlightening moments from mm -hmm. the interactions alone. Like, for me, Kido Kiri might become even more critical for ganks, or at least characters with strong alpha damage could be significant. And we've seen the evolution just over this tournament, Goz, of Pirate, for example. Pirate ganks have changed just alone. Yeah drastic differences especially on the pirate you know we have you can't uh you can't gunshot for confirms anymore uh there's a lot of different there's a lot of variations that uh of various ganks now that's gonna have to be changed like shinobi gank has been dr drastically adjusted as well however there is a, a a tight timing that you can get on a slightly delayed reset uh on the bash there's still that but it's going to be really difficult to tackle those types of situations. And I think that that's partly the intent of the devs is to make it so that, you know, you can still do some ganks, but it's drastically different. You have to have very tight timings on it. You can't make a mistake because if you do, you're going to get punished for it. And that seemed to be what the what uh, the inclination was coming from uh, from JC. So, you know, I just realized Burp 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 is only rep 16 which is interesting overall. So, interesting. Bro's hmm. running Mark for Death instead of the trap. Oh, who is Bro in Let's this see, context? see, what's Lemons? Oh, Keen who's running uh, the Bear Trap. Yeah. Ah. Oh no, so he, yeah, he's running Bear Trap. Uh, was it the other Bear one? Lemons. 
Yeah. What's his rep on OC? Three? Oh, he has everything. Interessante. Are we watching this? Are we watching the onesie again? Yep, here it goes. Kino took the took it last time. I think he also took it in the uh, the team fight that happened later. So Immortal's looking for revenge here. Hmm. Kino's looking for an out. He's in the middle of his enemy minions. Doesn't want to get killed here. Gonna be able to step to the side, get a little bit of heavy damage off the GB. Really good read here. Both players looking for the bash. Kino's got better bash apparently. Dodge attack comes out. The GB is good. And by I mean dodge, I mean dodge. But yeah, GB is good, and that's gonna be it. Kino takes it again. 1v1 yeah, this mortal. This time it looks like they even take in C. Unless <gasps> Normie just. Not wall splat. Is Not a wall splat. Defenders captured zone C. Mm, unfortunate. That's a Sorry, much I didn't mean to talk over start you. for them now. Winning B and C in the beginning. And looks like they're taking A from spawn. But Goblin Gang immediately pushing mid. They'll have it. Yeah, it's going to be a gank. But. Uh, oh, wait. No, no. Just one. Mortal's going to get up here. Not going to stall it, though. Or you're going to stall it, but not going to stop it. It was really close timing, though. That is yeah, just that's annihilation. Ocelot. That. Ocelot is, you know, one of those players, one of those heroes you can just... <laughs> <laughs> it's a killer gaming! Let's go! Just the pure, like, Mortal's, like, looking with his eyes on one oh. side of each, uh, each side of the pillar, like, yo, dog. You gonna you gonna hit this pillar again? How many how many hits does it take to get to the center of the Tootsie Pop? By the Tootsie Pop being the center of this pillar. <laughs> that Tootsie Pop's got splinters. <laughs> the world may never know. What's Kino doing? I have no freaking clue, but I was gonna ask the same question. <laughs> what? Getting that bench, that's what he's getting right now. Oh lord. If he's winning that, then we have the answer, but until the winning part, no. Oh, nah, it gets caught by a mortal. Very close, very close, very close. If if he would have had enough time or enough PO for the the bash finisher, that would have been it for. But he still would have got killed though, because they had uh, was it Chikekar or something coming off screen there? But Normie chased that... Kinu down during the poltergeist. He knew which way it was going immediately. Can I help it? I press the right button. There we are. Antonio, oh, I want to see what Kino. What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, like, I, I understand he's trying to get away, but this is not just your average gamer you're trying to get away. It's Antonio, my friend. Yeah. Someone's in the polter, guys. Two members oh. down on WTF. Nice. And that'll be the final one. Ace. Long XC. Is it going to get interrupted? Interrupt? Yeah, Do we have an ocelot nearby? No, we don't. We don't. We don't. There's somewhere else. On A point, Kino and Immortalum again. Immortalum takes that one. Immortalum's going to get A. Clear it out. Kino dead again. Score goblin line. Up by one, so... on, on Goblin Gang is from Kino, I guess. Uh, I'm on, uh, he, I mean, he died tw uh, three times. Fair, 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 fair. What? I'm, I'm quiet. Okay, now. so he's going for the back cap. Okay. Yeah, it's good, actually. You need to... No, deal. Anton yeah. is not trusting, <laughs> though. <laughs> no, Anton does he's not, not trust. convinced that he can leave, yeah. The but yeah, this is the tier one. from the tier one here now, because Anton is really not sure. Can I leave? Can I not? Yep. Kino making a decision to go to mid. Clearing. Gonna get peel for teammates. Yeah, that, that, that's gonna get the peel for sure. Yes, no, no. They died anyway. Yeah, living what? was just threatening everyone at once. Look Damn. at the shoe go go. Shoe go go. The parry. Let's go. Ah, oh, nope, nope. Burp choosing not to go Reset. for the deflect. Plays it safe. You know, preventing him from healing, also preventing himself from healing. Should step back potentially. Hey, just to run away. Don't don't roll. If he dies again what? from rolling, I will. <laughs> and comes Antonio. <laughs> Wee! Does that count? Uh... <laughs> hey! Oh! Living finally got a bow to work. Let's go. Where's Kino? Kino dead. is currently yeah, dead, going up the stairs. Oh, oh, oh. They're okay, going to I, just, uh, I will heal and then we're going to continue the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, gonna, gonna, oh, speaking of tier three. Oh, that all. Oh, I thought for sure Chiquette was going to have that land. Goodness. Tonio with the backstab. Uh, not yeah. in danger was, of dying. Was, and... The next time he's just putting himself into any recovery, yeah. he's going to feel the loss. Understandable. Have a nice day. Yep. <laughs> yep. Just leaves. Like I'm out. That's good. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. You guys, you guys, you earned that. 
Oh, more ghosts. There comes the yes, tier immortal four. ghost. Tier four, very close. Uh, cap the point. They get tier four, and they already get verb half. Communication is we're gonna keep verb low. Don't kill him yet. Uh, he's gonna have to get rotation here to a point though. Mortal is too super super low, so they're gonna yeah, have to. He get... should keep getting the revenge. Oh, it's the pillar doing it's, its the pillar, yep. again. But Kino, Kino off screen. There it is. Did not get mid lane. Had nobody clearing the mids. Ooh! Ow! Oh, went for the Shigoki and got uh, JJ instead. They had such a strong start. Yeah, they did. They oh. had some momentum, but look at the oh. scoreline now. It is falling fast. Goblin Gang sizing up a pretty succinct 2-0, I think, here, chaps. So I think that, that that gank they tried to pull off here, I think that the Hito did the follow-up light, and instead of confirming the uh, the finisher bash from Ocelot, I think that allowed the teammate to, uh, the other gamer to roll away. Hmm. I could be wrong. I... I... I'm trying to, like, there's been some cool macro play, so I'm trying to keep the free cam, but we're also trying to keep yeah. it on the fight at the same time. Yep. Got a bit of a 2v1. Oh, Just Chuck on head. the edge of that. Oh, no. Unfortunate. <laughs> oh, that was tier four. Living's going nuts. He's got the win button, but Vub gets revenge just in time. Lock down your teammates, Living. Yes. 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 yes! Oh, Hyper Armor don't care. Hyper Armor does not care about your tier 4. Juggy does time. not care. Boom. That's it. Another good thing for, like, Hidokiri, or another interesting thing, like, Hidokiri is, is, is that. So if you have anything that, like, knocks down or does some kind of, uh, status effect like that, you know, you can just Hyper Armor through. That is true. That's a fair shout, actually. Final scoreline is looking authoritative for the Goblin Gang. Their high, their lowest earner almost above their highest earner. And that's interesting because as uh, Spaniard points in the chat, Kimu spent half the bloody match as a ghost. Did I think, I, I feel, honestly, I don't mean to like, throw, I'm not trying to throw shade at Kino. Obviously, they're they're a good player. Uh, I'm... I mean, I, halfway through that match, not, not even like a third of the way through that match, I'm starting to wonder if they're memeing. Maybe. There, there is potential. This is a more chill vibe tournament, so yeah. but there may be a point where we're like, all right, we're at a good time. Let's have a funny. Mm. Uh, I don't think Go so. You don't think so? <laughs> don't think so? <laughs> no, no. Oh, no. well. I was so close to winning the tourney three weeks ago. Yeah. I think they want revenge. I don't think they're just memeing. Ah, right. Okay. I just want to see a, a team named the Meme Dream Team. I don't think we've seen that yet. Fortunately not in this iteration. We almost have a finished round, actually. Looks like everything else was succinct two zeros. The only one is Kazuya Mishima, mostly machine. Outstanding. Yeah, they need, they need to they need to go zero and two on this one. That way we can go zero two two zero zero two two zero zero two two zero. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes. It sound like a text to speech program slowly dying. I was gonna, yeah, I was gonna say it sounds like sounds like binary, but with twos instead of ones. Hmm. That's just not binary then. That's not how that works at all. <laughs> I I said with twos instead of ones. All right, fine. I'll let you off the hook this time. Go maybe get the teller in here. He actually does binary stuff. I think. Well. <laughs> I. No J comment. <laughs> Understandable. JTEX, spectate. We have an eye. Are we going in from current position or are we going from uh, beginning of game? Uh, yeah, I would say beginning at this point. Uh, right. this is, it's the last game. game. Yeah, it's 1 0 to I mean, I mean, the Mishima. last game before we break off the, 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 the. Yeah. For the Swiss. Yeah. All right. From beginning, back to Temple Garden. Once the Zild stomping grounds are competitive, we have. Belly. Although a pirate is on deck for this temple garden, we did not see a temple garden for the last one. Yeah. Just to quickly explain what chat asked. Um, the next ones are the tiebreakers because we're gonna have like a one everything in the Swiss round with us gobbling. But then afterwards, like second, third, maybe even fourth place are going to have the same score. 
Mm. So we need tiebreakers there. And the team that wins the tiebreakers is going to move to a grand finals, which has the usual bracket reset system. So if you come in as the team that lost before, you need to win two best of three. If you want everything, just the one. That is a very turquoise ocelot. I just realized that V-Ray's rocking. That's a very pretty ocelot. Sorry, I got distracted by colors. What's going on? Color of blood, violence. There we are. Segways, Canada. That actually did quite a bit of damage to the Hito. Dropping their own. Nice. Just puts it in the clavicle anyway. JTAC has no fear. No, JTAC actually tried to open this fight with an external on the other Hitokiri and unfortunately slightly whipped just enough to Oros and go through right there. No, actually that would have been don't able to get Don't feed Venge now, don't feed Venge now. <laughs> it's really close to Venge. Externals. Okay, right. Uh, go for the pirate. They recognize that. They got away from it. Ow. There we go. Now he can touch again. Uh... Uh, uh, oh wow, uh, did that reset so stand him up? Yeah, it, he just stood up. Yeah, Hito did not uh, go for the go for the uh, damage, so. So is that a new feature? Maybe? Because of the carryover, that when you hit the, the third one within hit stop, the reset makes you stand up. That is interesting. So so what you're are you suggesting so guard break throw counts one your first uh, opener counts as two and then your third one your second hit you know counts as three so then they immediately stand up off the yeah that's up. what it looked like exactly yeah. I've, this this is stream not only is it good data we're feeding freeze's next video idea immediately yeah. we're just building a list of oh, things no, to yeah. test Eight, yeah, because I, I, you might be right about that because if they tightened up on it, because basically, you know, most most heroes get two hits off of the, uh, off of a, a guard break throw or a par parry that are out of stamina. So with the new rules, that does kind of make sense. I, I think you might be onto something. Yeah, since we pointed out that the hit stun values carry over through even the pins and everything and the hogs and all, that might even be the case on on the knockdown stun. Yeah. Ooh. That would be interesting to see. I mean, it, I think for sure we want to test it, but I mean, from what we've seen today, we've seen it a few times that we've happened, and we're like, you know, that that looks kind of different or whatever. But and so yeah, I, I think that it does seem like it. Uh, it does seem that way. Ooh, been too early with the GB there. Was it? Yeah. We have vague clouds on the map. That's why the audio is going a little bit funny. Venge is being th threatened, not held yet by Nitro. Don't Nitra, touch, but don't touch, JJ, don't touch. <laughs> We're clenching. Uh, yep, yep, hold now. now Nitro touch. is a now beast. Touch. Oh no. No, the GB, I mean, the, the beast, the, the bash, whatever. The, the, bush, the, the bash, heavy, the heavy is good. The bush, the heavy, the winning. And cannot do the gunshot anymore. We just saw how that resets the hit stun. They got a parry from the JJ. Uh, they could have gone for the uh, action, the water plank there, but kind of cancelled out of it last second. They bottled it. Oh, going to try and stand. Oh, JTAC not going to get saved here. Goes for the guard break. Great read on V Ray. What? <laughs> not going to get the XE. Semper, Semper just Barat running in the from the back. Let's see what they going to come back any second now. Oh, yeah, that's respawning, maybe. No, he's run nope, okay. going yeah, to yeah, running away. Nobody has C yet, so A is the only point generating points. I'd say it's a good call. Yeah, fair point. Yeah, they got a they got a rotation from spawn. Jindu's there. They're bleeding out. They're still going to be contesting C, though, because rhythm's coming in. They need this execution really bad. They got oh, it. no, excuse me. No, Jindu's just holding off for the, the pirate. So they'll get C and the execution. Buy one, get one for Eagles. Very nice, yeah. Two for one. Oh, I thought for sure that was going to land. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I thought that. I just did the, the, the angle. Jindu. Tier one and tier two are online for Jindu. I would say you use one of them. They come back so quickly. You need to utilize that. Mm, you know, I just, I'm just saying that might have helped a little bit. Venge. Light. There we are. But in comes yeah, Semper. Well, they've got their tier one and tier two still online. Not using it. Jindu, I swear to God. I swear to God. Okay, Can please. You swear to yourself. Is that a thing? I swear to myself. They would be dead. Look, look at the damage. Look at it. They're so low. 
I'm sorry, I don't mean to be critical. I'm just saying, like, you know, you have the opportunity. It's there. Ah, oh, the gunshot kills them. But surprise! Uh, oh, actually, Crentley opted to go to A, which means the people who showed up over here is actually the pirate. Gun, gun battle surprise! Two for one! Already got tier four. Didn't even realize. Wow. Nitro beast beasting, yeah? Yeah, off screen yeah. must have been farming in mid and A. Up. Oh, oh good read. And Rhythm in the mix up. Oh, oh, for the pin! Skewer good! Intro beast goes for two! Nothing more to be said. That was just a solid performance by Nitro Beast. Gunpowder surprise to get him off balance. Almost gets the kill. Recovers. Oh, Creddy needs some help, though. Oh, Creddy doesn't want help. He wants violence. No. Don't want violence. Okay, Decides to not take the punish. <laughs> yeah, that's smart. Move away. So, heals. Yep. Get out while you can. Semper. Teammate was there to peel, gets that, gets the gunshot externally. The thing about pirate that's so that they're so good about the wow. Ow. Oh, the so bash. many resets happened just now. Oh dear. Good. Good. Very nice. Good peel. Yeah. Up. Oh, shouldn't get away, unfortunately. Nitro Beast now gonna get deflected and dead. Is there somebody there at sea? There is no. Jindu to try and stop him, but has very little health, but they're eating, chipping away at Rhythm, and Kree's going to be able to come in here and actually stop Rhythm from getting to sea point. JTAX there. Everybody's accounted for here. Yeah, everybody's accounted for. We got two mid, one offside of, of, of mid here in the face of Rhythm, and then you've got uh, whoever's on A point there, so Semper's they're all on accounted a. for. Yeah, two just spawned from mostly Machine. And yeah, looks like everyone's going to be rotating back to, to this extended fight in not they, even mid lane anymore, just the mid. Yeah, I think the one thing I would critique a little bit is that they know where everybody is. They just had somebody come off a of spawn uh, for our mostly machine. Uh, they had time, they being uh, Mishima, had the opportunity to go to C point, or sorry, to mid lane to help with the team fight and let one of their teammates rotate out to C to try and heal. Hmm. Jindu. Gotta be a little bit where he gets caught, unfortunately, ends up going down. Just supplying someone in chat with the bracket link real quick. There you are, good chap. Fred Lee, gonna be coming out of spawn. Okay, can we take a second to look at the macro for five minutes, please? Scoreboard, here macro we are. Macro and the, yes, the scoreboard. 15 uh, I mean, two. technically it's very close. I mean, the, the renown is obviously different, but in terms of feats, it's almost identical. Uh, yeah. The tier, the, the bottom two uh, for machine are a little bit behind. They don't, uh, they don't have as much, but uh, it, the feats are very similar. Hmm. Where is Creddy going? Nail Bomb goes off, clips Nitro Beast. That's a heavy, heavy loss on this. JTAC yeah. gets, has to put, gets revenge, actually saving JTAC's life Ooh. just Ooh. in time. Creddy takes it's C. It's the push to heavy, it's good. They're gonna uh, take one with him. B-Rave gets the kill though, and the XC. That will be no chance of resurrection, but what's Creddy gonna do? Creddy has to assist. They they got a chance to go offside while that team fight was happening. They got a chance to come off, get their tier one, heal up on C, and then come back and rejoin the fight here. They're not going to be able to stop this gamer from going to A, but their teammate off spawn yeah. is. They're yeah. not going to get the heal. They're going to flip this A point right now, Verb. Nitro. Ha they have oh, try for the parry. No dice. Nitro has got oh, oh, pillar. Oh, wow. Hello. Ghost parries. Nice no. to see you again. I cast your curse this entire you situation. You did. You actually did. Now fix it. I literally did. I, Ooh, if there's no we'll fixing confirm, this. Confirm. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like they tried to GB, but I think it bounced. Hmm. Oh, was it? Oh. I think so. I mean, I, I maybe then again, oh, maybe fair, I'm fair, maybe fair. you know. I thought it was just a fame to tell you. I'm, I'm just sure. making stuff up as I go along at this point. <laughs> that's just that's just what we're doing at this point. <laughs> it's good vibes. It's good vibes. Jindu in a bad vibes yeah, situation. It's really close, by the way, point wise. Yeah, oh it yeah, it is. Look at that. What is? I thought mid lane's that. crucial. So, yeah, they just win it. Mishima up, needs no. somebody on C to stack, and they need to get somebody in mid to let this guy go heal. And they'll be in actually pretty decent spot here to take this. They can clear out mid. They'll be at a they'll be at a, a a point advantage. Go double breaking. There's four one v ones here. Whoosh. It's a duels tournament. What is going on? It's a duels tournament. I need to kill like five minions or something. Uh oh, oh no, no, about no, to no, drop no. here, maybe. Oh, P-Ray drops, J okay, JTAX goes down, Jindu goes down, they're going to be able to go, at Machine is going to take C-Point right now for free, okay, Nitro sees the opportunity, he's going to go and try and stop him, we're going to barely make it in time, 
Oh, the beer! Oh, oh, that's oh. tier two! It's epic! It's epic! Long X, long X, the kill. Long X. Let's go long get the flip! It might be in time to get the... Sure two people are down oh. right now for Majishima! Counted. Epic flip! Flash Amazing break. play! Right now for Machine. Oh no, that was the. I think Cookie is gonna get flipped though. Gonna... No, no, no. Jindu is gonna jump off point. point. For no, reason. he's got a teammate behind him. Oh, he did. This is down now. Two people. They're both accounted for on a point. This is maybe GG right now for Mishima. Machine may reset, stop the bleeding here for this set. Down to one. We have got Zipper Paratus eyeing down. Looking down the barrel of a Jindu in his face, and he's going to take it to town with a tier four and the big heavy. That's all it is. Machine is going to come mm. back from this, reset the bleed. Somebody's We're going to a game good. three, folks. Mm. That was a well timed counter break. That bear trap hitting at that time to allow not only one, but two people executed with no chance of return. That was, that is, to steal a phrase from, like, tactical shooters these days, that is getting timinged right there. That is nothing else but raw, unadulterated timing. V-Ray with the tier two bear trap and the kill, and just, like you said, the timing of the, uh, of the executions on both players, that was an amazing play from Mishima. The 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 absolute map awareness, uh, the communications. I would have loved to have hear the comms uh, going on behind the scenes here, folks. Like I have sobered up completely. This <laughs> is the testing grounds ganking tournament, my friends. This is what we came to see today. This is exactly those little bitty those, those plays like that. Uh, it just feels so good to see. Waiting for the next eye. One to one. Game three. Are we going to Sank Bridge and are we going to cry about it? Oh, I'm I will going try. for a high force. I will. <laughs> I don't think high force banned, right? Let's see. No, high force. Uh, it's the comp map. High force uh, available. Pool. I'm gonna. We're gonna see a high force or a beachhead. That's what I'm going for. I'll be right back. Oh, you calling it? All right. Oh, then. I love high force. By the way, be, be down for that. Wait, unironically, yeah. are you capping? Are you are you a high force enjoyer, Freeze? I am. I am very much so. Why is that? And I'm, I'm not even kidding. I really like high force. Yeah. What is it about high force that you quite like? Out of curiosity. I'm, I don't know. I guess I played a lot of Warlord back then. So. Ah, right. Oh, it's a joy. The, the spirit no, of fish. I think that, no, the whole aesthetic of the map, I really enjoy. Hmm. It wasn't 1-1, by the way. It was 2-0. Oh, it was 2-0. Oh, I had the teams the wrong way around, possibly, then. Ah, that was on me. Okay, I am Nitwit. So are we moving to the tiebreakers, then? Most likely. JTAX MM. By the way, do you not enjoy uh, High Fort? No, High, high Fort is, is all right. I just didn't expect you to be a High Fort enjoyer. Oh. I, By the uh, way, do you remember the first hmm? map we played against each other? Was that High Fort? It was High Fort. Yeah. Ah. At least the first time I remember specifically playing against you because mm. I knew who you were at that point. And yeah, that was High Fort. Oh, damn. Throwbacks. Sometime season one, like first few weeks, I guess. Yeah, I mean, hell, that might have been caught on my early uh, like stream. I don't know, my early stream recordings are like close alpha and beta. That wouldn't have been on there unless we somehow ran into each other then. I mainly played duels back then. Oh, you were a duels gamer. Yeah. All right, so I assume because it's tiebreakers, so WTF, Kazuya Mishima, Pink Underwear, Mostly Machine, Greenhorns, and Donut Glazers are all in ties. Technically so is set up a Mishima, unless I'm misunderstanding how Swiss works. Uh, Frozen Reapers is out. However, Goblin Gang are your definitive winners for this evening. No matter which way this you know, bit of bread gets cut. Oh dear. You're a three-way tiebreaker. Yeah, we'll wait well, for- I don't know how we're handling this, to be honest. I imagine Spandit is having to fight through the internet apocalypse to make a new bracket and get that all set up. Shout out, mm -hmm. shout love to the admin for today. Like, like on top of already having the extra mental stack of the the game does not limit in custom game people. So he's probably having to constantly restart matches because people are uh, setting up the games wrong. He's having to do it on like a hotspot connection that's dying because of the rain. Yeah. Well, it was actually all right for us, right? We didn't have a single match that we started spectating where we said, oh no, 
they picked the wrong characters. No, Spoiler. everyone did follow the rules. Nobody was like, oh, I, I'm playing Elimination, onesies with, I don't know, Magi. Hmm. Nobody did that. All right, so we're just going to be chilling for a moment until we get the thumbs up from Spaniard that the tiebreakers are ready to go, because, yep, we will be broadcasting all of that, and that will be a traditional actual bracket we can follow, like, from left to right. Well, to fill some dead air, I've got a story for you. Sure, go for it. So once upon a time, there was a man. Oh, no. This man liked beer. Yes. He liked beer so much that he went to go pop the bottle on the wall and realized that he couldn't pop the bottle and he didn't know why. So this the... man looked at the bottle opener on the wall and there was something mm. in that. Do you know what was in the bottle opener on the wall that was stuck in it? Another bottle cap? Another bottle cap. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Are you unable to open your bottle with a lighter or any other utensil? Oh no, in the house? I, I'm an American. I do it with my teeth. Oh. <laughs> Wait, then you don't want to do that as an American. You'll damage your teeth, and dentistry's expensive there. Yeah, it is. That's very true, very true. You should true. be taking I mean, the and, safest and, options possible. And 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 to co and and you know to and to realize that I mean you got to keep in mind like you know us Americans we eat a lot of sugar so every time I open a bottle not only do I get a scratch on the tooth I chip another chip another tooth. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No. Yeah. So before long I'm gonna before long I'm gonna be like Asmund Gold you know you ignore the problem <laughs> it goes away. <laughs> Christ. And now by the way, kids, do not open your beer bottles or anything. Teeth. It's not something you should do. What? <laughs> Just learn the skill of opening bottles with every utensil you have in the house. A table. Just do it with a table. I, mm. you, didn't I post a video of me opening a beer bottle with a piece of paper? Yeah, you uh, you Twitter. did post that one time. I a remember that. A piece of paper? Yeah. So you like fold it a certain way so it has enough structure to... Yeah. I don't yeah. know. I, I sh I'm sure I still have it somewhere. Clip, right? That's smart. Okay, uh, announcement here. I just looked in the tournament's announcement on the Discord. Uh, Pink Underwear and W2F will be joined in the tiebreaker bracket with... Uh, oh, wait, that's old. Never mind. Uh, I thought that was actually a Reddit <laughs> announcement. That was actually the I old one before it. the game. Oh, wait, uh, do you, you found the bracket? No. There is something <laughs> being up there. Video of me open the beer bottle with paper. <laughs> I mean, uh, I'll DM it to you. You can show it to everybody. Sure, if you want. why not? We'll go for it. I don't know. If you want to show our DMs. Oh, just open it here. oh yeah, sure. Why not? Hang on. Right, I'm it now. Let me do this. Has Storm got a team yet? Apparently, the answer is no. Tiebreaker bracket is live. First match live. is Pink Underwear versus Kazuya Mishima. Yeah. That was such a close game that we just watched, though. I, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't, I didn't realize either that the teams were swapped. I was like super stoked to see that. It's like a, it's like a comeback. But yeah, huge, huge ups. For uh, for that last game coming out on the top of it, who was uh, that was um, Machine Mishima. Hmm. Yeah, Mishima came out on top of that versus Machine. I yeah, I I was actually we did it, we did it, y'all. Look at round four. O two two o o two two o o two. Oh yeah, look at that. It happened. We did it. Our goal's been a. I can retire now. I can retire happily. I, I can die happy now, guys. I can die happy. You can we die did it. happy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, tiebreaker. Oh, there we go. We have to tiebreaker. Yeah, yeah. It's a separate thing. Here we are. I did see it on it. It's going to be... Oh, is, 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 is Cobra referencing... Oh, no, you speak. Is Cobra referencing the gamer who was trying to get people, like, last minute? Maybe? Uh, let me see if I can find the chat. Anyway, uh, so we're saying, so... We have the actual setup, Kazuya Misima Pink Underwear Revenge. 
target will be I pop balloons, most likely. I think I, yep, I have I pop balloons. So we you also have the video if you want. I, I have the video. I am uh, quick. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, yeah. Yes, I am uh, quickly read, uh, <laughs> j uh, doing the setup to what? show the video. It's fine. Yep, the, still, vid the video. Have, it's still a tournament. I'm fine, fine. fine. I'm just saying. We're, we're Main's video is good. The clip of Light Boogie yelling at both teams, hoping they lose, is good. <laughs> yeah, that that that's amazing. Anything with Raven is TOS, so <laughs> that one's out. Oh, good old Raven, <laughs> TO. He's provided so much entertainment to this community. I mean, does a VLC player work like that? Hang on a minute. Can I do that? No. Uh, hang on. I'll show this <laughs> damn video uh, unless we get a die. Hang on. I'm doing this. I'm committed now. <laughs> uh, let me check. We still don't have an eye, which means I can still try this. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry about that. I'm still working on it. <laughs> I recommend you people learn in that. Okay. Hang on. Uh, uh, you know what? Let, let's do it. Let's do it. OG display capture. Oh God! What is oh, happening? That's the wrong one. That's the wrong one. Primary oh, monitor. There we are. Whoa! Yeah, you, you saw Whoa! My production hey! Setup. Hey! What the hell is that? <laughs> <laughs> you, you, <laughs> You, you saw my production setup. It's cursed as shit. It is just a bunch of windows fit to screen. There we are. Here is Freeze's educational guide to opening a beer bottle. Yeah. Oh, okay, got it. Yeah, piece of paper. Uh huh. Paper, right? Oh, there is sound. Okay. Oh, it is playing sound. Nice. Yep. They fixed that in OBS. Yeah, and then. That's a glass table. That's right. Ooh. I would, you know. I am, I'll be honest with you, Freeze. I'm really hoping the glass table shatters in the midst no, of all this. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's possible. Because people on Twitter didn't believe me. I said it's easy. Yeah. I mean, it yeah. looked very easy apart from you. <laughs> I struggled a little. <laughs> yeah. You know what's great? No, you can open a TikTok? A... Have you made that a TikTok? You should make that a TikTok. That yeah. that legitimately would blow up as a TikTok. Yeah. If, if I've got the yeah. uh, the the monitor capture going on while we're waiting for the eye still, uh, you know what? Behind behind the scenes view, that's nothing. This is my production Jesus setup. Christ. This is my OBS. This is all my stuff I use here. Chat my Spotify. It, yes, it's all very well and good. This this is the cursed second monitor. Hmm. Mm. You run a 1080p on your monitors, right? Uh, I've got two 1080s and a 1440p. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh, I right on up. cue! The perfect stall, Norgoz! The perfect stall! <gasps> Thank you, Freeze! Yeah. <laughs> Epic stall. Ooh, uh, we're gates. seeing a Citadel Gate for the first time today. I... On I run, I love Citadel Gate. It's a classic. It is a classic. It's a throwback. It's... It goes back as far as, hmm, is it breaking NDA? I'm not sure. It goes but back a while. It was the while, first though. map that was ever shown publicly. It's the OG map. Mm -hmm. We'll go with that. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. One of the first maps. Also, if you were going to reference something from the closed NDA alpha from <clears throat> nine years ago, I'm fairly sure yeah, you can talk about it at this point. It's, I, you know, I mean, we've already kind of skirted some of that a little bit over the years, and, and, and devs seem to not take issue with it. But, uh, yeah. yeah, like, it, it's it's been almost 10. I think that's uh, the 10 is the number we're looking for. But, yeah, it's, <laughs> no, it was definitely one of the first. I think it was a five-year NDA, so I think we for a while. I don't five was, remember, five or six to be years, with you. Something like that. I literally so, don't. If only we looked ones, at the fine print. Ah, well. Well, I did, but I, it's been so long. Like, I, I don't remember. I Usually they're 10 Bro, now. I, I wish I secretly recorded I like archive footage from back in the day of yeah, those, because yeah. there were some wild so things back in closed alpha. Yeah. I was hoping for people to release footage when they... Uh, but nobody uploaded anything. Yeah. So when, when, really they, when they what? There. When you they what? Off. You know with that, that Christmas alpha that had the NDA on it? Oh, Where yeah. You... Oh. The one from, what was it, 2015? 16. 16? Yeah, Christmas 2016. Oh. When I that think... NDA fell, I thought people would upload stuff, but nobody did. Nobody mm. actually I bothered. Look, I, I, used to, I used to have it on my profile as to when it was. I, I was in early, I was in Tech Test 2, and that was also uh, like fourth quarter. But I'm pretty sure it was 2015 for mine. 15. Like, First time I yeah. played was summer 16. 
if you played 15, then I was like early alphas. We're super, super, super we're all early old stuff. here. Yeah, we're old here. Yeah, that one. That, I, I only say that because it was on my account. I've said it before, mm. and, and there's been no issue with it. So I'm like, all right, well, I'll do. Even Steven so far in the in the. The long and protracted fight in the mid lane, as is tradition on Citadel Gate. Unless one team gets a firm foothold and wipes, you're going to see this kind of back and forth, tit for tat. People respawn in and out consistently. Doubly so when there are two Ocelot on the table. Absolutely, the Ocelot's tier one adds a little bit of a uh, little bit of a uh, flair to the opportunities of rotations nice. and whatnot. Adds some pressure, also. Speaking of, ow. What's going ganks. on over here? More ganks. Oh, the peel. I mean, the peel. The, the, no the confirm, pin. confirm. No confirm, yeah. confirm, confirm. <laughs> they did, you know, they did. They threw a heavy and fainted it. Shinobi threw a heavy, mm. fainted it. That was the confirm. So it's interesting how this is changing the way that we know ganks. So now we've got options. Okay, okay. is this red? Is it a GB? Is yeah, it a heavy? Exactly, because people were uh, expecting like the light confirm mm -hmm. of the walk the plank yep. and people would parry early to cover GB as well and with the just heavy faint and then parrying in that direction basically. Yeah, confirms it. No confirm, confirm it is. Yeah. I like, uh, I like having, oh, that was, oh, oh no, no, that was simply oh. reduced. Never mind. I shot that up was, already. <laughs> that was reduced, but it, it still worked out because the throw, it didn't reset them back to neutral where they could do it. They, they, this throw still happened. They still ended up getting a wall splat from that. Speaking of wall splat, we're in danger of getting some fire and brimstone. Uh, not quite. Wait. We might still see it. Dodging. Oh. Uh, oh. Going for the bash. What's going on around the map? We've got a fight on Blue Dome, fight on A. Actually, a gank on A specifically. Let's hop over there. I said hop it, hop over, hop over there. There we go. We have to find the right one eventually. <laughs> We're in A fight. Let's go. Hey, revenge. Mm. Whoop. We, that was, uh... We've seen a lot of good revenge pops today. Mm. Yeah, that was this a one good was one. really I... good as well. Yeah, uh, they... Unfortunately, Kanano was making a heavy feint, but that was still... Yeah, that was great timing. It would have caught the... Uh the light Oosh. if it were speaking of can canadia right now tier one oh it's it doesn't matter their teammates dead already so we're there hey hey all right so what are we looking at on on uh scoreboard what are, what are we on feats definitely in the way of pink underwear revenge gang right now they are definitely up by a little bit actually so, no i mean they're all they're up by like one feet overall yeah the solid lead still in Solidly. Yeah, hard points are really close. Like, I mean, if you look at the scoreboard, we're all over by, what, 30, 40 points? 40 points. I can do math. We don't here to come here to do math. We come here to yell at people hitting each other with medieval weapons. Oh, dang. Yes, yes. So, V-Ray is hanging out, waiting for the opportunity to get uh, get in here. Does peel for teammate? Yeah. Baby gonna eat a bunch of damage? Baby says no. Baby... Baby wants, uh, baby wants bush. Baby it's... wants bush. Baby gets bush. Baby get heavy. Get heavy. Get heavy. Enough time get for not G. one but two people to get out. That might be worth it in the long run if they get something on the. If Canada can survive for long enough. Also, I uh, think there's a shinobi drop. A dream. No. I thought... So as soon as the. A... Oh wait, wait. Uh, can they? Uh... No, they can't capitalize. BB. Takara has tier four already. Oh. Uh, nice. Mm, nope. 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 Twice now, Rizzo's gotten caught from the dodge. Uh, Pink Underwear Revenge Gang still up. That's more. That much more. Re okay. You could get two uses out of this tier four if you needed to. You could pop it right now, like on Can Canadia here. But he's gonna go ahead and heal. Oh yeah. Gonna get the rotation. Yep, I, yep, yep. I see a question in chat here, Goz, uh, from Halo Spartan about like some feats showing up that normally aren't banned. If you want to explain like what's going on with the rules situation today. Uh, tier one? No, no, yeah, it's not the uh, tier one's not banned. So there's multiple things here. So I believe you're specifically asking about tier one from Ocelot. Oz not banned. Uh, it's not banned in all tournaments universally. Uh, it is something that. Uh, 
right now in testing grounds though we are not banning a lot of feats and by we i mean the admins have not banned a lot of feats because we're limited to 10 heroes so we don't have the typical rule set of a lot of uh things being banned out right now so but yeah tier one is not being banned from ocelot the only thing being banned right now is shooting stars because it's bugged yeah the outright bugged is the only actual thing we don't have a lot of room to maneuver for i guess quote unquote luxury oh. bands of things being a little bit too strong Semper, tier though. four doesn't need it tier uh, teammate comes in can't confirm there we are still has tier four's backup now mishima's down by two players we're seeing breaking has happened right now verb and mishima only has v-ray and canada left they've got to break mid there's too many minions though they don't have a flask or anything of that nature right oh. now they opted for the phalanx here which is a really good defensive feat but they don't have anything to really get them out of breaking right now and they're down by two players this is probably not going to go their way this is going to be pink underwear revenge gang is i'm gonna go ahead and call it they're taking this one round one yeah looks like v-ray died to the left there got caught by sicario and baby it's canada versus the world and unfortunately they're gonna get colonialized that's gonna be one nil the mishima zaibatsu liberation liberation i don't know my canada please. history well enough were they liberated at some point no, please, somebody, please, dear gods, get that reference. Liberation. Uh, today's not been a good day for me getting references. Ogre no, battles? Um, I swear to God. What's ogre battles? What? I, I, I'm out as well. I have no idea what he's talking about. Is it about. an anime? I We're am not, not that this. old. Don't do this to me. Chat, help us. Is Norgos having a senile moment? What's going on yeah. here? As a fellow old person, I call him... I, pron I pronounce you older than me. <laughs> I pronounce you old. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I, I, no I, I, I don't know either. What's Ogre it's Battles? Like a, it's, a strategy, it's a strategy game, but it's not... Uh, it's like it, it has... Uh, you, you set up your squads called? and you o send people Ogre over. Battles. You capture other... like You, you capture like uh, new cities and, they, and whenever you capture them, it says Liberation. The March of the Black Queen. Oh. When did that come out? 1993! Like, that is yeah, a few like a years before I was born! I was oh, 10. I, Ogre Battles 2, I think it is? Or was it 64? I don't know the one what I'm thinking it? about. On, on the Super Nintendo? I had that. No, no, it was, was no it the not? one I'm thinking about was like PlayStation or N64. I don't remember which one I had. Was that not released in Europe, maybe? I think it was Ogre's. I think it was actually Ogre Battle '64 is the one I'm thinking about. Maybe that was a remake of the original, Ooh, but still. Okay, yeah, you have one person in chat who supports you here, Gaz. In here, Ivan apparently you. supports you. Let's go. Oh, that one released in '99. Then I was on N64 and the Wii. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so the '64 one that I played. I didn't play the original. I'm, I'm slightly younger than than, yeah, than I originally thought. Then. One. It's, I mean, it was, it was good. It was good. The Ogre Battles Tactics, that was probably the better one, though. All right, speaking of better things, <laughs> better map right now. We have, uh, I almost called it Overwatch. Temple Garden, basically Overwatch is... Uh, Pretty a cousin. Copy cousin, copied cousin, exactly. Yeah, we're on the same page. You're on the same wavelength. Speaking of wavelengths here, though, the pirate is off of the waves. Came off of Skull and Bones, attacking. back into Marauder here to try and fight them off here. Team fight on C-Point, Verb. What do we got going on? Hot balloons getting caught a little bit. Gonna get sunk below sideways if you're not careful. Eats used the hyper arm, but eats a he full top heavy from Canada with no real profit off of that. You've got to get something for the value of spending your health with hyper armor. And so far, balloons is gonna go bankrupt Ooh. if he's not careful. And so is the rest of the pink underwear revenge crew. Yep. This. Yeah. This. It doesn't appear to that the. Oh, wait. Oh. The undergarments are going to be they saved. Want mid. They want mid as well. That's actually huge. This could be a turnaround. This is a massive start right now for... Kazuya Mishima, they lost people in mid, but they're winning on C. Like, this is kind of evened out very quickly. I think we're Sicario. in for a long C fight. You reckon? Oh, yeah. Because yeah. they're about to get a rotation. And the Vengeance was fed. Venga, yeah, and the Shin Bob is back. I mean, they've got full health. They can kind of take the damage. It's it's not a bad play just to get rid of it. But they've got f almost full vengeance. What the hell? Wait, no, no, yeah. that's the that's, that's a bug. Sorry, bug. Sorry, bug. There we go. That's spectator. That's there it is. Half health, half half vengeance. That's still a lot. I was like, I know that they've got a few points. 
I know they've got a few points. I was just like, I don't think that's that much. All right, so they've got A point and C point here for Pink Underwear Revenge. And they got Semper Paratus. They are eyeing right now, trying to figure out what they want to do. Communication is like, I, I'm not really sure what they're doing here. They're not really sure. I don't think, I'm not sure if they're really sure either. Hmm. Are you sure if they're the sure? I'm not sure if anybody's sure. Rapidly. <laughs> the assured levels, are, the assuredness the is dropping rapidly. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Oh, man, that's a triple cap right now for Pink Underwear Revenge Gang. A point is in contention right now. Sicario dangerously close to getting killed. Uh, B Ray on the bit of a back foot now because of stamina, but now it got stamina back. Big top, a big light parry from Sicario. Not going to be able to add pressure here. B Ray making a great read in the blight parry. Just one heavy away from dropping Sicario one zone into a mix up, Ooh. and Booyah not going to need it. Double lights. Timed right. Now, of course, Sicario has tier one. Mm -hmm. So where does Sicario choose to go? Very good question. I think the tier where one is a real disadvantage. You reckon? Yeah. What can he oh, do? Oh, wait. Here? No, no. He's going to be oh, able to really stop the Terry. Stop yeah, the this cap. Let's go. Into a full HP heat. Oh, he has a teammate behind. Oh. All right. All right. All right. Let's see. He still stop the cap either way. I, I, I personally would... Uh, as long as they had the communication going there for sure. I mean, it doesn't, this doesn't look very good for them. They've already lost one gamer, almost two. They're not going to be able to gank very well with the Hito and the Pirate, unless they can actually get the bash going here. Oh. Uh, that's. He didn't expect to hit that. I didn't either. Mm -mm. Surprise. Same fight. Roll away. Pirate is there. Pi Poplings is half HP, so they've got to be real precise with how they press their buttons to actually be worth something here. They get some damage onto Rhythm to make them respect them a bit. Gets a bit more. Bamboozling Rhythm, used, throwing through heavies through the guard. Through lights through the guard. Gets backflipped. Kick. The dodge cancels on oh. dodge cancels. Going crazy. Rhythm almost gets completely tripled. Ooh. He's gone. Great work by Pop Bloons. Frozen ice getting through, stuck through the skull of rhythm, and that is going to be a really solid. Uh... Hey, it's just... <laughs> that man is crazy. Ray I don't is... think they even realized he's here. No, Hello. I'm not. <laughs> Cooey. He's like, what's up? Hello there, fellow kids. <laughs> <laughs> Have you heard about your ABCs? Oh lord! Oh my! Five, that's, it, that's it. This uh, man's uh, this man's is just feeding. This man's is feeding. But they got to know. Don't spawn again here. Yeah, you better <laughs> be moving. Don't do it again. Damn Wait. it, Ray! Where are you going, Ray? What's oh. the choice? I, he's got really it. thinking he's about going the guy back. He's going to leave, right? What are you doing, Ray? He's like, I'm gonna stop the heels on this gamer here. Up, oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, Shinobi knows. Shinobi knows. Trying to stop him, but I'm not against this spawn. That was all right, because he just mm -hmm. can't stay dead for like 30 seconds, 40 seconds. That's just you need to spawn sometime. Wait a minute. Good. Oh boy. Orlando Crusher. I've been thinking about this for the well, last then. several rounds here. If somebody wants to correct me. It is Orlando Crusher. Who is that gamer? Is that, uh, because Semper Fratus is on this team as well. Is that, uh, God, what is his name? They always duo together with them. I am not familiar with either. This is more potential uh, was, here. Uh, something Rising. Tenebrous Rising? Is that Tenebrous Rising? Tenebrous Rising? Oh, that could be. Is I've heard of Tenebrous. Maybe. No, but... that's not the Tenebrous you think of. Oh, okay, no, never mind. Then. I know I know them. Anyway, so here, one on one with A. Oh, oh come on. <laughs> oh, Highway robbery. Highway robbery. You gotta love the walls that in is this game. Jang Jun's mm. biggest enemy is walls. Oh. Phantom <laughs> Parry. Yep. This pillar. Is it this pillar or that pillar? Every single one of these pillars Every freeze. Pillar. The four pillars each have committed a war crime. <laughs> the four pillars. Th these are the four pillars of the House of Gods right here. This is what it is. They all... <laughs> <laughs> Smoke bomb. Uh, can make things a little bit confusing. Ow. Ooh. Hyper armor gober. Nice bush. Shutting down the heavy. Even though they got the tier one, they couldn't utilize it. Oh. That's a triple cap right now for Peak Underwear Revenge Gang. That is a massive renowned advantage as well. This is not looking very... Wait, you have this in the right side, right? We're not... Pink Underwear Revenge uh, is... Uh, I pop balloons and they're in the blue. Yeah. Okay, I've been using, yeah. I pop this, that's, this is... 
this is a drastic difference. So, okay, so Citadel Gate, let's talk about the difference in the maps here. So hmm. Temple Garden is a team fight heavy map uh, with uh, rotate, team fight rotational heavy map. Citadel Gate is the exact opposite of that in terms of where you have mid lane fights, team fights. However, you have the home points that are drastically uh, far away from each other. So rotations are a little bit more difficult. It's more difficult to back cap for the enemy team. So, and it's a little, you put yourself in a disadvantage if you're going into like a 1vx situation or you lose a team fight on the enemy home point. So, we're seeing a difference here where I believe that Pink Underwear Revenge Gang is utilizing this to their advantage. They're doing better with their team fights, they're making good use of the map. And you're gonna, you're seeing something here. right now which you don't have on Citadel, for example, the time where you can't heal. Because usually on Citadel you hold right. your home point, but right now the Mishima team really have the, the issue of I can't go anywhere to. So Ray just engaged here Oop. with like half nice. HP. Yeah. And the XE if he needs it. That was a ball the XE because that was way too long. I I immediately thought like dutiful concision maybe. No. It wasn't a long XE. That was one of the shortest ones, the shortest unique ones, but uh, now the pressure is to keep Simparatus off here. They've got one gamer down here right now. Pink Underwear Revenge Gang uh, in the situation here where they can take this game for themselves. Great read by Orlando Crusher and the the finisher from their teammate. That's two people down right now. Pink Underwear Revenge Gang right now in a very good spot to take this round. Reset the bleeding. Two players right now for their team, though. Orlando Crusher and they just dropped another one. One down, though. One mm. here. They're on C point. May have to do All a right. 1v1. Oh, tier 4 gonna kill his teammate! GG! Team kill! Gunpowder surprise from Bloods! Pops his teammate! Oh, the tragedy! B Ray not gonna be able to do a lot here. This is gonna be a 1 1 pink under revenge gang. Made great usage of the maps and rotations here. Coming out on top of every, of the situations they needed to be. Being where they needed to be. Really good stuff. V-Ray did make some pretty make, make that really good rotation there mid uh, mid match. Unfortunately, it, that those those rotations didn't happen consistently enough for the team overall, and we're seeing the we're seeing the uh, the tie at this point. We're gonna see the reset reset of the hit stun of the match going to game three. A tie and a tiebreaker. Yeah, that feels unproductive. It seems redundant. Mm. I agree. I'm trying to think of other a tie for a English tie, words. so you can have a tie. Too many ties. It's a full. It's a full crevasse. Ooh. I was trying to think of fancy tie tie loops. There's a crevasse that exists. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, um. I used to know some good ties. I don't have any ties to people that know ties, so. Report to play. <clears throat> no, I'm. I have accidentally <laughs> clicked that once or twice on stream, uh, and like Oops. chat's like, yes, report them. Like, no. <laughs> Report them for ganking. Block them. No, I need to spectate them. Mm, mm. You can still block. I mean, you should still spectate block players, can't you? I think. I, I think blocking takes them off the friends list automatically, yeah. right? But you so can too. still. So if you block someone, you can go to the top of the friend list, hit up, and you'll see all of your blocked people in game. Oh. Outside of game, though, they took that away from the friend list outside of game, which is odd. But you can still see it in game. Oh, right. Report Immortal. Yeah. <laughs> Why are we Report reporting Immortal? immortal? <laughs> what, what being Immortal. Do? I mean, obviously. Oh. I mean, you can see every time he dies, like, he just has this tier one feat that allows him to just, like, come back. Like, it's magical. It's ridiculous. Like, True. that should just be banned. He should just be banned for being Immortal. That's exactly it, you know. Oh, yeah. His I, name. It's in the name. I should take away the timer now because the timer is not relevant anymore. Timer not relevant. Very fair. For, fair point. Fair point. It's 20011. Oh, what? I'm in... Again? Did no! I? No! I am an no. idiot. No. Hang on. Pink underwear. No, I think. Hang on. Yeah. I no, but yo, pink underwear was on. Uh, I popped blooms was on the team that won that, right? Mm hmm. Wait a minute. Yeah, I pop. And yeah, I, the, I pop uh, blooms is on pink underwear. Where's the tiebreaker? Yeah, hang Where on. Let me see I... the tiebreaker. What yeah, does the bracket let me, say? Let me, let me put it up. Let me... uh, it is a, bracket. It is okay, a 2 0. Oh, no, I put it the other way. It's 2 0 to Pink Underwear. They won the first game. Did they? Uh, it was we... it was Pink Underwear Revenge won first. Thank you, Choker. Okay, that I, that was on me. It's the first game of the set. I put it the wrong way around. So, yeah. I'm lost. Yeah, but that was on me misc uh, scoring the first game of the set. Thank you, Choker. That was on me. All right.
Now we're moving on to round the final game of the tiebreaker. It is Pink Underwear Revenge versus Kazuya... Oh, sorry, uh, versus WTF am I doing here? Okay, and then we have the grand finals with Goblin Gang. Is that right? Because uh, I can't see it in the brackets. I literally can't... Like, I, I can't see that. I don't know if that's intended or not, but I cannot see those in the brackets. Oh, uh, are you are you off. looking on the stream view? Because uh, Goblin Gang don't need to play a tiebreaker. They're one. They're done. Yeah, uh, we're deciding that the, resolving the tiebreaker here, and it was a three-way tie. Oh, bracket. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not. Oh, there it is. Okay, now I can see there it. Now I can see it. Yeah. So tiebreaker. the final one of the day is going to be WTF. Am I doing here versus Pink Underwear? Okay. No, no, no. Afterwards, the winner plays Goblin Gang. Oh, right. I am throwing. I'm going to shut me. <laughs> Shut up, sweaty. <laughs> Miss input. We are on the way, folks, to a fourth beer situation. <laughs> I'm not even drinking. This and is I'm basically on a fourth losers' beer. finals we're having right now. <laughs> okay. Spaniards Sorry, here to clarify. Like it's usually the format. Hello, Spaniards here. Uh, the tiebreaker, yeah, the tiebreaker bracket of freeze actually pretty much summed it up. Tiebreaker bracket is pretty much the losers' bracket in regular double elimination. There is still going to be after this a grand final between. Goblin Gang and whoever wins the tiebreaker bracket, oh, and then they okay. have the like whoever wins. Let's say what say Pink Underwear Revenge would beat WTF, then they have to beat Goblin Gang twice in order to win the tournament overall. Okay. Yeah, question. Then... Question. So yes. in I know because it's been done this way before on this particular situation. Do we have if uh, whoever goes up against Goblin Gang does Goblin Gang already have a game up on them? And by game up, I mean uh, with a round uh, best of three. Do they already yeah. have like so basically we, one? Previously, game? we did. Uh, previously, we, in the previous tournament we ran like a couple of weeks ago, we did mm -hmm. a best of five where they had one map in hand. Mm -hmm. But this, but that caused some confusion itself. So we're switching up to doing a just like two best of threes. Um, if they they reset it, okay. Okay, so it'll be a neutral neutral set basically it'll be a best of three like the first one if goblin gang win that then they win the tournament and if pink underwear win that then they have to beat goblin gang again so they have to do another best of three if pink underwear gang got does that make any sense because like because yeah. so far only goblin gang have only lost one um well goblin gang haven't lost any matches right whereas the other other teams pink underwear and so on have all lost one game each so okay. they have to do, so if they yes, uh, I'm not explaining it but it's in the rule set it, it, I thought I explained it clearly in the rule set but then clearly my ability to actually no. vocalize no it's not it's not, not on you we're just we're just trying I'm, well. I'm just giving the clarification for those watching mainly uh, me <laughs> because I got it wrong <laughs> <laughs> This is why I, I didn't I, do admin. I, just, yeah, I mean, honestly, yeah. with, the, with the number of teams we've had, I probably should have just run double limit, double e limit. It's just that I haven't had, didn't have time, time to change. Yeah, changing the page last moment week. would cause chaos. Basically, and, for the purposes uh, of my dumbass, yeah. I'm just going to keep spectating <laughs> the, the games you tell me to spectate until you tell me to stop. <laughs> yeah, that sounds good to me. That's what I'm going to do. That sounds good to me. Keep I going. should have made like a diagram, but like I said, I just had no. <laughs> the funny no diagram. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, the Venn diagram of of whatever versus whatever. I remember we did the diagram doing into the fray. That was hilarious. <laughs> that was so good. Yeah. Oh God, that was a good. One, yeah, I should have done that with uh, MS Paint. Yeah. Yeah. To be uh, fair, you're also yeah, I'll, I'll, with half a Give me a second. I'll, I'll do. I'll do. An, I'll do an shitty one. <laughs> you know what? Damn yeah, it! I, I, I wanted. I got. I have paint too. Oh God! Are you competing for like? The affections of the chat. Who has the better shitty I paint? I think I see. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm actually I'm actually bringing up paint right now. Oh um, no! Tournament. <laughs> I okay. Tournament. Oh here it is. What is it? G for grands. Grand tie. Put like a little tie in there. Yeah, yeah. Little little knot. That, that's a knot, right? We'll go with that. Wear pink shirt to support pink underwear and face cam. Yes, I'll, I'll put it in pink, pink shirt. <laughs> no. Pink, and then who who are they going up against now? Like pink versus what? Uh, WTF am I doing here? WTF am I doing here? Okay. I'm just going to make a little. God, why is that? Erase that. No. Oh, oh, it doesn't erase the whole thing. No, this is cozy string cobra. I, I I am full slothing right now in my pajamas. I am not getting the yeah. camera set up. Oh, 
what, 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 who is it again? Pink's going against? Uh, what the w fuck am I doing here? Yeah, okay. correct. D WTF am I doing here? And then the, whoever wins this goes against Goblin. We're still waiting on an eye, actually, from iPop Balloons. Let me triple check to make sure I've got the right target. Yeah. iPop Balloons is on Pink Underwear. Kimu is on there, so they're my targets. Just quadruple checking. Okay, this is... <laughs> this is really bad. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm sure that's pretty shit as well. Oh, no. I'm gonna see some art. <laughs> <laughs> it's so bad. Bruh. Yeah, yeah, okay, that is worse than that is worse than mine. Um yeah, mine is mine is ongoing, but you know, it's still like, you know, not not it's not that bad. This, yeah, this, this is an interpretive explanate exploratory graph. This is it, it explains in its own way. We still don't have an eye, by the way, which is where we're stalling. Remember when we first casted together? Yeah, I remember Cobra. That was that was a fun time. That was that was a jolly fun time. <laughs> well, it's like it's not even necessarily the fact that there is no explanation here it's more the dot is like the doctor's handwriting here goz like that's what i'm looking at <laughs> i my cursor doesn't show up in paint i think it's because it overlaps with parsec so i'm just kind of <laughs> guessing where the cursor is <laughs> i i do enjoy the huh on like the wtf is versus pink Oh, is that what it is? Yeah, that's that's the explainer of that. Yeah. Oh, that was yeah, a donut yeah, with yeah. the hole on the wrong side. And I'm like... <laughs> the, like the, the, the glazed donut was side. earlier. That what it looks like. Jesus. <laughs> glazed donut was yeah, earlier. Yeah, the glazed were earlier. <laughs> All right, well, I've got my... Here's my... Do you want my, my contribution, which is possibly more confusing? Yeah, um, absolutely. No. We don't have an eye yet. There's, that's impossible. That's impossible. They start the match. Uh, Thank you, Sophia Rez. I take that back. <laughs> One, two, three, yeah, four. Yeah, yes. Da, 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 pink shirt. F. We've got like pink shirt. Yeah, it's fed up with you guys. Look at it. We have an eye. I'm yeah, a bad yeah, yeah. We have an eye. <laughs> just bought the right right. enough of you. Uh, <laughs> I'll yeah, be right back in 60 seconds. All right. Take take nonsense back. later. God, that's my I probably should have. Oh, no. We were stalling until we had an eye. <laughs> we had an eye. Thank you, Spaniard. Appreciate oh, you. Yeah. Art competition. Thank you, Sulfuras, for the early warning. We have... have we had a single game without a bot today. Have we had a single game I mean, I bot? understand that we don't, but still. No, not really, right? Sorry, well, what was the question? Not a game without a bot? Bob. Shimbob. Oh, bot or Shimbob. Um, I, I, I think, think so, Yeah, right? there has been a Shimbob present in every game. Yeah. All right, here we go. Let's see, some crazy opening, or just standard, what are you saying? We'll find out. People are really rooting for the underwear gang, huh? Mm. Swap sides, there we are. Oh yeah, pink underwear in the blue. WTF On two team. mid, look at it. Ooh, no, what? Uh, 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 what? Okay, Orlando uh, pieced out last second. Yeah, basically just... Makes sense. I wasn't sure what he was doing yet. <laughs> they were thinking if they wanted to overload mid or not, or maybe even send Orlando up to A. That is potentially an option for an early take. Gives a healing point. But everyone's going for the traditional bar brawl on C. Orlando, half HP already. GB, but the peel from iPop Balloons is enough to keep them safe. Tuba going after their opposing number. Hitakiri on Hitakiri set up. But they got to be careful of the peel from Chiquette instead. So they got to peel off of that initial idea to kill Baby Nater. Oh, sorry, to kill Tuba. Baby Data goes down to Tremor. Tuba with a cheeky little one two GB out of, out of sight. Pop Balloon's trying to do their best, Ooh. but oh no, that was a Venge feed. Yeah. It wasn't even because of the gang changes, that was just plain feeding revenge things. <laughs> ah, ooh, good try, oh. can Look at the ledge. Look at the yeah, they got ledge, but not the way I thought it would go. <laughs> Okay. Revenge tag's off now. Pop balloons can safely attack. The early dodgy. The read. Ow. Oh. 
They've watched Verb too much before. Mm. Because he's he likes zoning. He zones so much. <laughs> Case in point. <laughs> Case in point, yeah. Hello if there, you... Sarah. Have a look at the chat. Thanks everyone, chat, by the way, for watching. This was a little bit more of an experimental format tournament, so it's and it's been good vibes, so it's nice to see people turn out, even if you're just here to look and watch and see what happens. It's been nice I to missed have you from healing. Maybe, oh, hang on, yeah, let's find Verp. Verp, uh, Verp was stopped by Sicario. The dodges, though, look at this! Yeah, there we go, get in, eh? Being able to, no, Bloons oh. is here. <laughs> and you get around one enemy a second, one pops around a corner. What is this, a soul's like? <laughs> Ooh. C point cake and... Did you say boo? As, as if he were a ghost? No. Ooh. <laughs> oh, ooh. <Okay. laughs> no, he's not, they're I not saying boo, for they're some saying boo insane words. insane play with it, but at the end of the day... Generate some more points. Hmm. Exactly. Nothing fancy happening. Yeah. And these later rounds of the tournament. Oh, there we go. Uh, no. Oh, yes. Go on. Speak at a point. Balloons is getting no points for not pairing the unblockable. Was not expecting that to reset hit stun, but this is exactly why this tournament is here because the hit stun reset is a real thing. And again, we see it again right here. Pen does not reset the hit stun. We're going to see that reset. And they're also, again, Gun. not going to get a parry. The gun as well, making that harder. It Ooh. seems the call was... I'm liking the comms from Pink Underwear Revenge. They're keeping a note of where people oh. are and consistently tracking Ooh. them. Kino got yeah, that... so fucked there. And he again. did, the wall. Yeah, the wall saved him. The wall, the wall bounce from the uh, pirate's dodge attack is what saved him 100%. That was a parry. Yeah. Oh, balloons. Chasing their opponent, dodge cancel, cavalier dance into cavalier dance into oh. walk the plank, oh. it's cavalier dance, gets oh. caught by the undodgeable though, you can't dodge cancel blue, unless you're a fear. They, they unlocked and tried to run away at that point, Verb, they got caught by the blue from trying to just disengage and, uh, ow. <laughs> Speaking of disengaging, uh, Verb just got disengaged into Narnia. The hard points are very close here, Burr, but they're starting to move very quickly toward the way of Pink Underwear Revenge because they've got all three. They're stacking C-point, and they've got mid. Uh, Mid's getting cleared right now by... What the F am I doing here? But, uh, yeah, they still have a ton of minions in mid as well. Minion advantage there is going to be good. Multiple parries by Sicario. They're just holding here because they know C-point... Or at least they have confidence that C-point is going to be held, so they're dedicating here instead of necessarily sending someone to rotate to assist, although they may want to do that now. Yeah, I was going to say they need somebody to rotate, and they do. They get the rotation. It's a little late, though. They really needed that a lot sooner, uh, and this would have maybe been a different situation. Unfortunately, <laughs> I believe they tried to parry a, not only a little early, but with the wrong direction. Why oh, wrong direction off. as well. Mm. But yeah, that would have been a good breather for them. Getting the out of stamina knocked down there with it. But yeah. That would have been major for them. They really need this. They can't afford to lose any more team fights right now if they want to keep their lead. They want to keep their advantage. Oh, interesting decision to reset and try and confirm with the lights. Okay. That, that's interesting. 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 Indicator game? Confirming from neutral with lights is unchanged. So that is completely fine. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you guys think, like, opinion here, do you guys think that a lot of players are leaning into just the stuff that they know still works versus necessarily trying to adapt to the things that were changed? Yeah, I think in the beginning rounds they might have tried a little, but right now it actually counts the going back to what they know works. Yeah, There's no uh, experimentation anymore here. Like a point from a Cobra Dominator in chat. No one seems confident with ganks in TG. Yeah, that like we're yeah. seeing ganks have been less confident because people are still trying to figure this out day one. Oh, absolutely. And we saw like in the very first round where they were still trying to do ganks like in the old way, the things that they knew that did work on live or still work on live. And <laughs> Orlando just going to get out of dodge <laughs> for free. Great PO by their teammates. Yeah. Excellent. What we're seeing is they adapted to no gunshot. Mm -hmm. That's what they're doing there. They stopped doing that. They quickly realized, oh, that this is not happening anymore. Oh! Brave. That was a gunpowder surprise that went off out of camera. 
Verb actually, you know, I, that's actually, you know, I know a lot of people will be watching this and think that is an out of stamina parry. Verb could have done something with that. However, I think it takes, shows a lot of discipline from Verb for Verb to not take that parry. Because in that scenario, you are one HP. If for some reason, somehow you miss the timing on that parry, you're dead. Doesn't matter if it's latency driven or or, or if it's something you did wrong. You made a Even bad doing read. It again. Yeah. Uh, spawning at the end. Oh. <laughs> He's done that like four times now over the course of time. At least what we spectated. So yeah. Oh, he has to debuff from killing the other guy. Uh oh. That's and they're gonna really be able to come back. This is gonna be a gank situation soon. They just need one confirm. Reading the bash confirm there. Ooh, well done. Tier four. Ah, there it is. G G G B G G. Oh, he killed his um, mate. Oh. Um, he can't go revive either because the cardio is just gonna. Sp yeah, see. Yeah, there he is. However, reinforcements coming in. Pop balloons and tuba, both of them arriving. We have multiple people underwater sounding because we have multiple ghosts running around. Someone call an exorcist. This, this tree is haunted. Oof! Great use of the type armor from uh, Trimmer. Keep himself safe. Indicator ganks. I do hear the sound of ocelots uh, oh, whacking. That's it. Execution is. That pop is balloons. potentially. If they can cap C, they'll be out of breaking right now. And this looks like. Yep. They get it. WTF is getting out of breaking right No, they're not. Excuse me. They, they now have. It was mid lane. Mid lane was being fought mm -hmm, over. Mm -hmm. Yep. There we go. It's they getting pushed. So there we go. There we go. Now they're getting out of breaking. They need to get that shit together now. Yep, this is they not where it counts. Anything else. Uh, this this, this dies. was an old gun. This would have worked before, but not right now. Attackers captured zone A. Ow. Heavy from neutral. Goes for the GB. It's good. I'd have just let that heavy fly. I see a bear trap there. Actually, that's gonna get I do. funny. Up, oh, nice deflect. Good read. Great stamina. The key I mean, eye. Wasn't he out of stamina already? No, he he, he, he was, was an inch away. He, he had he was an inch away. Yeah, okay, yeah. So sure. not a ton of usage there from that, but also Orlando was already low on HP. So no matter how much stamina they had, it's not a bad play. Kick. He's doing no. something <laughs> to stall here. It's there. If they can get the point back, it'll be good for them. And they stalled long enough to get a teammate. So right there, and the heavy's going to be good here from the bash. That's going to be no exe. I mean, no getting up. They're not getting up here. All right, so Pink Underwear Revenge has one player down. WTF right now. Careful. Or rather, rather, yeah, one, or rather, WTF one player down here. Yeah, this is going to turn into a 2v3. Mm. Got bad surprise. Oh, oh, surprise. Four, just gonna get him. Yeah, tag him. Double breaking. Yeah, right. This breaking is not down. lost. This is not lost. Two players are really low for Pink Underwear Revenge Gang. You've just got to make sure Kino's going to make some great reads here. And unfortunately, mm. he doesn't. I just cast his curse the whole thing. I'm yes, done. you Check did. Out. Tuba has all feats available. Oh, oh whoa. Crash. No. Maybe. I mean, you're not going to get a reset here. So, yeah, it's pretty much <laughs> over. Unless, unless like, we can't see off screen, it is entirely possible that... This could just be spectator Oh, uh, well, no, it doesn't doesn't mean anything. Yeah, yeah, what the fuck is the one who's on the back foot? So even if they lost bit middle mid, it doesn't matter. Yeah, this could be a spectator bug, so I'm going to assume, unless there is a reset by admins, that I'm going to wait for the score to update. And he killed four players with one T4. Hmm. Yes, in the in the testing grounds, that is something that was made to compensate for the gang changes. Tier four from Hidokiri, uh, as well as the uh, uh, Ocelot, now will branch off into four separate players if they're within the vicinity of 0.3 meters close to them. Hmm. Yeah, when <laughs> activated. What is this, fantasy buffs? So, oh, hey, Senzo, how you doing? Host backed out because they lost. Oh, that could be a good shout. Spectator lost track because of that. If the host backs out. Oh, oh you, well, it also could be like somebody disconnected because of a bot. It's not doesn't necessarily mean that the host law, uh, dropped out. Like if that person that we that we spectated into, if that person gets replaced by a bot, that tends to cause that problem as well. 
All right. And like, that, if you have insider information and you're calling it out like that, that's what I'm just like letting. No, you I'm know looking at the... chat. I'm looking at chat. Like, uh, yeah. no, I know, I know. I'm saying that's who I'm referring to. Yeah, if, if they're they're saying suggesting that it's uh, that's what happened. All right, let's chill for a moment then. Let us wait for the words from the admins and to let us know the state of that game, or we'll go from there. We'll hold it on a nil nil for now. Guys, I'm Sicario. He left because they lost no point. In oh. Uh, Vanix is Sicario. Okay, so that means hey it's there. one nil. I got a bit of info of what, what happened then. Uh, nope. Yeah, unsurprisingly, unsurprisingly, it was Kinu rage quitting after oh. losing a match because oh. he's a pussy. Right? <laughs> oh, okay. Honestly, get your shit together. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, man. All right, let me get you a link for the brackets here, uh, God of Salt. We're getting close to the yeah. end of the stream. They are going to their next game um, with uh, Pink Underwear Revenge are a match in hand. And, uh, yeah, they will go to round two. And, of course, if Kinu Rage quits again, he's just going to get banned. Because I am really losing patience today. Um, Understood. So, yeah. Thank you for the heads up, Mr. Spaniard. That is appreciated. Oh, I thought we sorry. We wanted to have some like fun behind the scenes, like the understanding of like uh, uh, Tio's getting mentality, right? Didn't we? Yeah, that's that, no, that that's it? that's fair. No, that's entirely fair. Good one, earlier. All right. Uh, enjoy the next left match. Righto. Yeah. So I, I will address this. It's uh, I, I've seen like two or three times somebody keeps saying that the game it, it's over already it's not over until the score is reported yes i don't mean to be sassy but it still says zero zero so until score is reported nothing's over yeah we only know we don't know about that because we get the tip off it's ideally everyone updates the score every time ideally yeah. all right let's go from the beginning overwatch the second to last set of the day. WTF am I doing here? One nil up over Pink Underwear Revenge. All right, we got a three. Whoa, we got a four and a three one no. split here. Okay, Change there we go. That's... This keeps happening for them. It's like they're, uh -huh. they're not sure what they're supposed to do. Oh, they're sending Tuba mid this time. Ito Kiri versus Ocelot. Ocelot's got really good mix-up pressure once you... Well, both both characters have really good mix-up pressure once yeah. you get started, but I think Ito's got better Ooh. neutral. Yeah, once you get in that mix-up, you got to make a hard read yeah. on what they're going to do next. And they got hyper like Nobody's enjoying with... fighting Hito, right? So oh, no. Sending Hito Nobody. mid E is uh, like a little bit of an extra tilter. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. What is going on at C point? There is so many people low right now over there. Oh, ha oh yeah. Let's actually. Holy take a hell! Woo! Lots of people low. Only one person down though. So many people. Just one mistake from these team, both of these players here on Pink Underwear Revenge Gang. And we got one left. Boom! WTF? Gonna take it? Yes. And they're gonna cap C point oh, as well. Oh, the fucking ladder bot there. Yeah. Is it gonna cost him? Can he not capture? I, I mean, I, is anybody chasing? Um, no, no, it's not because of the ladder. Okay. Yeah. Well, I don't. That, I mean, that, I understand I'm, people like complaining about that because it's been so long where you just go up a ladder, and then all of a sudden their character goes back down again. And in this case, in one extra second, I could have gotten him the point. But yeah, I annoying. I hear you, and I don't. I don't want to like like a debate like this lava. I don't. I don't think that's actually a bug. I what, think what tr triggers that is when you're you press like uh, like especially for controllers. Or for keyboards, if you're pressing sprint, what happens on a ladder? You go down faster. Yeah. So I think when you transition, you're still trying to like, you still have the sprint, you're still pressing it, that that's what's causing the problem. That's my experience. Right? Either way, it needs to be removed, I agree with you. Takara. It is frustrating. Oh, be careful. Yeah, for sure. Takara. It's annoying as hell. Watch it. He's just, he's just getting pecked to death here, lads. He's just getting pecked to death with the lights. Chiquette. Up. Oh, nope. Not going to get dropped. Going to get a rotation here, though. One read away. Ooh, Chiquette. Dodge cancels away. They're going to drop. Chiquette's down. Kino at 1v2 right now. Careful. 1v2. 
You need backup. Good Verb, Verb, Verb's on the way. The triple V. Uh, too late. Unfortunate gaming. Tuba's here as well. They're dedicating a lot of resources to A. Mm-hmm. What is their uh, what is their their renown at this point? Here you go. Yeah, it's a little bit of an elite of WTF. Yeah, uh, advantage to WTF. Um, resources being dedicated by Pink Underwear to A. Is that wise? Potentially, if they can secure it, they could have a place to heal and then push the rest of the map from there. You can, of course, get down to mid quickly by choking on the minions. If they don't get it, though, it's going to be bad. Oh, excellent. Key I uses by Orlando, yeah. squeezing it out just in time to delay just a little bit. They definitely, I mean, they've got, they do own mid, so the play is obviously to, at this point, to, you know, get a side point if you can. However, you're right. If they do lose them, they do lose this. It's gonna hurt them a little bit. Oh, because they've been stalling this because it, they've allowed Orlando to stall for so long. Yeah. What is going on here? Great parry, great read there, getting confirmed by the light. Yeah. Tuba was expecting a, an early like backflip out of the sickle rain. He just kept doing the the, the little strikes, so he bounced Ace. GB, uh, and it was just really unfortunate. He's got, I think a better play would have backflipped. I mean, that's mean of me saying that, right? Uh, but I understand him making that read, so it's really unfortunate. So maybe it was just yeah. seven layers deep in, in his read, but I think he just pressed the sickle rain strikes. <laughs> We're seeing the WTF is up by at least one feet overall over Pink Underwear Revenge game. And I mean, the hard point to tell the same story. They're up by a couple hundred at least, plus the soft point. It is not looking good for them right now. They cannot afford to lose any more team fights here. It's going to lose them so much ground here. You know, sees himself close to getting hit, knocked into into spikes. Not going to risk getting hit by a heavy and knocked in. They're speaking of Bird, 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 going to get it though. That's two players down. Quick succession right now. This is they they and then Tremors right now in the middle of a two v one. One good confirmed. There it is. Yeah, this is looking like an upset, isn't it? I mean, I mm. think it is an upset in my eyes, at least. But yeah, this is looking... Pink Underwear is looking great. So the question is, is this a matter of tilt? Because I think that's what's in the minds of, of chat based yeah. on some of the feedback we got after the last match. Is, is, this the, is, the, is the mental game here what's taking effect and changing the way that... Uh, that they're playing. That is the that is the question. Yeah. By the way, the score is the wrong way around. God, Na is it? Is it one nil pink? Yeah. Thank you. One day I'll actually figure out my how to score teams. Yeah. And then you need to switch names all as well. Oh, God, yeah. damn it! Thank you. One nil pink underwear. I think now we're good, right? Is that right? Is that right? Yes. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, because uh, 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 Kinu left and Kinu's team lost last game, right? Yes. And let me double, I can double check the... Uh, Kino is blue. Yeah. yeah, Kino blue. And A, hey, he's going to be dead. Oh, yeah. uh, he's got to find somewhere to die. Oh, no, 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 get stopped. Nice. Up, oh, but, but, but. He's push. Push. Oh, he did. Mm. Oh, what, what? Oh, no. the reset was so early there. What? He got wow, teleported out. Hell? He died right as they started breaking, so he instantly got teleported back. Interesting, because you have to be at least at 13 seconds on the, or if you're not executed at 10, in order to actually respawn. Hmm. You have to have two seconds transpire between the time of which you died and the time of which you revived in order to actually get a revive at that point. I just realized, by the way, guys, we're, we're almost five and a half hours in. No wonder we're getting slightly loopy. Oh, shit. This has been going on for a while. I mean, for only having, I mean, not only, but I mean, like, we have, you know, for the grand scheme of things, we had, what, nine teams, I think, sign up here today and confirm. Yeah. So we had, yeah, we had, uh, that, that is quite a bit, uh, quite a bit of time, but I mean, it's been really, really good games for sure. So no complaints for me. Kinu, uh, working alongside Chiquettes. Can they get something done here? Large hitboxes being deployed from Jaquette to keep iPop balloons in check. Defenders are now breaking. WTF am I doing here? Are at risk of going out in a 2-0 sweep by Pink Underwear Revenge. 
And the uh, only feedback I have for that gank is uh, they could have used... Oh, never mind. I see what happened. Well, no, yeah, if they'd have popped the Tier 3, it might have been enough to kill that gamer and clear out that plane long enough to... Uh, I guess it doesn't matter at this point. Like, they this have a is actually... Oh, no, 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 look at it! We have a bot! Oh, no! Oh, it's not Kino. Good spot, Sweaty. I did not spot that initially. Hmm. That's... This is really close. And and they just got a triple cap, so it's in their favor that they got a triple cap and the bot's on WTF. So this is a really, really, this is an extremely close game. If they lose it, I, I think it it very well be may be fair game to contest. Yeah, we'll let... see what happens here in the coming moments. Yeah, let's keep it Wow, going they got the stopped time. by the wall. Oh, unfortunately. Oh, saved him. Up, oh, gonna get hyper armor. Chiquette how I would have had the hyper armor to trade, didn't go for it though, clearly. Up. Up. There yeah, it is. There's nice. the hyper armor. Execution. Expected the bot. He's dead point. right now, mate. If they don't keep C point, this is this is bad, bad moment here for WTF. Uh, who you know, just you. died? It's not the Hito, it's not the bot. Yeah, bot's going to mid right now, actually. Gets hit by the nail bomb. And getting hit by the nail bomb. What in the world is it doing? What in <laughs> the world? This is the, I mean. Dude, it's no fluffy. What the? No fluffy. No, it's not. It's definitely not a fluffy too. I have no idea what they're doing. Chiquette is being oh, left all four. on their own. Tier four is there available. Dude, he's boosted. They're going to use it. Now's the time to use it. Now's the time to use it. I'm not going to be able to get it from both players, unfortunately. Needed the hit stun. Uh, took a, I think it took a gunshot instead of tier four earlier. Yeah. That's the would have been the time to use it. Is to use it off of the hit stun. That way you can at least get it on one player. B -b 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 good can. Oh, good swap of the guard. This is there. not over yet. This is not over yet. Knock on wood. Oh, no, this is good. I actually heard the knock on wood. <laughs> Come on, Just need Bobbles. to wait out the tags. Mm -hmm. Be because you can't get away from most a lot either. Oh. This is getting a little oh, bit oh my close. God. No, the tier no! four. Get away. Oh. <laughs> there you. Is he That's, out? They're, gonna, they're out. No, 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 get they're back. They're back. Yeah, they get yeah, somebody else died, but they're down, but they're going to be like, Genobi is critical AF. I mean, the bot is out. Yeah, yeah bot's out. out. <laughs> Two down. One, One each for each team. Tier four by Baby Nader. Let's see what they can get done with the fear itself. That was a shot from downtown. Baby Nader gets the kill with the assist it's, of the gunshot. Let's go. So close. It's, oh no. Oh, Chuckets. That. that Damn. Damn, I, I, I would Feel fully bad. expect uh yeah, I would fully expect a, a, a contestation. Yeah, that's going to at least get a pill. We don't know if there's going to be a restart or not. We'll have to wait for news on that. We'll put the win, like, there wow. for now. That would be a, that's a 2-0 for pink underwear on paper. But we will, actually, can I do question marks? Is that a thing I can actually put in? I can. I can put question marks in, technically. Ah. It looks weird, but you can do it. Huh. Uh, oh, yeah. It really doesn't like the program messing around with that. All right. So, in theory, it's a 2-0. <laughs> However, yeah. we are, I think it's prudent to wait. I would agree with both of you that there is at least going to be a contestation. I mean, being that... I mean, that close? With a bot? Like... That that's an easy contest. I mean, it's up to it, it's it's up to admins on the reset. But it's that I, there's unless they just don't want to replay it. Like that that's that's blatant. Like oh yeah, I'm definitely I, I if I'm on their team, I'm contesting it right now, hundred percent. All right. So unless you guys have anything to say or speculation, I think we should probably chill for a moment until we get word. I have a I, I I do. Yes. So <clears throat> here's what's gonna happen. Okay. So <clears throat> keep in mind that time is linear. Okay. Okay. Uh, and uh, we don't like to mess with time. However, Fluffy Two, I have been told, discovered a black hole the last time that it it, it replaced a player. 
and I have been informed that through the Time Nemesis that it is going to replace the Hitokiri bot and the bracket is going to be updated to where it's a 1-1. One, one. Oh. Time that, travel. Fluffy is really called. almighty, isn't he? Fluffy is, <laughs> is our, yeah, Fluffy is our lord and savior. Fluffy too. <laughs> Fluffy confirmed power creeping the universe of Ferrona Comp. I'm telling you, like it's... Yeah. For everybody in chat not following, like, when was it two hours ago we had a, a, a JJ bot named Fluffy2 replace somebody, yep. and he was absolutely beasting. So yeah, oh, yeah. they won with that bot. So yeah. 100%. Like, no, like, unironically, that bot made the absolute perfect rotations during breaking to save them from being, uh, getting out of breaking. Yeah. To secure not the like W. like this bot just running mid, whiffing. Yep. One attack running into <laughs> nail bombs Whiffing, and a, a trying to attack a minion what? from three year, light years away. That was wild twice. Yeah, that wasn't what you were hoping for. Cobra has bot. asked for artwork. Here is Norgaz's explanation of how uh, the tiebreaker. Oh, works. I got, I got an okay. I got a new one for this for this other bot. You okay, have a new how one? it's gonna come through? The, I'm, I'm working on it. Hang on. I, I'm, oh my. Let, let me cook. Let, okay, man, let him let cook. cook. He has invoked the declaration of <laughs> let me cook. <laughs> we will let him cook. But he, such an amazing art. I know, right? <laughs> Bless my eyes with such beauty. I heard that if you lose a bot in a ranked game, it will give you points when losing a bot with a resulting of victory is something new. Huh? I heard that if you lose two bots in ranked game, will give you points, but losing with a bot resulting in a victory is something new. Please rephrase that sentence, Feel Snickers. What? I don't quite understand. You may need to retype that out. I think he's misunderstanding. They are not winning just because they had a bot. Hmm. Or maybe he meant um, uh, what I referred to before. Might be talking about like ranked games if you get a bot in like 1v1 because it's ranked onesies. Maybe. We're trying to we're trying to decipher the tea leaves here, folks, while we wait. On paper, Pink Underwear Revenge will have 1-2-0. Yes. However, there is the contentious problem of the bot. So, you know what? I'm gonna actually make an executive decision here, chaps. I'm gonna call a quick break. Let give Sounds us a good. bit of a rest. So yeah, be right back. We'll be back when we have a word from the admins. All right, folks, we're back. We have an announcement. 
we have a ruling here for the back ends. The set is going to be declared a 2-0 to Pink Underwear Revenge, which means we are going to the final tiebreak. Goblin Gang versus Pink Underwear Revenge. Let me just update this. There we are. Alrighty, now everything is proper. So, I imagine they might be taking a second to get things set up. Oh, hang on a minute. I see art. You have made art for us. This is this is your explanation, Goz, of Fluffy2 yes. breaking the timeline. Would you care to uh, give us the detail yes. on this? Yes. So, you see, Fluffy2 goes into the donut hole, uh, which is known as mm -hmm. the black hole. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, you come out the other side. He completely uh, assassinates the Hito Hitokiri bot. And then WTF comes out with the win, with the big W. That that is what mm -hmm. we're we're witnessing right here. Now we now we're not witnessing this obviously in real time because time is linear. So what's going to happen is this is all going to take place in a completely broken off, forked off timeline. Uh, ah. This is this is like the next level, like like iteration of our current like like interdimensional warp space. Okay, mm -hmm. uh, I don't mm -hmm. know if you know this or not, but I'm like a warlock. I just uh -oh. kept, I just fire on different terrestrial realms, and that's how that works out. You know what I'm saying? You know, Charlie mm -hmm. Sheen once said that before, and uh, I think that that is uh, exactly what's happening here. The 2000 IQ play is where I can I can feasibly see the different dimensions where Doctor Strange has come out and seen this is the one that if I tell you about it, it doesn't happen. So obviously it didn't happen. Uh, we're back to square one. I wasn't expecting a Charlie Sheen reference in 2024. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I was on your bingo card. I got it. <laughs> That's probably not the best reference we could make, but... Alright, folks. Pink Underwear Revenge lining up against Goblin Gang. We're going to be uh, targeting iPop Bloons and Normie. Uh, we have an eye, but it's fake. We're staring down the barrel of a fourth beer. Oh, my. Yeah. Yeah, you know what? Actually, I am going to call a second break until we get an eye. Like, unironically... Uh, let's save our voices for a little bit. We don't actually have that much to talk this, about anymore. This is my intervention. This is oh. where he takes us offline and he tells me <laughs> that uh, I have a problem. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to actually take us for another <laughs> break, folks. We're going to chill our voices until the final one because we've almost been going. We're going to be going hitting six hours by the end of the stream, guaranteed. But yeah, we're right back. See you then.
But wait is over. We have an actual game. Final game of today. It's going to be the final tiebreaker. Goblin Gang versus Pink Underwear Revenge. There was a substitution required for Immortal Limb, I believe. So Cypher is going from Miss Input is going to be stepping in here as an emergency sub. Here we go. Compositions are looking as expected for the tournament. We have the, it seems traditional here, chaps. Double Ocelot. Ocelot coming up quite a lot. Definitely, definitely is, Verb. And this is the grand finals. And I've been fighting most of my life in a ganker's paradise. This is the tournament that you came for. Let's take a look at the opening splits, Freeze. We have a really weird split, don't we? See, I don't know why. They keep doing it. Maybe it's not yeah. weird for them. Maybe it's just what they're... But they're basically giving up the push immediately. And now he's fighting in enemy minions. I, I don't know why uh -huh. he's doing that, but they... I guess that is worth it for them. And he is... Pulling ahead in the one. No, 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 no. It ain't it ain't over until it's over. And they're like, it ain't over yet. Antonio, you can't count him out. He might be flashing red, but that don't mean he's dead. Boss. Not yet. Antonio. Uh, it, it, this is worth it if Troy gets the light. If. If and when if or when if if it's Antonio. Antonio. Yeah, you, there's the, the light. GG. And the entirety of the team cleaned up as well. Goblin Gang cleaning up on C. The last person standing is Orlando Crusher. And Orlando's going to have to stall. Never mind, commentator's curse. Full and team Cypher wait. was sent to A. He was. Yeah. That's wait a minute. Bad. Wait, aren't we supposed to ban? Ban? Who are we banning? I'll, 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 I'll reference it later. We'll, we'll, we'll get back to that. <laughs> There's some so, looming reference. Seven points on the board right now for Pink Underwear Revenge. Goblin Gang in the Grand Finals having a very strong lead here, uh, both in hard points and renowned. And it may not seem like much, but they all have their Tier 1s, and we've got their uh, whoever's top of the scoreboards moving on to their Tier 2 very quickly. That's Normie and the JJ. So, yeah, Already that's really good for them. One. Yeah, already got a steer one, already popped it. See, that's what you want to use. You don't want to pop it, don't drop it. Don't save it for the next game. Use it as often as you can, because especially with JJ, you got two tier, you got tier one and tier two. Both of them have really quick uh, refreshes, so you can get uh, almost every single team fight can be used uh, with a uh, attack bonus. Babinator did not recognize that there was a revenge tag already on there, and they're going to get punished for it. Is he going to change and help out his teammate? Oh, it doesn't need to. Antonio backs up, and he's going to be able to roll over and get to A. But they gave up C there. They did. Overexcited there, I guess. Or maybe they were just ganked. They didn't properly see. There is a dead person here. They, uh, there was a gank. There is. Okay, so Livin got demolished. Unfortunate. And Antonio still half healthy. This is what we saw earlier with Sicario and Antonio. Exact same scenario we saw earlier today with the opening fight. So can Antonio pull a rabbit out of the hat and make some magic with Sicario? Unfortunately, he can't. He's going to lose that and maybe lose a point. Oh, yeah, they're definitely losing a point. They did not get up the ladder. So that's going to be a completely triple cap now, flipped in the way of Pink Underwear Revenge. But can they hold on to it? Looks like Normie's going to drop any second as well. Oh, the wall. Uh, wall. Ow. Nice knowing you. Two down right now for Goblin Gang. This depth three down for Goblin Gang right now. Pink Underwear Revenge coming down from the effective losers bracket. Down coming back into grand finals. Can I see they are looking right now? pretty good right now. There you go. I interrupted again. Wow. Nice. Look at that. Five and one. It's like magic. Put it in the wood. There it is again. You're seeing JJ popping the tier one. You love to see it. You get more of a bonus the more play, the more enemies that are in that radius as well. So I believe they got two, both the Hito and the Ocelot. It's going to be a little bit more damage that they're going to get from the teammates. And whether or not they stay there or not, that's the bonus of the tier one. It's not an aura. Once you pop it, they've got it for the duration. It's, it's a, uh, I'll say emulsion. No, that's a type of paint. It's a, uh, I'm trying to use the term Pathfinder. Eruption? No. <laughs> 
<laughs> I, I, there's, a, there's a correct term for that exact kind of AoE ability. I'll think of it in a moment. Currently, the term being used against Normie is damage. Oh. Lots of it. You've got to be a little bit careful. There we go. Orlando That's a Crusher normal gank initiation there. Oh, oh. oh unfortunately, the hit's done reset in the middle of the team fight. That would have maybe yeah. been a kill. Yeah, it would have been a kill before. Yeah. On live, that would have killed. That would have been awesome. So, really good game sense there considering the current rules but this is testing grounds that doesn't apply here okay let's get an overview on the map here antonio low but has control wow. a i don't think sakari's yeah. going to get that much health or get that much health back because sakari is going to stop antonio from healing here not even 90 seconds ago Ver, we saw that uh this was a completely opposite story where both where Goblin Gang, where, where Pink Underwear Revenge had both the triple cap over Goblin Gang and the Renown advantage, and now it's completely flipped. There's a little bit of a fight in the mid lane. Let's have a look there. Living on the Shugoki. Going to be uh, helping out Normie. <laughs> Gets Normie in the back. Never mind. You're not helping anymore. Cypher <laughs> keeping Orlando Crusher at least covered for the time being. Juggy Pop, though, that's an issue. Mm hmm. Yeah, you don't want to catch the Goki there. No, you uh, don't. I guess balloons didn't care. Emanation. That was the word. Sorry. Random topic from like tw uh, three minutes ago. It was emanation. That's the word. <laughs> yeah. The the tier one from uh, Jang Jun's an emanation. It just bang and then stops. Mm -hmm. That's all. I just had to get the worm out of my head. Gotcha. I see revenge here. Orlando going to use the infinite stamina to actually back out. What but in no, the he hell? dashes back into Antonio. You see, this is uh, not bug like the ladder. This was just him saying, I, I don't like stairs. Hmm. <laughs> well, yeah, he didn't see... I mean, there was still somebody there at C, I think, or, or popped on to C right as they turned around. So they just did not uh, get locked on to what was Ocelot, I think, to kill them. So. I like my story more. But <laughs> I only like escalators. That's only true. I like That's escalators. True. Well, you just got to make sure you jump over the, the top or the bottom. Bruh. All right, what is the old gonna, what, where's Pop Balloon's gonna go once the rest of the team gets back? Everyone's fighting on mid, but is Pop Balloon's gonna go for a jump or is Pop Balloon's gonna play it safe and contest mid? Or contest uh -oh, C? No, no, he's jump jumping. Attack. He's jumping. Here comes. Anton, oh. so, okay. <laughs> yeah, play it safe. Oh, no, Pop wants it. Although- He's still looking for it, it's too far. If he messes this up, he's down and their team is breaking. Pink Underwear will lose a man. Loons is still uh, believing in the possibility. What? But living is posturing. He yeah. knows it's coming. Let's keep it on the wide shot. Sicario executes Antonio. That will be no assistance, but Sica Baby Data drops to Normie. Nice tracking top heavy. Sicario is marked for death. Pop consistently harassing Living, effectively keeping him out of the fight this whole time. However, if I can actually hit the right button, Living now has Pop Balloons in his grasp. I, I hate to say it this way, but balloons look much like a uh, a bird that we've seen before that likes to run around the map for an extended mm. period of time. But you're right. The way that you put it, uh, it did put some extra pressure on living uh, in order to not actually get into the team fight. Hmm. Be careful of avian-based disasters in on C if you're not careful. This is not a scrim. Ah, that's a shield, gets knocked down. I, I believe you can technically drop attack off that ledge, but it has to be a very specific setup. Mm -hmm. Is it possible on this side? I know it used to be on the other side. I think I'm pretty sure it's on the other side. I don't know about this one. I assume to say that, that they're the same, but... I swear Ooh. I've seen people drop attack on this side. I could That could be old, though. Oh! That's new news from oh, the old, though. Two down for Pink Underwear. Revenge bow. Yikes. Oh, no. Look, look at I carried over the damage reduction. Did, like, three, four damage there. Mm. Let's see. That's going to be about all she wrote there for Pink Underwear Revenge. Goblin Gang is going to take round number one. Grand finals. All right, and chat Best is correcting three. us that you indeed Earth. can drop attack from that side. There you go. Yeah, I, I, it did make it, it makes sense. They both about the same. Ah. Or maybe chat is not sure. Memes is correcting them. Mm. Oh well, oh. you know what? Discord. I don't know. There is Discord in the chat.
Sarah's already busted out the pitchforks. Oh my. You can do it on both. Ah, right. Thank you. Appreciate chat literally doing our job for us. 1-0 to the ah. Goblin Gang. Pleasure to see you all coming out here for the grand finals. I see familiar names and new names in chat, one and all. Punisher, Memes, Cobra, Mona Lisa, Sarah, Bean, Tylenol. Pleasure to see you all. We like names. We like people. We like people. Sarah. Oh, actually, We're just, just doing, doing the two Sarahs. Impersonation there. <laughs> huh? What? What? Who? We're doing sh Jack. Oh. <laughs> Either. Not really sure where we're going. The stream's been going on for six hours. We're slowly going loopy. I'm confused. I don't know what you want me to do. I love it when you moderate tourney. You do not want to see me moderate the tournament, Sarah. I will do production and commentary all day, <laughs> but I will not do moderation. However, I think I know. I get what you mean. And thank you, Sarah. It is appreciated. Yeah, there's two Sarahs in here. Hey, in, in, insert confusion. There are so many Sarahs. All right, calm down, Cobra. <laughs> what? Cobra needs to be bonked immediately. We're just waiting on the eye of Spectator, and then we can get chat to calm down. 1-0 oh. to the Goblin Gang. I don't believe there is a any additional rules. It's not best of five, it's best of three. All right, I asked the same question towards the beginning of the stream, and I'll ask it again now before, like, we ask the question to the players. Your two collective opinion on the TG now that we have had a excerpt of it via this tournament. Hmm. Or do you need time to think? Is this a thinking uh, oh. kind of situation? <laughs> Grunts, I want to see even more. Yeah. Oh, more data required. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that uh, that's a fair yeah. take to objectively it's on paper and what we've seen so far. There's a lot of scenarios where it's good, uh, but there's still a lot of things that haven't. There's just not enough data on or, you know, different resets. And there's also like, you know, Freeze pointed out the various revenge numbers on things that were like, you know, bashes and whatnot or gunshot from pirate and so on and so forth that just there's a lot of variances i think that take place we might we might need either another very another iteration of testing grounds or just there's a lot of things to, to get adjusted so i don't think that they would just adjust everything because they're going to get a lot of different things on feedback i think they're going to do another one yeah and we only have a week and it's only three days in nobody really like put the time in to find anything really really fancy because that might have might be fixed next time. Anyways, mm -hmm. so... Immortal is back! Video. Breaking yeah, news! Yeah, Lemon is back. All right. What nice. well, uh, is that? No, no steal for him. No. Unfortunate. Cypher not able to snatch the steal out from under the claws of victory. Cypher's going back to event, event mode. <laughs> is Cypher just been mainlining the 1v1v1? I mean... I know Havoc's been mainlining it. Well, Cy Cypher's definitely, definitely, you know, been in 1v1v1, at least for, you know, one or two games for sure. Mm. Oh, Double Jeez, kill. Yikes. Head Tonya. And the long execution, too. The Wulin exclusive one. That's going to be even more logistically challenging for Pink Underwear Revenge to navigate through. Sicario's on their own in the middle lane. Only now is Baby and Orlando able to catch up, but might be a little bit too late to at least stop Sicario from taking a hideous wounding, courtesy of the Shugoki, being piloted by Linux. Faint, the faint, the faint. Four faints. No more faints. Sakaro trying to think he wants oh. to get away or not. He's trying to he's trying to buy some stock and faints right now. Living mate no, living not quite gonna be able to get away from this. No, he can't. But not adding tags. Hyperama. Finally getting away. Living Sicario just standing gets, there. Wow. Gets I'm was that a wall plant? Yeah, I, I was I Yeah. Was, how did he get wall splat there? It looks like it was off of the bash somehow. 
Uh, we're gonna need, yeah, we'll need to do a replay on that at some point. This is all somebody things. clip that? Yeah. That but, was interesting. I really wanna clip, watch please. that back. Looks like the majority huh. of PUR have retreated to a point to heal. Baby Nader is ascending to a higher level of consciousness. I'm fairly sure that is against the rules. Uh, P-U-R? I am not going to try and refer to them by rolling my R's. I can't roll my R's. That is a thing I physically can't, can't do, Goz. <laughs> can't blur. No, it doesn't work. No, it does not. Fair. I'll teach you next time we meet. Thank you. Baby. Uh. Careful. <laughs> No, no, not like that. No, stop. No, cease. Down. But uh, don't make me get the bulky stick out for you as well. <laughs> this is my regret. Like six hours of the stream, like, allowing my two friends here to drink. <laughs> Ugh. Zoom. Hug. And the hug. No hug. No. Demon ball. Damage. Yes. Yeah. Take the damage. Yes. Oh. Has that armor been gone for a while now? But that's still oh, super for... armor, isn't it? The demon oh, ball the, no. from the GB? Demon no demon ball. Pretty sure it's been demon gone. Ball been fixed. All right. Demon ball See, lost the demon messing... super armor a while ago. Oh fair, yeah. fair, fair. I wasn't yeah. sure that. There are a few moves that are something grained in the memories of old players. Like yeah. you, one forgets mm -hmm. that it changed. Like uh, I still sometimes think that Warlord or Warden can do the soft thing GB out of bash, even though that's been gone for years and years and years. Yeah, for like seven years. <laughs> mm -hmm. Whoa! <laughs> How did that not land? No idea. Uh, hyper armor. Our super armor. He has no, two, no. two on. No, no, it was Oh, you mean high county ground? Got what... it. I got you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Living has been judiciously enforcing the hug, and that has yeah, been yep. landing with an alarming level of consistency. What's happening? Uh, okay. I, uh, for a moment, I thought they might have been disconnecting. Yeah, it was a, looked like a, a weird loop. That's the punish. Apparently, yep. that's optimal. It is the the I believe the last light. You have to change directions, and you have to hope that they're basically. You have to make sure that that's not in the direction of their guard. Mm -hmm. I well, believe it's in the it. direction of their guard. They can they can block it. I don't think they can parry it. Stuff. Someone can feel free to correct me if I'm wrong. But I, I know you have to change direction. That? Oh shit! They might be losing C here. Oh no, living C. Oh. Never mind. Let's go with pop balloons. Okay, you know, I'm going to the wide cam. I'm trying to track everything at once by jumping around. I'm going to make give people motion sickness. We're going the wide cam. Pop balloons against living. Immortal Loom is a ghost once again. That's why the audio screwed up. Normie just finishes off. Orlando can now come over and assist living. Ooh, nice. There we go. <laughs> Prank. That actually is fun. I like it when Jang Jun has a yuck. When he has a giggle. When he has a laugh. Mm -hmm. he's, he's like the jolly old uncle, but he also knows how to fight like one you. Oh, nice dodge by Baby Nader. Completely avoided the tier 3 uh, from Antonio's. Uh, by the way, is that Baba? Oh, is that Baba? Is that Baba? Oh, uh, you know what? It would make sense if that's. That would, that would Chat, make sense. Verify, more sense. is that Baba? You know what? Let's see. It is. It is. Yeah, oh, thank you, Cobra. Oh, did you look it up? Uh, Cobra's helping us out. They were actually. Um, you you could you could see earlier. I don't know if they're still doing that or not. Though. How many hugs can you get, living? Calm down. Seriously, I should have had a running tally on this. Gunshot though. Ooh, gunshot. Ruins the party. Good night. Ow. Nice little that comeback in the mid. That was wasn't it? Maybe? I looked away. <laughs> That's what we get for having him fieldside report. Antonio gets <laughs> caught. Sicario trying to enforce the pressure. Allies are on the way. Living is almost here. Living just needs to wait for his stamina to come back. And it looks like the call was made by uh -huh. to have Baby block the bridge. Cobra yep. should be mod yep. for answering the question. <laughs> no. Confirmed. Yeah, yeah. There are comms as well. Interesting. Ow. Yeah, that's a baba. Don't even try and get away from a Janhu like that. Janhu was one of the finest roll catches in the game. 
Yeah, I was gonna say well, if there's time to use it, that's the tier. Yeah, this is the time for 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 feet usage for sure. Bunga the bunga. Oh, heavy. that's no. it. And oh. not gonna hit the heavy. Oh, unfortunately, missed Anton a little bit of miscommunication. Yeah, they could have gotten a second knockdown there. I think. Oh, it might have fed revenge as well. So. Um, if they don't, I think if they just not had the third person add damage, I think they could have gotten the other heavy from maybe from Shigoki. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because if you do like heavy headbutt and fully charge uh -huh. top heavy, yeah. that knocks down a second time. It hits in the perfect window. Oof. The bush. Oh, the pillar gonna, is the pillar the gonna screw really good. Yeah. Black, the forward tracking of the roll is exquisite. Like anything forward or backwards, Shinobi is gonna tag you unless you are right out of order. Speaking of out of order. Oh no. We right now are looking at Pink Underwear Revenge is, is breaking. They're down two players. One's Xy not getting up. And we're oh, going to do the cap A though. They're going to get back up. They have another shot at this. All right. How are they they got to hold out. How are they going to choose to rotate? Last second look at the scoreboard. No one's James Bonding. That's good. Everyone can come out of this with their dignity one way or the other. Yeah, they are behind Everyone on full feet. HP as well. And Tom healing. Who's got a heal quick hit? That's menacing. Antonio needs oh, to heal quick. Gunpowder surprise from Pope. Pump, gunpowder surprise from Pop, excuse me. Being oh, launched from on top of A. Normie, check. like, downed really quickly then. Mm. And you check. Can we check Normie's tier four? Can we check. Uh, Normie is Phalanx was Pop. It is down. Okay. I thought I saw it. I thought I saw it grayed out. Yeah, it is down. So they've got that down. That's not going to be available till next team fight, maybe. Maybe. And then. Ooh, living shit that have have lead there. Breaking again, and Orlando's down. Orlando's down on C. Living is down too, so 3v3 here. Normie coming back from spawn. Pop a yep. heal. Normie just got back. Baby's gonna try to retreat. trying to get away. Gonna eat some damage in the process, though. They can actually fight that, yeah. Watch them minions, they will chip you out. Oh. Oh, that's... Lemon, oh, no, get what? away. Uh... No, two down now. That's, yeah, that's two down. That's a GG. Unless they got somebody over there by C who's capping it. Oh, baby. they're at A. Okay, no, never yeah, mind. That's on it. A. That's Ow. it. As the gates slowly close on the turn when it seems, unless there is the mother of all comebacks. That's it. Goblin Gang. Goblin. A succinct 2 0 to round out today's tournament proceedings. Yeah. Such obvious confirms are really strong because you, you just don't expect the Ocelotl to just pop up. Defenders win. But they're Goblin welcome from 2 0. Grand Finals victory. Alright. So, last but not least, as is tradition. The winner's interview. We'll have to see if the players wish to consent to it, but I really hope they do, because I want to mm. hear their opinions on just what it felt like to play, because we, it felt, it did feel different in the minutia to watch, especially once you started to see the evolution of how the pirates were playing, and uh, to an extent how the likes of the, the Jang Juns were playing. They weren't just immediately going in for toe taps. We saw Jormungandr once or twice. Oh, hang on, Spaniard, hello. Oh, no, it's all right. I just came in to say, uh, well done. And there's probably going to be a winner's interview. So um, just expect Normie to arrive shortly. All right. Whee! Jolly good. Thank you kindly. So let's bring us back to the waiting room. While we're giving a little bit of time. That's right. Freeze. Please uh, carry on. Mm -hmm. you, you were, you were talking. Freeze. What do you want to know? You mentioned you were going to have a couple ideas for videos just off of this what's your list looking like so far of things to test one thing ahead. i definitely want to figure out is whether the hit stun reset during knockdowns makes you stand up immediately because i think we had one or two instances where it looked like this would be the case and that would be something completely new the hit stun value carrying over during all the and it causing actually like an instant wake up, it might be confusing to people. So hmm. that one, I definitely want to figure out. 
Indeed. As far as I'm aware, <coughs> sorry, I'm just inhaling myself. Um, apparently, there is some. <coughs> sorry, goodness gracious. No problem. There, there have been some alterations to the knockdown state because apparently before it wasn't um, obeying the hit stun rules as well. So yeah. this is this is apparently apparently there have been some changes in that as well. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. But the weird Normally thing is, is like uh, right now we always had like this stand up animation and everything. It just if it costs an early wake up, you'd still see the animation of them standing up. But yeah, what we had today was let's just instant just oh yeah i'm here the example uh, was uh it was a shinobi on temple garden right just kind of it wasn't up. temple exactly that's the one i remember yes i remember that one it looked very strange so i don't know if that's the same thing or if it's just um yeah literally just stood up yeah. instantaneously it's i think it's time it, it's things like that that will have to may have to be looked at and, and hey. see what is the best option or not Hey, normally, yeah, if you want to get your teammates normally to just jump into dojo chat, nah, then we'll, my we can teammates are minus on this interview. Ah, okay. <laughs> Understood. Well, they are allowed to come in if they want to. <laughs> according yeah, to you, the yes, according to me, they are not. <laughs> oh, okay. Understood. There is okay, an executive okay, order. Well, All they right. have nothing of value to say other than their star currently, so they will stay in the TPC. <laughs> All right. So. Let's keep this relatively simple, as this uh, are going on like uh, six and a half hours. I imagine all of us have various questions, but all of them are going to boil down to the same topic, which is now that you've been through a full TG tournament with like, you know, a full tournament with TG on, opinions, good, bad, trash, excellent. What's your take? Well, good, very good, but with the potential to be like the best right because right now it plays pretty bad uh because obviously we only have like a handful of chars and stuff is still unpolished but this is like probably the first time in a really really long time that they actually put something out that is looking promising <laughs> in terms of like core combat changes it's positive positive outlook on this same thing from your teammates, general vibe? Yes, 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 absolutely. Same, we're on the same page. Uh, we're really happy to see all the history <laughs> reset go. Um, but, I mean, there's still stuff to look at, like like damage reduction and just numbers in general. But this is great, like, it's an amazing base to build on. Yeah, yeah. mostly uh, revenge numbers. Mm -hmm. Revenge numbers like and the damage gunshot reduction. From, from Pirate, there's no reason for, for it to feed this much. There's Something no reason like that, for yeah. that character to be in the game if they don't change <laughs> it. Like, that and Bob, like, we're back to having chars that are mandatory and chars that are uh, not a possible pick. Who are the mandatory ones? Well, obviously we've only had five, well, like a handful of chars to test, but like, Ocelot is probably most likely going to be mandatory pick just because he still has like a 100 to 10% gank. Okay. Any questions from anyone is, else? Um, yes, go on. I had a question particularly about, about Ocelotl. I, as far as I was aware, Ocelotl's gank, his existing gank, requires those like one... It basically works because you hit that 166 MS timing window where you can't dodge the chain bash anyway. And other times it, it causes some weird bouncing. Like you can yes. bounce the... Um, so basically, because it's not it's not being changed because you but it's all you already know the timings for that. Would you think that the characters like Pirate and Shinobi, where you haven't, where because their ganks haven't ever required that specific timing before, do you think that you will find new timings with them that allow them to have similarly strong ganks? Similarly strong, not at all. Like not even close. And Okay. Like, Ocelotl just has the crazy setup because he has like three back to back bashes, which nobody else other than Bob has, and Bob is dead in the water. So, for the average character with like a, with a normal dodge forward bash and normal ganking tools, the best gank you can get for the easiest setup right now will get you like a solid 45 to 50 damage for like full venge, which is really, really bad. 
so yeah. that, that needs to change obviously but um it feels a bit yucky because i don't know it feels very stiff there's no more of that like on the fly ganking it's just a bit different but i think that's just something we have to get used to not really a bad thing but all yeah. right yeah, i think it's I because know. of the having to wait to neutral like during the whole like the the long chains of moves you always have to wait for them to be neutral again to actually get the damage in right and then come out of the situations and hit that small timing 100 or 160 so that's why it probably feels that the the quick ganking is gone just because you have to oh it was the same before with go. the timings it's just that like you could you yourself could be more generous with like your own timing i don't know it's a bit different like you just timings moved some moved a bit earlier some moved a bit later like bash confirming you have to do a bit later yeah. for it to work now but it's more or less the same thing but that thing that slight change in timing will mean that like 75 percent of the good ganks in the game are just dead all right yeah. Any i've seen you try uh sorry. with jj a lot sorry to cut like, in here bash uh, confirming goz do you have a question <laughs> I think we've kind of uh, addressed this to an extent, but I'm still going to ask in case there's anything that may not have been thought of yet. Are there any type of situations or ganks or individual punishes uh, that you felt still didn't quite feel right, either fed too much revenge uh, or they were able to still work uh, despite the changes that you felt may need some adjustments? Well, there's outliers like like Osoto, because he has the the thing I just talked about. He's only going to be the only one who still has this like brokey gank. But otherwise, everything needs to be changed, not just the hit stun. Like, the hit stun needs to be the way it is now. The damage reduction needs to be reduced on the third hit stun, and revenge feed needs to be tweaked to and reduced. Because so you can't you can't deal you... 50 damage with a gank that deals 100 revenge. Oh, you'd link the two now. Yes. So you'd absolutely. also give uh, revenge reduction. I'd I'd uh, I'd argue that the best and simplest thing you could do is just have the revenge number like the amount of revenge you feed be just equal to your damage okay and does that so, fuck with all the yeah. the damage buffs though well that's the point of the damage buffs oh, and okay. the thing is is like because right now if you have 75 percent damage reduction on that stuff you do a normal gank and you land the finisher it deals seven damage right six damage it feeds 30 orange yeah. At least if it it's like 16 or 18, what it would be if the damage reduction was like 40, 45 percent, it would be worth going for it, depending on different situations. Like, oh, this guy's low, this will kill, even though it would feel bench, so I can go for it. It's like I don't know, it makes it more flexible. But this, all of them need to be changed together. But luckily, in my brain, it all feels like number changes from here on out. But I'm no game dev, so I don't know. Okay. So quick. Sorry. Final, so qu clear, final question. Because we do have to cut for time here at some point. It is getting late. Go on. Final question. Go, Goz. Goz. Oh, I was just, I was just going to follow up on on that. And just the, and for clarification, where you're suggesting that the amounts, the numbers are for revenge, is directly related to the amount of damage that you deal, not necessarily the base damage that you deal, but the actual damage that you deal with, without damage reduction, with or without uh, damage buffs. Oh, uh, I thought about. I mean. It's it's a bit stupid when stuff is like I even thought about reducing orange on bashes because 30 is a lot and now you're landing like 20 damage for 60 venge with the bash confirm. Uh but yeah, I, I think they should just be tied to each other and be like the same number, regardless. Okay. Thank you for the clarification. Yeah. Alright. Um Final thing That's certainly one way of taking looking at it. It's yeah. It oh, final thing. <laughs> I guess so. I will add. Uh, I, I definitely could talk about this for a long time. Yeah. Like, um, uh, thank you. Final final thing for me. Yes. Thank you much for playing and for taking part. And if oh yes, that's this is something I do want to mention. Uh, at some point there will be a testing ground feedback survey from Ubisoft will come out. They'll put one out. I don't know if they already have actually. Um, and if they do. When you fling it out, please mention that you took part in this tournament and you've actually tested it in the competitive environment because I'm sure that will help them uh, 
uh, strap, uh, filter some of the feedback at least because I know that the, in if you play in the matchmaking that's very different to playing in a in a tournament where you're actually coordinating with your teammates properly. So yeah, make sure please that uh, if you when you're filling this in uh, the feedback in that you can give you can mention that you've taken part in a tournament like that. All right. Hopefully we have one anyway. Last but not least, since chat is begging for it, normally they want you to say hi. Hello. Hello. There I'm waving. You, you can't hear me wave, but I'm waving. He's waving. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much, everyone. We're going to wrap it up here. Apologies for cutting, but yes, if... I imagine you guys could get a podcast going because this sounds like there's a lot of meat on this proverbial bone, but we are almost come... We are past the six and a half hour mark and I'm bloody hungry. So... Thank you, everyone, for playing. Congratulations to Goblin Gang for the dub. You're free to leave if you want, Normie. Is there any housekeeping Spaniard, Freeze, or Norgos to do? Any shout-outs? Anything we need to say before we go? Go oh, watch memes video. Uh, thank you very much. Oh, yeah, watch memes video. Uh, thank you very much for you three for casting, especially at fairly short notice. Thanks, everybody, for playing, especially at short notice. The Steel Prizes, I haven't got the codes yet, but I will get them next week. So I will be, I'll let the captains know and then I will send out the prizes later on the week. Um, yeah, big thanks. Um, that's it. All right. Thank you all. Thank for... you to everyone. Oh, come. Yeah. I just thank you to everybody for being here. Thank you for the, for the co-commentators. Thank you for Spaniard for having me along. It's always a great time to, to be here and with the talents of Freeze and Verbalocity. And of course, all you out there viewing right now live and watching the VOD, uh, we appreciate you coming out to support live competitive gaming. Keep doing it. Exactly. Okay. Thanks for watching. Thank Later, you everybody. Watching. <laughs> We're ending on that. That's too good. Goodbye. <laughs>